this is our fresh playthrough world. This is day two, and this is our house chat. On the second stream of this playthrough, all I did was build this in creative mode. We are at level 20, as we were when we finished day one. So yeah, this is a lot of pyramids. We're here at the sinkhole in the center of the map. This is where we are. This is the sinkhole, um, which is kind of the center of the map, right? I mean, you know, it isn't really, but to me, it's the center of the, map. Center of this section of the map. Um, it's next to an obelisk, which is very, very handy for navigation, traveling around. Um, and also it's full of these hilly, sandy kind of dunes. It's, it's a great location because there's a lot of like, there's a bunch of stone around here. There's a river just down there so we can get to water. There's a spider world boss in that direction. Uh, there's Darfari camps all around. The summoning place is just over there, which is like a, a, a good Darfari NPC camp to get trolls and things like that. Also, the galleon is in that direction. And yeah, it's pretty, it's reasonably easy to get around. So this is our pyramid. I did think I had this idea of having a coffer in the center um, of the pyramid. And I kind of wanted to keep as much of like, you know, I wanted to see the fact that it's a pyramid as much as possible. So I built this thing in the middle which is where the coffer is, locked away with our little friendo. Um, I placed this treasure, we will replace it. Uh, I just put it there for like, show, right? But we'll replace it with all the actual treasure, which we'll go and gather. We'll get some heroic treasure. We've got these little like, little like mini vault little rooms we could put fancy stuff. We could put heroic treasure just on the floor in front of like in these little spaces, which I thought would be kind of cool. But I wanted it to have a decent size so we could really fill it up. And I, my plan is, and I really recommend you do this on your own games, to have your main base, have a big, beautiful coffer room that you can kind of like decorate and stuff, potentially, and then have another place to have a purge target. Build it small, um, you know, put the people you need around it, but, but have somewhere nice that you can decorate and kind of like enjoy and not worry about purging and stuff like that. So this is like our little coffer room. Now I could fly up, but I'm going to show you the way up. We got these stairs going to the upstairs section, which is the bedroom now i haven't done much in here i am i don't have um i don't have the battle pass unlocked but i would really really like to be able to decorate this um with the stuff in the battle pass because there's a lot of like egyptian-y kind of like fancy stuff in here so i've just plopped down a bunch of these beds which were in the they were, these were in the bazaar this was also the, a lot of this stuff was given to me by funcom so huge disclaimer about that and thank you to them including the pyramid set right there we go. That's our bed. Um, these, I think you're supposed to put a throne like backed up to these so that you kind of like, you look really grand. But I thought they were kind of a cool idea to cover these like windows um, and doors or whatever to kind of make it look a bit fancy. And it kind of fills it a little bit better and it works with the dimensions. So we're going to gradually fill it up and decorate it. I just wanted to kind of do it a little bit just to kind of show you what, you know, what was what. So I guess the first thing we need to do really today, oh, and the rest of it is just empty. So I was thinking we could use just this empty space for, you know, our benches and things. Obviously, the benches are very big. All right. So let's let's start kind of moving into here, shall we? Um, we're going to have a bit of a job because let me get ready for fighting. Um, let me leave creative and leave God and Cloak. Um, and we're going to go bring our stuff legitimately into here. Um, I, I don't remember how we got these Vanguard things, but I guess we got them from an NPC camp or something. How did we get them? I don't remember. Um, we did kill one world boss. We killed um, the Spooder. So we should have a skeleton key. And we could get ourselves... We could get ourselves... Right. We could get ourselves a legendary weapon. But in chapter two, uh, world boss chests have moved into dungeons. So maybe... Maybe we do the dregs today. What do you think? I never usually do um, dungeons like super early. Normally I wait till I'm mostly like level 60. Um, all right there, friendo. I don't think I have any points. Did I? Do I not have any points in anything? Do I need to respec? After building. But I got this hammer from the from the corpse of the, the spider, right? So that's the nice thing about it. Even though they've moved chests into dungeons, you could actually... I could Normally I would be able to go and open a chest and get myself a legendary weapon. But I got this hardened steel hammer... Um, and I could just go and deal with any enemies um, on my way, you know, if that makes sense. Yes, the drugs come and we'll drop. Nobody sounded the alarm. Nobody sounded the alarm about the new drop. 
Well, I did. I tweeted. It's on our community page. It's in my stream title. You mean Funcom? Is that what you mean? Usually, um, usually they don't mention it until later in the day. So I would assume at like five o'clock or something, they will there will be a tweet. But it's usually not before my stream. I usually stream before they, they announce it. I don't know why, but that's you know. We do what we do. Are the chests random or does dungeon level matter? Chests are exactly the same as they were before. It's just their location has moved. I mean, obviously, I think they look different. But no, it is RNG what you get in a chest, as always. Bum, bum, bum. Um. Fry. Thank you for nine. Thank you for ten months. Welcome back. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Right. We need to pick these things up. Um, carpenter's bench, Nemedian artisan bench, campfire. I am going to regret all of this, aren't I? I should have done this in creative. Bum, 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 bum. We do have max... Oh, we don't have beast of burden. I am going to move it legitimately, but I am going to respec. So semi-legitimately, just because it's, yeah, it'll take us all day. There you go. It's a pain in the ass. I also have very little tolerance for being over-encumbered in games. Does anyone else? Like the inability to move at like full speed. And um, especially like Valheim, where you can't even turn your character. Oh my, that drives me crazy. Love the game. Hate that. All right. We do have a set of stairs here, which we'll leave here. Um, and not not stairs, sorry. We have, um, well, we do have stairs and an elevator leading down to there so we can get water and things like that. Um, so let's take our stuff. I don't think I've left anything. Let's head over to the pyramid. I don't know where I'm going to put our map room. I guess we'll kind of put stuff around it. The nice thing is, so now that you have control over the purge, you can build however you want to in your main base and not worry about... Not worry about oh how will how will I cope with a purge for this you know I always used to do solo purges um, I mean I would play on PVE official servers as well uh, so we would help each other okay um, but yeah I would like to I tried to keep my footprint very small so that I wouldn't have to worry about you know managing it all by myself and I would you know have like a bunch of delincias or ber berserkers and things but. You know, you kind of always wanted to, um, you know, keep it manageable, you know. Um... Freezer, I see. What, do you know what? When people check, I'm like, how are you a 10 month sub? And I don't feel like I've ever read that name before. Bless you. <laughs> how do you want me to say that? Do you want me to say Seren? What do you want me to say? Being over encumbered in Ark. Or it's it's T-Rex. Yeah, Raptor found you. Yeah, that's it. So this hammer is doing great for us, even though we've got no points and strength. Um, that is a teeny tiny one. Um, teeny tiny little pyramid. When I was building this, if you didn't see the stream, I don't know if I'm going to put it onto YouTube. It is just building this, um, which is why we're just calling today to day two. Um, Blyke, thank you for seven months. Welcome back. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, hello, Terry. How are you doing? Good to see you. Uh, Stubble. 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 Welcome in. Um, what was I going to say? Yes, we did it as like a super pointy one. If you watched my, um, if you watched my YouTube video or you watched the stream where we did like a purge, uh, build, summon and like harvest, uh, like loot, treasure and things like that. We did a very, very steep pointy um, pyramid at first. And this one was starting like that. And people were like, mm, that's a Nubian one or it's not, it's not a, it's not an Egyptian pyramid. And I wanted this kind of slopey one. So we kind of rebuilt it and we practiced with that one first. So there you go. All right, we got everything inside. How am I going to organize this place now? Um, so are we going to call this like our main, our main front door? I guess it doesn't matter. Um, but maybe this side we could start with. We could start putting stuff in corners. I guess we'll reorganize it as we make bigger benches because they do get pretty big. Um, I can no longer pick up benches anymore. I have to dismantle them, which is somewhat annoying. Um, okay, so we can do, we can replace our blacksmith bench. 
oh, this is going to drive me crazy. So normally I'd like to put the bench in the corner, but we're just going to work with like these braziers for now. There we go. I didn't hear that click down. Um, I don't even know if we had a tanner's table, but we can make it with the mats we've got now. So let's make tanner's table. There we go. Hit the clip. Armourer's bench. Um, we need a furnace. Let's do two furnaces. We can, yes, we can. Okay. Um, what else do we need? Let's do a little carpenter's friendo. I'm just going to put them all together for now because it's just going to be easier not to have to run around. Uh, we did have a an artisan bench as well. Make all the starter benches. Yeah, so the dregs would be kind of nice today. Normally I wouldn't do um, a dungeon this early, but the dregs is definitely easy to do at this level. Uh, we could do the palace of the witch queen, but there's no there's no legendary chests in that um, alchemist bench. We haven't made one of these. Let's plop it down. We've got the mats on us. Let's just make all the things that we've got mats for. Um, we can make a campfire. We didn't learn sorcery yet. I don't know. Yes. Why do I have this if I haven't learned sorcery? Interesting. Hmm. Anyway, um, where should we put the campfire? Hmm. Maybe like on this side, out the way. Whoops. Do, 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 do. There we go. Right, so that's everything we can make. I feel like we've got way more than we had before, but we did have some wood and some stone here. Alrighty. What next? So, okay. So we are currently wearing um, a Tafari skin piece. This is just transmog, right? This is from Fashionist. I just dragged some of my usual things I like to wear um, into here. And so I can just transmog without sorcery. So... Yes, this is what we're really wearing. Darfari uh, chest piece, coarse leggings, and some Darfari skin greaves that we looted. Actually, that, that gives us a bit of a strength buff, so that's probably why we're hitting reasonably hard. Uh, we could use these medium boots, which give us carry capacity. Oh, we did also get these Aquilonian sandals. Chat, where did we get these from? We got them from a box. But did we get them from the boss? I forget. Um, why not... Uh, Freezer is a Danish word for freezer. Ah, I see. So do you want me to call you... What do you want me to call you? Freezer. Okay, Freezer. Okay, Freezer. I'm Freezer. I'll remember that. Uh, hello, Kugurskov. Speaking of names I can never say. Hello, lovely. How are you doing? Hello, did. Good to see you. Why not Yeg uh, Freezer? Okay. Those sorcery items were part of skins. Were they? Is that what it was? Squirrel. Yes. Hello, shoestrings. Hello, hello. Just call me Freezer. Okay. Freezer. Freezer. I'll, re I'll remember... I remember er for short. Oh right, okay. I can come on now, people. Can you not just call yourself like John, Tim, and Frank? Because I struggle. <laughs> just kidding. I <laughs> struggle. Er, how do I remember er from Hugurskov? Like seriously, like seriously. Okay. Anyway, um, right. Let's put stuff away. We need some boxes. Let's make some boxes. Um, how is the game audio and stuff? Is it fine? Can you hear it a bit? It's a bit quiet. There's not much happening at the moment in terms of volume. Um, we have a bed, obviously. We need some storage. So could we do... Did we make that? Those better boxes uh, in the journey? Um, bum, 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 bum. What was it? Was it Homesteader? Is that what we were doing? Feels like a long time ago. Home, 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 home. There it is. Yes, homesteader. All we need to do is make a chair. Let's make a freaking chair, friendos. I think we needed to level up as well. I think that's one of the reasons why we didn't do it. Um, make a chair. So can I learn chairs? Chair journey. Chair maker. Yeah, we needed to be level 17. We leveled up a bunch. All right. Make a chair. Shall I make something from a DLC? Um, something fancy. I could do with something that looks nice in an Egyptian like pyramid, really. Or I could just make anything for the journey and then we can move on with our lives. 
Um, I'm getting distracted. I'm getting distracted. Let me search for chair. These are our choices. Hmm. Maybe this aquilonium one, it looks kind of fancy. Um, or this one. Well, that, that uses... Okay, we need silk, don't we, for those. Let's just do a basic chair. Um, yeah, so the Kitan chair only takes wood. It doesn't take shaped wood. Um, and I didn't want to make that because if you don't have that DLC, then you'd have to make shaped wood. Um, let's make some shaped wood, shall we? Which we did already, okay. Oh, the police are coming, people. Let's make some more shaped wood. I've got a bit here. So today, my plan is to get into the dregs and get ourselves a legendary. That's going to be fun. Okay, that's the wrong bench. They look the same in my defense. Bam, 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 bam. Uh, cheap chair. A wooden chair. Let's just make a simple wooden chair, people. Um, dang Danglish is more fun. Goodness me. Oh, I've got coffee here, chat. I caffeinate myself. Oh my god, that was so noisy. Okay, perfect. We don't have any thralls yet or anything. We've just been, like, soloing stuff. Right, so now we should be able to make boxes with our homesteader thingy. Claim that reward. Right, box friendos. Have I used the wood now? Is that... If I fudged up, okay, let me take that back. Decoration, storage, and then there should be a better box. Reinforced box. Okay, so I need twine. If I don't have twine, we can make some. Has anybody else noticed? I don't know if it's my keyboard or if it's the game, but I have to I have to hold down tab a bit longer for it to register. Is it is it my keyboard or is it is it the updates, people? Because I've never noticed that before. Usually I just like press tab very lightly. Uh, they try the chest and dungeons to bring people back in, but I've overplayed Exile Lands. Yeah, they have made some changes to the dungeons as well. Um, but yeah, I mean, once you've got like thousands of hours in the game, it is okay to be like, do you know what? I want to play something else for a bit. You know, I do that. I like, I take breaks and things. And if you, you know, if you're, if you're done with a game, it's all right to be done with a game. Um, I still love it. I still want to play it. I'm like a diehard fan, unfortunately. A bit more twine. Let's make another box. Bum, bum. Okay, let's just put our mats away. Do, 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 do. So we do have this Hyrcanian bow. I tell you what we should probably do before we do anything else, and that is get ourselves a horse. Uh, because travelling around the map will be a bit of a nightmare. So let's do that. So I'm going to drop that leather apron. I could do with them... Um, well, we have a coffer, so let's put... Let's put any treasures in here. I'm going to... I'm kind of tempted to get rid of anything that... I'm just going to replace stuff. I just want it to look nice. So I'll replace stuff as we make it, right? How's that? Or shall we now delete it? Right, I'm going to creative mode so I don't get the mats back. I'm going to delete the treasure. Horses, absolutely. Yeah, let's delete this so that we actually kind of feel the progression. So there should be no treasure in here now. Um, and we actually, we haven't earned this. We haven't earned this yet. So let me take that. And let's, let's go through the motions. There we go. It did, why did it give me the mats back? Okay, so there's no treasure in here. These are just like pots. Like whatever. Um, okay, leaving creative. Right. So, we need to make ourselves some iron reinforcements. Gonna drop these. So we need to get some iron, and let me dump the, the necklace in here. 
for now. There you go. So we feel the progression. We'll do it like legitimately. I just, um, quite often I like to build something kind of fancy for the playthrough. And I like to do it in creative mode because I'm not going to spend hundreds of thousands of hours like hitting rocks like I have done in the past. Um, we could wear this armor if we wanted to. Um, so it automatically transmogs it for me. Do we have anything for our wrists? We could put these brace braces on. Um, I might dye them black. Or I might use a... What do I? What should I use for a transmog? Some kind of bracelet. Do, do, do. Um, gold. Daketo dancer bracelets we'll wear. Let me dye those black. I can put them here and then I can just have transmog um, without using any sorcery, which is kind of fun. Um, I don't have any helmet. Oh, we've got this. So I can wear that and then I can hide it with fashionist. Otherwise, we look quite terrifying. Um, yeah, so all I need, to, I don't need to transmog that. I just need to hide it. Okay. Um, I could choose to wear these agility weapon damage shoes, um, which we I think we got from a boss. Um, so let's switch out for those because we're doing a, an agility build here. Yeah, even though some of these pieces are like whatever uh, strength. And this is an agility. So let's go. Hmm. Hmm. So the only thing about this is maybe we start with a strength build because we're going to be using this hammer. I think we'll do that because that's what we've got. So let's switch these out. Strength. Strength, that's agility, that's strength, that's strength. So do we have any wrist thingies that are a strength? I don't think so. No. I'm, I'm only using these as a transmog, so. All right, so we'll wear this. We'll spec up for um, strength when we do that. I'll put any armor away and things. Let's put wood in here. Let's chuck stuff in boxes. I do have a bunch of mods on the playthrough. If you want to see the list of mods, this is it. It's Mods Conan, you can see. It's the same as we've got on our server, except we also have um, uh, Pippi on the server. Uh, Shoestrings, thank you for the five tier one gifted subs. Oh my goodness, thank you so much. Uh, Kin, Jelcinta, uh, or Min, ah, Stizzy. Welcome, welcome. Thank you so much for that. That's very nice of you. Uh, gifted subs are 25% off until the 1st of October. So thank you very much for that. It's very nice of you. Thank you, thank you. Um, 9,000 hours in code and I still love it when I'm burnt out. I'm waiting for the dust to settle. New combat changes. Yeah. Well, I meant like, well, 7,000 was my last count, but it, it may have gone up since, well, it's, it will have gone up since then. But yeah, I understand, definitely. And also, you know, there'll be, sometimes there'll be an update and you're like, eh. You know, and then sometimes an update will really excite you. So, did you really, really enjoy sorcery? Did you come back for sorcery? Uh, you just, just not just you having to hold tab longer. I'm having to press escape sometimes to get up and just yeah. I'm glad to hear you say. Well, I'm, I don't know if I'm glad. I'm glad it's not my keyboard. Um, yes. Hello, Zamel. If I didn't say hello to you, hello, hello. Yes. Thank you so much for those gifted subs. That's very nice of you. Um, all right. Let's put any mats away. Let's just get them out of our inventory because we do have um, Unlock Plus, which is like a craft room containers thing, which is incredibly handy. Just dump all this bits and bobs. I hate picking up little bits of things. I just hate it so much. I might keep repair kits on me because they don't weigh very much anymore. Um, I don't like to use repair kits at all after I get to a point where I can really craft stuff and repair stuff myself. What is that? That is agility. Okay, we're going to go with strength. Um, let's get rid of anything we might use. We do have a full car set as well, which I guess we'll kind of use. Which, if you get stuff from boxes, you get them in full durability, which is lovely. We've got, we keep getting arrows from enemies. We've got stone daggers we could do with replacing those now with some iron poniards. Um, yes, let me just dump anything that I don't need in here. Da -da. Do, do. There was a hot fix today. Is anybody was anybody having any issues that have now been fixed, or do you have any like 
particularly pressing issues. How is it work how is it going on console? Is the game running properly? Did you get all your invisible friendos back? I have questions. Bum 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 bum. Do 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 do. Da dun bum bum. Okay. I think we're good. So really what we could do with Jim before we do anything else is getting some iron, isn't it? Um, we're currently spec for Beast of Burden. So maybe while we're, we're still in Beast of Burden, let's go harvest some things. We do have an iron pick. Um, let me think. Do you know, one of the problems I always run into um, when I do these kinds of bases where it's like four, every, every each side is the same. I never know which way's which. <laughs> okay. So where's... There is some iron over there, I remember, because I lived there once. Let's go get some. Let's get let's get some mats while we're, like, beast of burdened up. Because we're at level 20. At level 20, you can max out your expertise. Um, and carry, like, a full load of stuff. There's our little pyramid friendo. So we can really fill our boots. Bizarre got pushed... Our re reset got pushed back a bit, did it? Hello, zombie. I went to I went to go when Kona was updating, and then you were streaming. I see. So the bizarre update got pushed back a bit. What you mean? You you knew when it was supposed to be updated? Have they announced it? Because uh, what seems to have invisible friend is back. Yes, I'm still having issues with starting the game. Saying I'm not live. Um, not connected to live services. Is that what you mean? Here's the iron. Do, do. I'm so glad that the invisible friendos are back though. Um, I would like to test Sitter. So I did mention yesterday on the stream that um, I'm just going to get a bunch of everything really. I did say yesterday on the stream that I had to reinstall Conan. <laughs> uh, I had my, my Steam. So I had a bunch of issues with my PC. Um, and then I, while I was like not streaming, I, I'm not going to say I was on a day off because I was working very hard on YouTube stuff. Um, actually, let me, shall I pin the message? Hold on. Let's pin my most recent video. Um, if you haven't seen it, which is the one I can pin on here. There we go. Manually unpin at the end of stream. Okay to do it here as well um oh i had a bit of a frame drop there um what was i gonna say yes so the sipter world is gone um this is this is obviously on a server fortunately um this time around i'm using a server um but i had to reinstall steam had to reinstall my had to reinstall conan had to reinstall valheim i haven't even tried to play valheim hopefully valheim works um i need to like check into that um so so the sip to playthrough is gone as well um and i know that uh, kevin i know that you said that you, you were, you've been able to um get stuff back by because you like you move you, you know where your saves are and things like that but for me when i when steam disappeared i didn't uninstall it but it seemed to like uninstalled um then the games were still on my pc but i didn't know where they were i actually used an uninstaller to get them off my computer because i could it was um steam was saying to reinstall them and um i know i sound like a completely tech unsavvy person here but that's because i am i suppose um and how do i say Yes, so I had to uninstall them. I could see that I, by the amount of storage space that I had, which was like 150 gigabytes left, I could see that they were still on my computer. Um, so yes, so I uninstalled them to start from scratch. You know. um, the game on PS5 is still crashing. Since today's... Did you get a hotfix today on um, console as well? Bunny, are you sliding around? A game and not an <laughs> yeah. I mean I wish I was I wish I was more tech savvy honestly I mean so this this gaming PC is this the first I guess I have had I've had a laptop before this of like all of my uh, all of my own 
Um, but I guess it's my first PC that I ever kind of got from scratch by myself as a grown-up. And, um, you know, I, I did it... I, if I, if I got it again, I would set it up differently. I'd be like, right, how am I going to store my files? What's my, how am I going to organize things? Let's get rid of OneDrive, shall we? Which drives me absolutely potty. OneDrive, I hate you. I hate you with a burning fire. Um, yes. <laughs> and, and yeah, so I would like to start from scratch, really, at some point. Um, you know, I don't, I probably will never will because I always have, like, saves to move somewhere. But, yeah, I would really love, like... I just need like a PC person to come in to, to sort my computer out really completely. That'd be nice. Um, yes. Uh, where was I going with this? Would you get off my pyramid, you little fluff? So rude. Right, kudo. When kudos attack. There we go. Uh, do I have anything to harvest you with? I guess we'll use a stone cleaver. Um, there was a hotfix, yes, on the Xbox. Okay, so everybody's, is everybody's game working? Any crashes that you were having, have they resolved if you've had a chance to play? What's, like, what's the initial reaction? Do we have any cooked food? Yes. Hello, hello, fight now. PS5 always crashes irregularly. Mm hmm I see, okay. When I when I logged in uh, to Sipta um, on my PS5, I was very surprised that the ground was bald. There was no um, there was no grass, and I don't remember that when I played on PS4 Pro like a couple of years ago. Are the servers up to date again? Hey, do you mean my server? What do you mean? Are the servers up to date? What do you mean? Do, do. Mostly around big buildings for me. Oh, crashes around big buildings. Mm, okay. Mm -hmm. We did it crashes before and after. I see. Okay. And is that on? Is that on PC, Danish Knight, or is that on? Um, is that on console? Right there, sir. Oh my goodness. Okay. He hit me like a freaking truck. Okay, I have no points in uh, vitality at all, or anything else. I'm just like beast of burden right now. Hi, sir. I don't even have passive regeneration. I'm just gonna run away, not towards the hyenas, obviously. Sir, sir. <laughs> um. Okay, there's also hyenas over there. Let's keep away from them. Only crash overpopulated bases on Series X. Too many religion bubbles. So the bubbles are supposed to be going, aren't they? Have they not gotten rid of the bubbles yet? Aren't they? They're getting rid of God bubbles in this. This. Uh, this. What's it called? How are you still following me? That's right. <laughs> oh, it's on console. Okay, right. Okay. Uh, it's been lagging for me playing on a server, especially fighting anything. Mm -hmm. Okay. Alrighty. Yes. So I would like to see if the Sipta crashes have stopped. Um, definitely. Um, maybe what we'll do is we'll just do a... Will we start a fresh playthrough on Sipta? I don't know. Let's get this stuff back. Um, or, I, I don't know. I could put us back to the way we were. Um, kind of, you know, admin us up to the same level we were at. I don't know. Or maybe we'll just do a fresh Sipta playthrough. Um, all we had done, really... We hadn't built a base. I was going to build in the trees. Um... I don't know, friendos. Right, let's cook up some rocks as well. Um, let's keep some stone behind. Dum, dum, dum. Okay, so I hear Kevin saying that Thugra's got some uh, iron. We'll go over there, back over there, now that we've healed up. Put this in here. We probably should rely on our bow a little bit better. Mayhaps. Um. Bum, bum, bum. The nice thing is, though, being able to run away at uh, full speed when you're over encumbered. That's the nice thing about Beast of Burden, isn't it? I know some of you are like proper hoarders and run around with Beast of Burden all the time. And I love it. I love that. I, I can't do it because I, I want to be like, I want to do the most damage possible. If 
he lost me. No, he didn't lose me. We're going to be fighting on a pyramid quite a lot in this playthrough. Okay. I guess we'll harvest his body. Um, has the glitch of Karak been fixed when you go in with a level zero thrall? And they, they come at level 20? No one has, no one has told me about that, will they? Pyramid really sits here. It does, thank you. I think it's lovely. Um, hello, goatee. Hello, hello. What's Anna Briella up to? That sounds like an accusation. Uh, we're on a fresh playthrough. This is day two. We built this. We built this on stream. It's like a, you know, cosy thing to do the other day. Anyone else thinking, thinking about the mummy because of the pyramid? We're going to be, we're going to Egyptianize the fudge out of that thing once I get the uh, battle pass unlocked. I do have, I do have like 20, I did have like 20 XP multipliers. Um, yes. Um, evil dead Paul. Thank you for the follow. Should I call you Paul? Um, right. How are we going to do this tactically, friendos? we got a bunch of bone arrows. We've got some iron head arrows as well. Let's use those first. Let me try and... I don't have any points in, exp in um, agility. But uh, you do get a lot of arrows now as you run around the map. From uh, A lot of enemies will drop them. Gotta get him before he... Why did I pick up a trophy? I don't know. Before he regenerates. Oh, there's the iron. We could get ourselves a thugger, couldn't we? I guess we're going to have a bunch of thuggers on this playthrough. Hello, Kit. How are you doing? Good day to you. Um, comment on your build. Make it go all the way into the ground. Uh, you're talking about put extra slopes. Uh, we could do. They didn't on the dev uh, thingy. I might, eh, maybe, maybe not. I don't know. Thank you for the feedback. Just started to sip to play through. It's new and refreshing because I haven't done much sip to. That's nice. We're going to be giving away some Steam keys during today's stream. And if you guys really want a uh, sip to, a sip to key, I could do it. I've got sip to keys to give away if you want a sip to key. The slopes. Yeah, maybe I will, maybe I won't. I am doing... I exist. Status may change after coffee. I... Do you know what? I don't think I've ever identified with anything more than that kit. Seriously. I have a coffee here, though, fortunately. I was like, shall I just have, like, a little crappy coffee today? And I was like, nope. <laughs> nope. We're probably going to do quite a long stream today, so... I need my caffeine. Hmm. Somebody accrued to me. I hear like that beginnings of danger noise. Do you know what? I haven't lived in this part of the map for such a long time. Um, I remember one of my first server kind of uh, playthroughs, like uh, official server playthroughs, and I was there for like, I must have been on that server maybe for like a year, for like a really long time. It felt like maybe six months, I don't know. But I built there initially on that rock and then somebody came and built here and then just started like encroaching 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 and in the end this was on playstation and in the end uh, we, we ended up having a problem with the aquilonian foundations they weren't like rendering in properly they just were like all fuzzy they didn't look right and i just kind of got my and then it was so laggy it was horrible and i just left this area i was like this person just built out into the like desert in front of summoning place completely ruined my experience <sighs> Yes, so I left there, but I had such a beautiful base. I'll put a picture in the Discord if you want. It was a it was a tower, like an Aquilonian tower. And somebody, my friend said it looked like a princess tower or something. It was very pretty. Um, yes, but um, that is one of the reasons why, one of the only things I really care about on our server is that people do not build next to each other. Because there's one thing that will really sour your experience on a server and make you leave or make you, you know... <laughs> Kind of you know just ruin your day 
and that is that is people just setting up camp right next to you you know hi madam so yeah so it please don't build next to each other on our server if you'd like to join our server it is exclamation mark server conan but just join the discord look at the pinned messages in the conan exiles channel and you'll see the joining instructions all i ask is that you re remain in the discord because i will let you know when i'm doing a restart we're updating something or if there's any issues we can communicate with each other that's all i ask really it's free to join you don't have to be any sub or anything like that if you'd like to sub feel free to obviously you know keep the lights on just spamming the old arrows i have to say it is nice for somebody who will be doing an agility build later um that you get so many arrows now Sit. I'm running out of stamina, so it's like unzooming me. Because I have no points in anything. Got like a little pincushion, buddy. Maybe I'll get a bit lower. Okay, I can fight one of you. Listen, you fudge. Fugger is far away enough that he won't see us. He's over there. Oh, they both have daggers. Bad news. Bad news, bears. Bad news, bears. No, 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 no. Mm -mm -mm. Screw you. I have a dude right next to me on a fish. I'll just use. Just built a huge fu on my base. The thing is, the map is big. People will join a server and they'll be like, "I want to build in X location." And if somebody's already there, they're like, oh, I'll just build here and just wait for them to leave. <laughs> and it's like, I just, yeah, it's awful. Two different people right next to my base and along before them. It's like, all oh, places have to build. Yeah, exactly. Exactly. So somebody commented on, on my recent Purge video as well on YouTube. Um, can I use a different weapon? So I feel like it might help me. Um, they had somebody build and put a coffer right next to their base. And um, and they got their people got killed because of it. Now purges have always been a problem. If somebody sets at their base right next to you and they get a purge, your play your like fighters can end up getting damaged and stuff. Like that. It's always been an issue. That is not new. Um, what did you have on you, sir? It's maybe oh a spell page maybe. Um, can I learn that armor? Scroll note we'll get rid of. Sorcerer's map we've already seen. Spell page notes we don't need to keep. Um, okay, keep all the spell pages. Should we go defeat Thugra? He's going to hit hard. Um, building a cover next to someone is that's just a real dick move. It is a dick move, and um, I feel like you should be able to report that because they have tightened up um, official server rules, haven't they, recently? <laughs> I have. You're a bit, you're a bit shouty for my liking, sir. Right, have we gained anything here. Um, we need, we needed some strength wrists, didn't we? So we use one of these. Eighty-one, eighty-two. There we go. That does concussive damage and follower damage. This one is strength. Okay. See how that was. Get some more iron. Bye, Thugra. Bye, Thugra. Yes, absolutely. Yep. Listen, Thugra, we all know this is going to end. Stop shouting at us. I know. Freaking noisy turd. So I beg your pardon. Shut up. You're supposed to be dead. <laughs> yeah, should have a larger required distance between... Co yeah, definitely. Yeah. Yeah. I think... I think um, anything they can do, though, to tackle people, like... I mean, you, you're not supposed to spam... Like, now, things that they've tightened up on, you're not supposed to spam foundations to do, like, land claiming or like build bridges or things that kind of 
oh, I'm being really helpful, but actually I'm just taking up a load of land claim from other people. They've tightened that up, um, but definitely building right next to somebody um, so that so that their, 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 their experience is messed up. It should be top of the priorities, I think, personally. Because I just, you know, come on now. Let's just all, like, live comfortably together next to each other, you know? Yeah. What is it they say? Be, be friends, not neighbours, you know? Um, -da 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 -da. So, yeah, that is the one thing that if somebody kind of messes with people on our server, I will, I will tell people to relocate or I will remove their bases. You know. So I don't like it. I don't like it. Otherwise, you know, it's just like don't be a dick is basically the rule, you know. Hello, sir. Ooh. Oh yeah. That was quick. <laughs> is he teabagging me? Chat he teabagged me. Chat. Is that our first death? I think it is. We got teabagged. He teabagged us. Did you see that? He was, I mean, I, yeah, he did like a... This is where we're like, just, let me just kind of leave my fantastic palace. Bum, ba -dum, ba -dum. Okay, we have to be sneaky, th sneaky things now. I don't think I have any aloe stashed either. It is a good idea to stash some aloe in a box or some healing thingies. Um, I don't think we have... I could make a wrap. I hate all this like stuff here. Let's make a wrap or three. There we go. It's gonna keep us alive. Um some people's some people's exiles. Be glad you did not have a snake potion that we had when when the game started there. The snake potion? What was that like? Uh? Look at me remembering the right way. I'm gonna need to put like, you know, north, south, east, west on these doors or something. So on the um, on the dev stream, they didn't have the pyramid go all the way down to the bottom. I don't think. I don't know what. I don't know if I'm going to make it go all the way to the bottom. We could do. Um, I don't know. Permadeath. Permadeath. Start over. Yeah, this isn't permadeath. No. Do do do. Do, do. I have said I will do a permadeath uh, playthrough at some point. The problem is this game is unpredictable, you know. Uh, although so is Valheim, and I do permadeath in Valheim, so. Da -da. Right, go get our stuff back and live. These are our only goals. Might grab a bit of this. <clears throat> do, do, do. Do, do. Just attack from the trees, friends. Right, I see, I see my body. Okay, I didn't mean to kick your skull. Sorry. Don't you shoot me. You don't shoot, do we? I have to get my F key ready. Oh, still can thank you for the follow. The nice thing is we're going to have a bunch a bunch of um I'm just going to retreat. I don't have any points in anything. And she's just hit one tapping me. Are you going to climb the pyramid? Nope. Oh, she's going to fight those. It is nice being able to like walk up your house. <laughs> What are those pyramids? It's, it's, it is my base. Yes, it is my base. Yeah. We built it on um, the day after the first day. Um, it, this was given to me by Funko Music. It's in the bazaar at the moment. Um, yeah. We After the first stream, between the first stream and this, I did like a stream where all I did was build this, basically. Yep. Yep, yep, yep. Yeah, it's a new set for chapter two. 
Um, so do we have any bodies we can harvest or loot? Ooh, we can take, oh, I'll take your shoes, lovely. Okay, let's, like, smelt our metal and whatnot. We won't go in there to fight them. We were just harvesting some stuff. There we go. So, yeah, we need to get some proper metal tools. We'll make some iron poniards, full set of iron tools. And we're going to go do the dregs today, which is like a low-level dungeon. Looks nice. Thank you. Thank you very much. What up with the bazaar last night before I went to bed and small right side office had seven hours wake up and the same but three days on them. Ah, I see. Somebody did say that. I see, I see. So I've decided to extend it. Six days. Ah. Some of them say three. Hmm. Yeah. I really want the gibbet in this, but I don't really want anything else. I don't think. I mean, maybe I do. I mean, I wouldn't say no. Um... I don't think these should pull through the dye that you have. You know what I mean? If you've dyed your clothes, I think it should show you what it looks like without the dye. I don't know if that's a bug or if it's intentional. You get the gibbet by itself. Sometimes that's how I got it. Yeah. Patch seems to have messed it up a bit. Oh, I see. Yeah, a couple of people said, I don't know if it was you, zombie. Somebody said that, um, yeah, I really want that. The gibbet may be used to convert foes into thralls. I want that. I, I want to see how it works. Yeah. Yeah, but it's a lot of coins, isn't it, for this set? 2,000 crumb coins. So, yeah. Anyway. Nice for remote... Um, no, remote thralling. Mmm. This is Emitas must have stand so far away, really. So I mean they would be offering new stuff today on those that had the shortest time left. Unless I have to wait three more days. What was meow? Oh, bless you. Doesn't save, doesn't save room. Oh, it doesn't save room in the end. I see. Mm -hmm. Basically, a level one wheel of pain. You can add a taskmaster. Yeah, I don't like when they do that. I, I don't think that. Um, I don't think that anything should give you an advantage at all. And I do generally, generally like feed stuff back about that. So if you do spot something in the game that is giving an advantage, if you buy something, let me know, will you? Because I do like to t like point that out. Sometimes I think they don't realise, you know. So, bum, 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 bum. Okay, do I have my own drop yet? This is what I'm checking. Bum, bum. Maybe. Let me just check if I got my drop. Pay to win. Well, that's it. We want to avoid pay to win at all costs, I think. If I scored the drop. Now eligible. Let me claim the drop. Um, bum, bum, bum. Claim now. Okay. So if I restart my game, I should have it. So let's restart so I can see the drop. Uh, which is what we usually do. Uh, I, have to, I have to close the game entirely, actually, don't I? One sec, people. Bear with. Bum, bum, bum. The only thing about this game at the moment is it takes a very long time to uh, restart, doesn't it? I don't know why that is. It takes a long time to shut down. It never used to do that. Hello, Neff. Drop. Yes, indeedy. I got the drop. Is it going to let me start? You see, it still says stop. It takes ages. Bum, 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 bum. Do, do. Like, this is too long. Do, 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 do. Do, 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 do. Squirrel. Still, still doesn't say, it's still running chat. This is like way too long. Does anyone else notice this? Oh, here, here we go. It's finally popped up. Pressing play. I'll put the Be Right Back screen on because I'm going to be starting into a server, which I don't want you to see necessarily. Not that it matters too much. Um, continue. Oh, I can just press continue. That's fine. 
Should I not redeem the job? If that's what happens when I do. Yeah, redeem it, Blyker. It just it just takes you a moment, that's all. Yep. It just takes a long time to shut the game down. I'm, I'm restarting now. It just it's like 30 seconds or a minute or something ridiculous. It feels like an eternity. <laughs> Quit and restart my game in that time. Yeah. Do 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 do. It's nothing to do with the drop though. It's just the it's just the game. It always takes me that long. It's just a long moment, nothing else to it. Yeah, but it never used to be. It didn't used to be that long, zombie. It's like the most recent couple of patches. Yeah, claim to hope my game does not black screen now. Oh no, the game didn't black screen, Blyker. I, sh I restarted the game. The game didn't black screen. It doesn't, it doesn't black screen. Yep, yep. First, they stole your snacks. Then they stole your coffee. And that was just too much. Isn't that how the beginning goes? I'm suffering of it too. Yeah, I don't know why it does it. Did you have to restart when I claimed it? Did you have to start when it restart when I claimed it? No, if you when you get a drop in um, in a game, certainly Conan, I've got to sh shut the game down and restart the game to for it to appear. So I've just shut the whole game down. Instead of logging out, bum bum, attempting to join. Bum 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 ba dum bum 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 Here we go. Got the drop sweet. Do 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 Ah Thank you, Balkaris. I always go first they took your cookies, then they made they made you take a nap. Ah, bless you. I'm gonna put my admin code in before before we start, just in case I need to use it for anything. Yes, yes, yes. Yes, 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 yes. yes. Um, settings, server settings, make me admin. Just in case I need to like spawn something in to look at it or something. There we go. There we go. And we're back, friendos. Hello, welcome to the stream. Welcome to the 10th world, warrior. I am Hugin. Wrong game, I see. Um, okay, what was I going to do? Let me show... Right, let's have a look at our drop first. Will it show here? We haven't made a clan thingy. Um, will it be in my... This is it. That's it. There you go. Uh, clan emblem wall banner. A hanging banner displaying your clan emblem. I see. So how is it different from this? Shall we find out? Let's learn this. Wait, let's do it in creative mode. Because we're doing this for science. If it's doing it for science, I'm allowed to cheat. Do you understand what I'm saying? Because um, we'll delete it afterwards. But I just want to be able to... Um, let's choose an area. Uh, we could put it upstairs, mayhaps. I just want to see, is it the same thing that we already had? I haven't got any walls. Let's go here. Um, clan. Clan or... Okay, let's create a clan. Okay. So that's it. All right. So that's the drop on the right, and on the left is um, what you get in the game. Let's have a look at the the, 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 the clan thingy. Um, What have I gained? Is it because it's purple? Is that what it is? These are like base, like things that we already have. I 
I guess it's the purple. Is it? Purple instead of black. That's all it is. Yeah. I see. Let me get rid of this because we haven't done it yet properly. Interesting. Well, we'll leave it there so we can show people what exciting things they've gained from what. <laughs> it's just the banner colour. I think so, zombie. Yes. I think so. Size. No, size is the same. It's the same thing. It's just purple. They've all done themselves. <laughs> yes. Well, there you go. Excellent. Well, you know, what are we like Pokemon people, aren't we? Okay, let me leave creative. Let's go back to doing the usual shiznits. Braxis, thank you for the follow. All right. So let's cook up our metal and let's make ourselves some some tools. Okay. Uh, so, I definitely want to make poniards. I need a hatchet. Okay, I need sticks. Let me get rid of these stone tools. Do -do -do. Uh, stick, stick, sticks. Do I not have any sticks? How is that as well? Okay, there we go. It's not possible. I've got a bit of straggly iron there as well trophies i don't care about but i do care about heads um stick stick sticks okay all right so hatchet iron sickle iron skinning knife iron cleaver and then i want to learn how to make iron poniards Iron poniard. There we go. Ooh. It's very dramatic. Um, purple is a good colour. It is a good colour. It is my channel colour as well. Um, it's the best colour, but that's just my opinion. Yeah, yeah. I see the, I see the purple friendos. I see the purple friendos. Does it, does it show me purple in the chat? My name colour. For me, my name colour is purple as well. Uh, does anyone else use the daggers to move whenever it gets... Yes, they, yes I do. Absolutely. It does. Yeah, there you go. Yeah, my channel colour is purple as well. Uh, although, actually, a lot of my branding is now black and white, isn't it? I use purple. Purple and green are my favourite colours. Ah, I do like purple. Yeah. I think red. Maybe... I do like black, but that isn't a colour, obviously. And I like white. <laughs> but, um... I... Yes... Red, I do really like red and blue, I guess. So there you go. Um, like a lot of people, nothing too exciting there. Uh, so we need, we've got iron poniards now, perfect. Um, skinning knife and whatnot. We could do tool upgrade kits on these things. Um, generally, I would say, like, make tool upgrades for every single thing that you make and uh, weapon upgrades and things as well. So we would make a, a uh, what is it called, a tinker's bench for that. Have I unlocked the Tinker's Bench? Um, tinker, 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 tinker. So 26 for weapon upgrades. Fine, that's good because I, don't, I don't, can't really be bothered. And same for these tool upgrades. Okay, so we'll, we'll go without any upgrades as of yet. Perfect. Um, let me repair my pick. And then I want to make some heavy armor, I think. Probably. It's going to increase our survivability. Let's get a bit more iron. And we'll re Wait. <laughs> that won't help me. Hold on. We'll respec as well. Dun, dun, dun. We'll do it properly. Let me repair you. Okay, um, I got a bunch of tools, um, armor's bench, tanner's bench. Sandstorm. So somebody said to me on a comment yesterday on YouTube that they were getting damaged in their base from a sandstorm. Is anyone else experiencing that issue? Is it just on console? I 
against dark purple with cyan. Um, if the purple is also the background of your clan, you'll now get full purple background, not a black border like on the normal one. Mm. Love contrast, orange and black. Mm, nice. Hello, Kai. It's not heraldic though. Color on metal or metal on color, not color on color. Mm. Just did on Xbox a few minutes ago. Mm. How do we read the patch notes? Um, you can look at the tweets. Look, look at the, the Funcom tweets. Yeah, or in our Discord. It's in the Discord. Gonna go to the grocery store. All right, lovely. Be safe and whatnot. I haven't noticed, but I wear the mask all the time, so I wouldn't mask it. Anyway, really, do you? That's interesting. I never make a sandstorm mask until I go to Shattered Springs. Um, generally speaking. Right. Armour. Armour, armour, armour. So you can see it going through the building. Now I'm getting protected here by my pyramid. Oh, it's actually passing us anyway. I don't think we're in the path of the pyramid. Uh, the path of the sandstorm. Have they finally... Hello, Kalendros. We, we, there's no carty. There are no carts in this game. Thank goodness. Or I'll uninstall it. <laughs> um, one thing I noticed is my friend maker now damaged the friend prospect again. Damaged them? What, they came out injured? How do drops work? You need to connect your Twitch to your uh, Conan account. You can do that in-game. Uh, on console or on PC, it'll be on the bottom right hand side of bottom right hand corner of your screen as you like on the game menu um, and then watch the stream for an hour, claim your drop in Twitch, uh, it'll pop up with a little thing when you've got it, it'll show your progress, there's a drop down in the chat and then um, and then you need to just restart your game and then it'll appear in your in your feet <laughs> wow i can speak um there you go it'll appear here it's an emblem uh andy thank you for the prime welcome back thank you for eight months thank you thank you hope you're doing well all right see friendos armor 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 okay so we're gonna make heavy armor and i think we're gonna go with strength armor because we don't have anything good for agility yet um so we might go for my favorite which is pictish warchief um, from the Savage Frontier DLC. This guy here. So we need heavy padding, iron, and leather. Okay, we need to work on our leather game here. Let me strip. Um, strip the hyena fur. I don't have a tanning bench, actually. Just realised. Um... So if I press caps, it should tell me if I have the mats. I don't have the mats. Okay, what do I need? Uh, bark, wood, and stone. I have most of those. Do I need to reset? Um, maybe I do. Unlock plus. Construction hammer. Pull items. Caps lock. Save. Oh my goodness. Respawn. Oh my word. Respawn, thank you for the five tier one gifted subs. That's so nice of you. Uh, Lurik, Aspinall, uh, Warsa Kane, J uh, Joa, hello. Ahmed, welcome, welcome. Thank you so much for that. That's very generous of you. Um, there was a patch this morning on Conan. What is, where's the best place to see the changes? Um, so if you're if you're if you're in our Discord, you'll see it in our Conan Exiles channel. Otherwise, uh, the best place to see it is the tw is Twitter. Their Twitter account usually posts the patch notes. Uh, Conan Ex at Conan Exiles. There you go. <clears throat> or you can follow me on Twitter, Jeremy. 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 Um. Uh, Lord Lord Gizzle. Lord Gizzle. Thank you for the follow. Health went down when I and I hit them. When you hit them. When you hit your f converted followers. What? That's so weird. Oh my goodness. I'm so glad I stream because I, f I wouldn't find out so much about the all this stuff. Good evening, Empress. Good evening, Kalendros. Um, Kyria, welcome back. Oh, Kyria, thank you for nine months. Thank you for kicking off a hype train. Choo choo and whatnot. Thank you, thank you all. 
You can see them in phone comments, Twitch messages. Twitch messages? Twitter? Is that what you're talking about? Welcome back. Do you have an admin for your connect or service? Someone is asking for one in chat just now. Um, you can raise a ticket, uh, raise a support ticket in our Discord, and I will look at it after the stream. There you go. Uh, is it, unless somebody's about to die in real life because of something on the server, in which case it can wait till after the stream. Yep. Um, and I hit a brute that I wanted to. Ins oh, I see. The truncheon is damaging them. I see. Oh, that's what you mean by your friend converter. I thought you meant the actual wheel itself. Mm -hmm. Um. So somebody said that truncheons are now damaging thralls again, which they're not. They weren't supposed to, and was a freaking magical, wonderful thing. Right. Let's go get some wood and some bark, people. Um, got our tools now. We still got our beast of burden, so that's helpful. Um, let's do. Put this in here. I don't need to carry this many arrows around, do I? It's a bit much. Okay. Wait. <laughs> you know. Thank you for the 300 bits. That's very sweet of you. Thank you, thank you. I'm carrying around so much crap here, aren't I? But it doesn't matter what we're over, like what beast of burdened. Thank you very much. Rip, rip, cheer 100. Um, yeah, the, the tensions are not supposed to be damaging them. I, I assume it's a bug. I hope they haven't just reverted that because I thought that was a great change. Um, especially because some of the friendos have absolutely awful health on like, uh, what's it called? New River these days. Ah, uh, thank you for the 100 bits, zombie cat. So I wanted to, wanted to be an admin and tells me she cannot trust me with that much power. Draw unlimited power. <laughs> then I took an arrow to the knee too. Okay, yeah. Um, yeah, just, it can wait till after stream, yes. It, nothing, I, I bet you it isn't, like, urgent, is it? No one's gonna die. It'll be fine. Just raise a ticket and I'll have a look after the stream. There you go. Um, just while we've got it in place... Um, we got fiber bindings from somebody. That's kind of cool. Okay, let's go get some wood. Um, nearest treeage, next to the water, probably. I love living here. I don't know what it is. It makes me happy. I just like this area because there's like an NPC camp there where you can get a bearer from. There's a spooder boss on the other side. We've got loads of NPCs all around us. We're not far from the galleon. We're by the water. I just like it. You know, that's what I told them in game chat. Yeah, that's it. Tell them to raise the support ticket. That's why we have support tickets in the Discord. That's it. Thank you, thank you all. Yeah, Kalendros is like mad with power generally anyway. So, you know, which I kind of uh, amuses me. But, you know, you've got to like, you've got to like, got to manage that. Do you know what I'm saying? <laughs> yeah, let's not give him too much power. Um, points, yes. If you want to buy tickets for a complete edition... Conan Exiles key, which we're going to be giving away today. Uh, do exclamation mark ticket. If you are brand new here and you don't know how many points you've got, and you might not have many points yet, which you get from watching the stream and following and subbing and all the things, um, then uh, you do exclamation mark points to find out how many points you have. <gasps> Please don't kill me. I'm just a nice lady. Please. Please, but we're going to be giving away a complete edition key. If you'd like to win that, exclamation mark ticket. Here you go. Who needs power to be mad? That's it. That's fair. That's a good description of Kalendros, actually. But if you look up, if you're looking up on the internet, it says, who needs power to be mad? Am I right? I'm just like, I am leaving. Because <laughs> it's like, if you're going to be mean to me, I'm going to be 0 0.3. What is 0 0.3? Um, is it okay, if I get... Valkyris, you can enter as many times as you want to, my dear. And subs have two times chance of, of winning because uh, you increase you can increase uh, sub luck. Hit. Oh, you hit the keyboard. Oh, I see. Oh, love. Are you being supervised today? <laughs> she's not. She's kidding. Do not look up. <laughs> yeah, please don't look up Kalendros. That's it. I'll be researching my mods. <laughs> wow, is that texture glitching then? I thought the wall was glitching a bit. Points. Yes, 1860, yes. Thank you for that hype train, people. That was very sweet of you. I mean, I should mark the iron here, shouldn't I? Choo-choo. Thank you, guys. You're so cute. 
one oh the hype the hyper motes i wish they would um add more hyper motes because uh, i have all the hyper motes been streaming for coming up to two years now and i got all the hyper motes and i want more i think you know and lots of people have like all of them at this point probably um <clears throat> and just the name from a dragon that's book series is a blue dragon and later becomes a dragon overlord i see i see it's it's a it's a very spoodery area over here so the nice thing about where we are is we found some snake eggs in this area. So we, I would like to get a snake pet. And um, I think the one of the battle pass uh, rewards is like a reskin of the snake pet as well. Which is new to chapter two. Which is very exciting. Um, and it'd be kind of cool to keep the snake in the, in the like coffer area, wouldn't it? Wouldn't that be kind of sweet? Very stygian. Uh The drop, yeah. There's no exclamation mark drops. It's just drops. Um, but yeah, connect to your Twitch. To your Funcom account. I thought I recognised the name. Mm. Tickets. 1860. Oh, gosh. Yeah, exclamation mark ticket and you get one. So the tickets are, are like 20. What is it? Cost 20 each, is it? It's 20 points, I believe. Um, I can't see here. It'll say, though. So, yeah, you won't be able to get, like, you have to divide it. So, did the patch fix stuff today and what broke because of it? That is a good question, Scumdog. Uh, apparently, it has fixed a bunch of stuff. Um, but, you know... There will always be some kind of issue, won't there? Because it's like a, it's like whack-a-mole being a dev for this game, I think. Poor things. Yep. Eighteen sixty. Yep. There you go. So you should, if the if the tickets are twenty each, then divide it by twenty. Is it is? It's a giant snake in the pass. Uh, well, you can get a you can get a snake without the battle pass, but it's a reskin. It's just a, a recolor. Oh, baby crocodiles. Hi, little friends. Hi. We don't have any points in strength. We do have armor that buffs strength. Um, we are specced currently for this. We could put some points. There you go. A couple of points in strength. Um, but yeah, we're, we're spec for like building right now. Or we were. We just spec for like harvesting things. Um, I'm playing this beta, something's always going to game. Never, never, yeah, I mean, it, I think it's impossible. They're never going to fix every bug. It's just not possible. Not with, not and still like be able to pay the pay the light bills and stuff like that. Do you know what I mean? Um, yeah. Obviously, anything that prevents you from being able to play the game has to be like top priority. But there's always going to be some things that just are a bit buggy. For this kind of game, you know. How many of you are waiting for ASA, Arc Survival Ascended? Are you planning on playing it, or are you like, are you like, I'm not playing that game again because ASC is ending on cert officials, or... But the pyramid collapse now if you accidentally... No, mm -mm. no, no. That is the nice thing about the structural integrity perk, um, is you can just do that. I, I do it now if I'm building anything, just because then if I want to add to it later, there's loads of iron here. Um, then uh, there's no, you know, there's no detriment to it. Oof. This is where my daggers really are, like, king. Let's wait till we stop bleeding. Let's climb something. Let's heal up. Uh, hello. <laughs> it just disappeared. It's like he reset, isn't it? So confused, he doesn't know where I am. Faster than the speeding bullets, sir. I'm 
so quick. He doesn't know where I am. He's, he's broken. He's so confused. He doesn't know what's happening. <laughs> he's doing a little dance. What was that about? Oh, survival ascended. Um... <clears throat> Crafting survival games will always be a little janky. Yes, definitely. Yeah. I'm playing it. Um, Conan is life, yeah. Not giant one, you can only get the giant one in the pass. Want to play, I'm concerned about how much juice it needs in my PC. It's getting, it's getting old, yeah. Arc Survival Ascent. So they updated the Unreal, the Unreal Engine 5 version of Arc, basically. You've heard of Arc, haven't you? Of course you have. Only newer game I've been playing is Texas Chainsaw Massacre, really. I'm um, over, I'm over Snare. Um, 15,000 hours in Arc, and now that, yeah, that's it. As what? <laughs> Real. <laughs> the fact that ASA has little information on videos of it soon release is kind of sketchy. It is kind of sketchy, there's no information, yeah. ASA for me would depend on some of the changes they bring with it, like if they brought primitive plus to the game would be awesome. Mm. Champion, thank you for the hug. That's very sweet of you. Hug back. Bless you. Um, Alright. Right, what did we come here for, friendos? We came for trees, didn't we? We got a bit of iron as well. I'm gonna mark that there's iron here. Oh, this music's so good. And um, well, I am planning on playing Ark Survival Ascended. I have a server courtesy of our friends at Nitrado. If you need your own server or something, there's a link in the chat to my Nitrado thing. Thanks very much. Um, thanks to them for giving us our service. Um, but uh, yeah, we do have a 20 slot server ready to go for when Ark hits the updates. I have no idea when it's gonna happen. So, yes. Oh, get the King of Empty Promises, yeah. It is kind of like a meme, isn't it? <clears throat> Mortal Online 2 is up there as well. And Mortal Online 2? Mortal Kombat? What do you mean? Mortal Online? I don't know what that is. Hello, Van Devious. Yeah, so who knows when that's going to happen, but I do have a server ready for us to play as a community if you feel like joining us. Um, I do I do love Ark. I did cover it quite a lot. There's a lot of it on my YouTube channel. Let me spam all my links for anyone who's new here. If you haven't seen my YouTube channel, um, there's a bunch of like Conan stuff there. There's a bunch of Ark stuff. Ark I am not an expert in. Ark was just like me adventuring and memeing and having a grand old time getting chased by giggers and stuff, um, which was good fun. Dying and whatnot. Um, but yes, so I do love it. Um, once it gets kind of super techy, I'm like, meh. I like it when it's kind of, you know, I like the first day on the beach, just like I love me a Conan fresh playthrough. I do like the beginning of Ark when you're like on the beach with the dodos and you're not really sure what to do. Um, yes. Um, so yes, I am I am planning to play it, but I am I do hate the way it looks. I feel like it's hard to run, like Ark Survival Ascend uh, evolved, hard to run, and it really needed an update. Um, I thought I thought the UI was kind of horrid and stuff. Even like you know, I just felt like it was always waiting to go into like 1.0, you know. Um, so I'm very much excited for a graphical update. Um, so yeah, so I'm very excited about that, and and I would love to. Uh, We'll have a server so that the friendos can join us. Hello, sir. There you go. You wanted to know where I was on that. I haven't really talked about it much, so I just wanted to let you know. We did have a server when I played Fjorda on this channel. Um, Mortal Online 2 single server open world survival MMORPG vampire building. Um, pro oh, promises a lot. I see. So it's kind of similar in that way that it's like over promise, is it? Things of Blush is the best, yeah make a primitive server i could do i mean so i will you know will the server generally speaking like conan i like the server to be um kind of a mirror of my game so like any mods that i have uh, i like to have those mods available for the community as well I'd like a curated list of like minimal mods but quality of life um which is how our conan server is set up um it's exactly the same as this as my game here two times harvesting and the same mods except we also have Pippi on the server because I don't know how anybody would run a server without Pippi honestly yeah um, server uh, primitive was an amazing server mm-hmm I suppose it's the best yeah yeah maybe we maybe we do a primitive plus or something <clears throat> is it still does it still work then primitive plus um 
I just feel so much better with daggers, you know, when we're this early in the game. Not on console. Mm, yeah. So, isn't it supposed to? Arc Survival Ascended is supposed to have mod support, like immediately, isn't it, for console and things? Isn't it supposed to have mods on console, which is kind of exciting? As a former console friend of myself. Do do do. They've probably seen mods on console for years, but I think it's supposed to be there for um for ASA. Isn't that what they've said? Uh, rumoured but not confirmed. Uh, if they ever make a game like Conan and Space Travel, like Conan Sky and the job options. Job options of Final Fantasy XI online, but but it's Star Wars, you'll never see me play another game. I think you need to make that game, Scumdog. I think that's it. You're just going to have to make the game yourself. Should we, like, form some kind of consortium or something and, like, make a, make a game as a community? Dun, 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 dun. So if you haven't, um, if you didn't know, you can learn a dance emote over here. I'm sure a lot of you know about it. But this over here is where the Aquilonian dance is. Which I'll show you. You just have to watch these dudes and then it'll teach you this dance. We already learnt it. No, not the belly dance, you Wally. Uh, yes, so I did learn all the emotes. Yes. FYI. I did the command for learning all the emotes because of thumbnails and stuff. So you'll have to forgive me for that. Just one of them things. Uh, yeah, this is where the dragon er, dragon eggs. This is where the snake eggs are. We got one the other day. So we'll kind of collect those every time we come through here. Um, my brother and myself are recently talking about making a video game. Yeah, you should do it. You should do it. I mean, uh, you know. Those belly lot guys did it, didn't they? I I don't have any like programming skills whatsoever, but I know what I like. <laughs> um, I couldn't say there would be mods in console. The problem is that word is not just yeah. That's fair. That is fair. Mm -hmm. uh, with like like a scroller or like gems game biscuits and basically like, yeah yeah. Hello Pika, thank you for the look. Hello Sam. <laughs> He is not quite wake awake yet. I recognise that feeling. Sir! Sir and madam! What is that AOE? Oh, I'm like... I'm used to... Um, I'm also used to having a lot of agility. And we move so quickly with agility. Okay. You can live today. They're like, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I'm like, I'll let you live. <laughs> Runs away screaming like a child. No Zaf. No Zaf priest? What's wrong, lovely filler? Go oh, Unreal Engine 5, yeah. Don't make it in Unity, right? You've been following that. Don't do not do Unity. That's a bad idea. But I'm very excited to play more games in Unreal Engine 5, definitely. I, uh, as, do you know what? I don't know what it is. Maybe... Maybe someone here relates. So I wear glasses or contact lenses. I'm like relatively blind. You know what I mean? I mean, not blind actually, but like, you know, I couldn't get by without my glasses at all. Uh, all contacts. Um, and I think that's maybe why I'm kind of obsessed with how games look. Because I'm obsessed with constantly trying to sharpen my vision. Does anybody relate to that? No? Is that very niche thought? Um... So yeah, whenever I'm just some people are like, oh, I don't really care about the graphics, and you know, it's more about how I feel and stuff like that. And I'm like, no, no, I want it to be like super, super. I want it to be like very, very vibrant, bright, sharp, and clear. 
you know. And the room. <laughs> Where are you? I can't fight you. Calendras, Marco. <laughs> um, Mila, thank you for the follow. Um, that's what we're talking about. Yes, yeah, and Unreal Engine 5, yeah. And da 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 da. Do do. Oh. You do selectively by no one. I didn't see that email. I love that. Yeah, I am definitely selectively deaf. Um, if uh, if I don't want to answer a question, I will definitely pretend I haven't heard it. <laughs> I have to say, yes. Is that problematic? No. I feel like we all do that. Oh, Mama didn't. I didn't realize you asked me a question. <laughs> give me give me a minute. Let me think about what I'm gonna say. Yeah. Oh, look at our little pyramid friendo. Can I fight you, sir? So what we, what we should do before we go into the dregs, we should get ourselves another skeleton key, at least, shouldn't we? So before we go, when we've respect, so we've got a little bit of like, I mean, we could do it just iron poniards and no, no points and anything. I do like doing that because it's kind of fun just to kind of meme about and modify bosses. I think you're right, by the way. Um, I think we need to. Um, I think we need to rate, make sure that this pyramid goes down to the, the bottom on this side. Should we do that first? Will I get too distracted? Is a question. There's something new in the ice cave. Are you talking about in the the war maker? Hello, where was the wrist? How you doing? Your. What are you saying about your? What do you think? You're just writing your in the, in the chat. No, with the ice giants. Oh, Temple of Frost? Is that what you mean? I've been in there, yeah. Mm -hmm. Um, Since the beta fight now, yeah? Because I was in there in the beta. Got loads of wood. Some stone in there. Hook up the iron. Doing well for iron. I have um, harvesting on two times, uh, so anything I get from these like iron tools will obviously be doubled, which is just how I feel like that's the sweet spot in the game. Let's strip this serpent stuff. Do do dragon. They give the follow. Uh, extra yeti. Mm. Yes, there is. Yes. Mm -hmm. Yes, I do have a video about the legendary chests on my YouTube channel, and that shows the uh, that shows the yeti. Yeah. Getting the build to the ground. You asked for my name. I did. I ask for your name. Did I? Yes. I think we should do that. Maybe we do that like before we do anything else, because it's going to bug me now that I think about it. Let's experiment with that. We're not going to get any points from doing it if we're doing it in creative mode anyway so let's just so I'm going to need more of these Just being perfectionist here. I had an, a lovely time building this on stream, I have to say. I never used to like building on stream, um, particularly. Is that is that um if I do anything too complicated, then I probably will build off stream because it's very hard for me to focus and be creative when I'm like chatting and stuff. But because I knew we were just trying to make a pyramid out of this, um, then it was it was fine, and I had such a nice time doing it. So I was very tired that day as well. I'm never very tired, obviously. I'm like you know, I'm always like full of joy and, and excitement and energy. <clears throat> 
Um, but yeah, I was really, really tired. It was just such a nice time. So did that with Valheim as well at one point, just to, like a super, super late stream. And it was, uh, it was very cozy. Let's just get these, get this all the way down. I quite like that it continues like that. Is it symmetrical? Cozy, yes. Indeed. Yeah. Are you happy? Never tired. Never tired. Yeah, I never. I definitely don't usually start the stream with, I'm so tired today, but I have coffee. It's fine. Definitely. Yep. Rufflecopter. I can't shoot well now because my brain is tired. Was that from Valheim? I don't remember what that was from. Or was it from Ark? I don't remember. It was a long, long time ago, so maybe it was Ark. I don't remember. She's conjuring what? Yes. Burn the witch. That's it. I am. I am the devil. <laughs> Somebody will believe that. You're as happy now. Okay. Listen, it's not my fault you've got a complicated name, all right? <laughs> Assuming you're your Mandan in, um, in our Discord. And um, it's easier for me to keep track of. Ben, ben. You just have to refer to yourself in the third person now. You need to do that. Everybody, if you could just refer to yourself as the way you wish to be described every time. <laughs> Don't say I. No pronouns. Just say I. Don't say I. Say your name. Ben, ben. There we go. Keep keep the console friend keep the friendos happy. I don't know why I said console. Did did these ice cream? There you go. That's it. Get into the spirit. Anna 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 always needs coffee. There you go. People come in, but like, why are these people all referring to themselves in the first person? In the third person. Uh, Web thank you for the follow. Welcome in. I do love building in this game. It is so relaxing. And I love what they've done to the repair hammer, uh, the build hammer, the building kind of system. I do love that you don't have to, um, you don't have to just craft a bunch of stuff now, you know. Right. It is, it does look a lot better, I have to say. I'm going to leave the other one just because I'm, what's the word? A troublemaker. I think it works, right? It looks fine. Way to the bottom. I don't know what I'm going to do with the doors. I'll have a think about it. I might change the front entrances. Um, but there you go. Don't say I don't listen to criticism. I mean, obviously I don't, but you know. All right, let's leave creative. Perfect. Wonderful. And we're back in the room. Excellent. Build is so nice now. You're a pro builder too. <laughs> Excellent. More compliments, definitely. Build is so nice. Yeah. Good, good, good. Yeah, it looks really nice. Um, all righty. <sighs> we needed wood. What did we need wood for, friendos? We, we, we're going to make a bench. Tanner's bench, that's it. Tanner's bench. Tanner, 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 Tanner. Tanning, tanning, tan, tan, tan. Okay, now if I press... Did I get bark? No, I didn't get bark. What a tool... I forgot about bark, chat. Whose responsibility was it to remind me about bark? Uh, stupid brain. Egyptian used lots of columns both inside and outside. Thank you. Hello, Falcon. Yeah, I mean, I, I put them in here. We'll have to kind of... We'll have to... I don't know how we're going to do the inside yet. Um, we can get bark from here. Is that the... <laughs> is that the Anna Forget Stuff sound now, officially? Is that what that stands for? Can I hit these and get bark? No. Just a random thought. No, I can get I can get sticks though. Let's just get some back. <laughs> do we need what do we need? Some kind of I have a reminder for you, Anna Sound Alert. Kevin. What about Kevin? Do we do, 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 do. 
Do -do. Da -da -da. Oh, it looks so much nicer. Well done. Yeah. It does look better. I don't know about the entrance. Yeah, so I don't know. Let's have a think about it at some point what we're going to do for the inside. Because I made that kind of central coffer. There's no snake here. Why did I hear a snake sound? Squirrel. Oh, from downstairs. From in the arena. Does that make sense that I would hear it from the arena? I mean, it shouldn't, should it? All right there, friendo. He's having a little... Oh, he's dead. <laughs> it's like he's just having a think about the world. No, I know you already modified him. Let's get some Ica using our hatchet. Right. Bark. Forgot to tell you about the bark. Oh, Kevin forgot to tell me about the bark. That's it, you see. Definitely. Uh, hello, Millie. Hello, hello. Do do. Do do. Um, um, um. Yeah, we're going to make a Tanner's thing. We're going to make some heavy armor. We're going to go do the Dregs dungeon. That's the plan today. Do get our benches sorted. Hello, friendo. The nice thing about the daggers is you can defeat things without putting any points. Because I usually, like, even at, like, level 60, back in the day, when I was always in a strength build, pre-Age of War, I would, I would carry around daggers and I would use them to fight a lot of stuff. Um, let's go for Ica. I do need some Gossamer, so maybe we'll grab some of that as well, because I do have a sickle somewhere. Yeah, let's get some Gossamer. Do... Um... So I'm not currently over encumbered. Got the first pick in strength. Heavy and special attacks deal 10% more damage. So I could, you, if I could repair these daggers, then I could, uh, I could just fight the Spudo while we're here. Put down a bedroll. Um, follow the sound of the snake the first time I heard it at level 10, regretted it instantly. Was Is it in the sinkhole thriller, in the arena? Because there is a boss down there. Is that why we hear it? I think so, maybe. Because there's one, like, over there. It is. That's one of those things about this game, though. <laughs> Obviously, I have a huge, like, a wonderful attention and everything. Um, so it's definitely not that. But I will notice things I've never noticed before in a playthrough, you know. And also one of the nice things about living in different places each time we do a playthrough. Okay, so we're gonna we're just gonna get a bit of bark. Let's put down a bedroll and let's fight the spooder again. My favourite friendo. Do I have any hide? Of course not. Oh, I do have a bedroll. Fantastic. Well done, me of the past. Um, let's put it here. I could put a box if I wanted to, but I'm not going to because I'm just such a maverick. Um, I might use the bow to defeat the little baby spiders, and then we'll use these daggers. They should be fine. 234 hits on them. We should be okay. So let's try and deal with the little bebbers because they're a pain in the butt. And try not to get diedified. Hey there, friendo. This is my favourite world boss to defeat at any level. Excuse me. Um, because it's quite predictable in its movements. And, um... Wow, I'm excellent with a bow. Just going to deal with these little spiders first, ideally. Actually, I do have, um... Can I... Excuse me, sir. Could you hold on a sec? Sir? You should always ask permission before you do that. Thank you. Let's get some gossamer. Wait, you're still fine. Let's deal with that guy there. So I could use other weapons, but I just really like the maneuverability that I have. When I, um... When I use the daggers... And I do like to show that you can really do it at any level as well. You just kind of put down a bedroll nearby, take your time, don't get too greedy. 
And you can grab yourself some keys for world boss chests in dungeons. What are they doing? Everybody's a bit derpy today. Has anyone else noticed this? This The crocodile was doing that before as well. We'll deal with people around the periphery first. Also some iron over there, which is kind of handy. I rolled. You are a cheater. You're calling hacks. I don't have gossamer to throw at people. What a turd wallet. Uh, went through the sinkhole. Oh, I see. Yeah. Did you drop into the sinkhole thriller? Somebody did suggest to me that we should have a channel point redeem um, for me to like go down into the sinkhole like from the top. Which I have done and I feel like is a rite of passage. Everyone needs to do it at some point. I did say to my friend when I played uh, Conan, like when they were new to the game, I was like, oh, everybody has to go down into the sinkhole from the top, you know, without an elevator. It's like a rite of passage. <laughs> I didn't manage and they died a lot. It was funny. Yeah. Climb down, did you? Yeah, it is kind of fun. So your Valheim vid this morning, you being happy about your about your bow skills. Which uh, which which video um is it the day one? The new day one, Hilda's request. Um then I was on on the run of my life, yeah. Okay, now we've dealt with everybody else. Definitely deal with the bebers first. Because this guy is predictable. Stay away from his face. Fly bleed two of them. And then just just avoid this when he stumps down. Just want to apply the bleed. Keep it going. Don't get too greedy. Couple of slashes. Move out. Stay away from the face. Regulars have seen me do this millions of times. You can fight the crocs as well, but it's very easy to get stuck in the face of the crocs. Um, so I, I try not to fight the crocs, really. So 20 sucker bead is maximum. We're going to try and keep that up as much as possible. But we're going to focus on avoiding the face. And I have no points in agility, no points in stamina. I'm maxed out in um, expertise. I have no vitality points at all. I have points in strength. The bleed will go very quickly. Move your way out when he does this. Try and keep that bleed up. Um, I don't, I'm not seeing float damage numbers. I've just realised uh, I need to s just make some tweaks to house elves, just because this is uh, everything's kind of reset for me. I should be seeing float damage numbers and uh, XP. I don't really need to slash very frequently. I just need to do it enough to try and keep that bleed up. It started a new stack. It's the only thing, we tend to lose it after he does that big slammy jump. Which is a technical term for it, you might not have known. <laughs> oh chat. I did have somebody say to me in a YouTube comment that um, they weren't getting keys when they harvested bosses. I've definitely had a bug like that in the past, um, but do let me know if you have like that happens to you. But you're supposed to harvest the body. They, they do also have an inventory now as well, so you might kind of be mistaken and, and forget to harvest them perhaps, or... I don't know, um, but I do, you know, if somebody says they harvested a body, then I assume you did. 
Come on, sleepy times, little friend. We'll get some gossamer from this guy. It's a good source of demon blood as well, this spider. There you go. What do we get? Ooh. We got some composite obsidian, five steel reinforcements, nice, and a hardened steel short sword. We've got an agility weapon. <gasps> oh. Chat. That is exciting. 47 damage, 16 armor event. I mean, that's not a bad freaking. And look how much durability. Oh, I like it. Uh, okay, Anna, you are amazing. Don't read to go over when we've only have fun. All right, lovely. Have, to, have fun. Um, he used to get skis from these spiders all the time. Yeah, hello, Psycho, hello. Can I ask you a quick Valheim question? Of course you can. Are the raids triggered by killing the boss, hanging the head, or accepting the power? Killing the boss. Mm -hmm. Killing the boss is the thing that triggers the next level of... Um... Right, we're going to harvest this guy with the uh, iron thingy. Yeah. If you have problems harvesting something, just do a roll and it seems to work. I don't know why. So, uh, something to do with instancing or so. I don't know what it is. I don't know. So I can also get Gossamer from here as well. An excellent place for Gossamer. We're also very close to Sinner's Refuge. I'm like super happy with where we are. It's a good base location. Especially because we built in creative mode. Obviously there's not a huge amount of trees around there's a good amount of iron a good amount of uh, uh, rocks and stuff um you might want to teleport make a map room before you make a huge base um but yeah you can you can because we're right by an obelisk you can you can just get resources from everywhere else it's great basic super cool already thank you um hello all um, uh culmination of millions of uh, years of actions Fate, the culmination of millions of years of actions outside your influence. Yes. Did I miss something? Um, they put the spikes back in the black keep. Yeah, spikes in the black keep. There are, definitely. <clears throat> First time here watching videos a few weeks now. Good to watch it. Oh, good to have you here. Welcome in. Welcome, welcome. Slimy jump. Yes, the slimy jump. Scared to even touch the obelisk. I should have nothing to worry about. You were scared to touch the obelisk. Um... Day one. <clears throat> Tends to get laggy because lots of people like to build there for some reason. Uh, whereabouts is that? Climb down there. It's never. It is nerve wracking, isn't it? Yeah. Oh, the the sinkhole is laggy. Yeah, that's true. Something wrong with the sinkhole. Of course, some people saying they were crashing around that place. Climb down. Yep. I always read chat backwards in case you're like, what is she doing? Yes. Okay. Well, we got ourselves another key. So we got two keys now. Um, we could fight another, a different boss. I can't remember if there's two or three chests from, I did make a video about it, but I can't remember, is it two or three? I think it's two, actually, in the dregs. So we want to go, um, equipped with a couple of keys. I think it's just two. Are you enjoying the new updates? Yes, I am enjoying the new updates. Um, I tested the purge, um pretty extensively on the beta um i would say that level one and level five don't feel very different for soloing but we did level 10 purges here yesterday and uh oh my i got my butt kicked and i'm pretty damn good at this game right it's it's tough um so then we did try um 11 level 20 berserkers in like full gear uh same gear that i have in my armor video on youtube um you know cooked pork black lotus uh, black lotus potion um and we just gave them star metal maces crafted with a bladesmith for fellas the hammer um and they were okay they were okay um they all survived uh, a little bit of damage to my base um yeah but obviously the the purge does scale so maybe what we do, we're going to do some more purge testing as well uh, because I love a purge. I was like a purge queen on like when I used to burn officials. I just used to do purges every week. Um, and build new bases to have different purges. Um, yeah, we need to test more things. I really want to do a lot of testing based around um, being able to solo the purge. That is going to be like a personal goal of mine. Because I like to solo stuff. You know? Is it three zombie? Is it? Okay, perfect. So we'll find another boss. Um... We could fight the spider again, or we could fight a croc. Should we fight a croc? It isn't my preferred, uh, like, thing to fight. You 
pooper. Hopefully he doesn't come through here. Are you gonna shoot me through these? No. God, what was that? It was me. I've got a taxidermy hyena. Lovely. Let's take these bone arrows. Twenty bone. They're so generous with the arrows now. It's brilliant. So yes, yeah, shall we fight a croc? I feel like we should. I feel like there's one very close to us. Um, in that little oasis by the survivor. Excuse me, sir. That was rude, wasn't it? I feel a bit like Hagrid sometimes. We do not bite, do we? <laughs> no. <laughs> Hello, purge junkie. Yeah, I love the purge. I love it. My first purge, I've mentioned this a bunch of times, so apologies for people I repeat myself, but people don't hang out necessarily the whole stream every single day. But um, uh, my first ever purge was, like, really upset me. I was like, I was gutted because I didn't ex I didn't know it was a thing. I don't think my friends knew it was a thing. And we just had, um, we got this, like, we heard the purge sound from, like, another part of the map. And we're like, what was that? <laughs> we didn't know what it was. Can you imagine? We didn't know what it was. And then we saw this, like, marker on the map. And we're like, oh, what's that? And we're like, oh, we'll just ignore it. It's fine. Um, I did, I've watched the Neebs play too, by the way, as well. And I feel like they had a similar experience. They didn't know what, I feel, I can't, I can't remember, like, their first Conan playthrough. Um, I feel like they didn't know what it was either. And, um... Yeah, and then we went, we were at home, and this is like single player co op. So I'd go, I guess it probably didn't attack our base or something. I don't know. And then it happened again when we were at home, and uh, we had a bunch of pirates come, and they just absolutely destroyed um, my sandstone uh, base. Yeah, and it was a horrible giant box with loads of windows. Just a, just a box, just a sandstone box. But I, I was very upset. <laughs> I was like, no, what has happened? I was like, no, you need to uninstall this game. And then we discovered that you could turn the purge off. So we turned the purge off. And that was like my first experience. Um, and then, it, you know, and then eventually I started playing on official servers because my friends got bored of the game, which is what happens, right? You play a game with your friends, they get sick of it. And you're like, you're addicted. You've got a problem at this point. You're like, I need, I need more of it. And... Um, yeah, then I started to really like purges, you know, it's good. That was, a, that was my story, friends. Dreg's question, is the acid supposed to go away? No, I don't think so. No, no, zombie. Mm -mm. No, just the, um, because there's nothing in the acid for the spider. It's just the, uh, the slug. Yep, yep. Thank you. It always happens to me. Yeah. Um, well, in games, you mean, you start playing a game with your friends and then they're like, well, no, I'm going to go play Mortal Kombat or I'm going to go play whatever it is, you know. Um, can I place my little friend? Do you want to go in here, bud? You, there you go. You can stay there instead of the coffer, dude, until we have a coffer. Excellent. He's very happy. He's a very active dog. Um, he's quite quiet. Um, yeah. Yeah. It's just, yeah. Perfect. Perfect pet. Uh, we could put the gossamer in the armourer's bench. Um, because once we got a thrall, we can get them to convert that, can't we? Can I, I can't do it in the tanner's bench, can I? No. Put it in here. I can convert it in my inventory, but I just don't want to carry it around when I've done it. Uh, right. <laughs> now we have the bark that we needed to make the tanner's bench finally the tannery can i press caps yes <laughs> yes victories um let's put you here i did change it so that there's only one door because i put plants in front of the door in case you're wondering nice now we can put some stuff in here we've got a bunch of bark already um, so the reason I see all these things here is because of Unlock Plus. So I could find um, the basic hide and I could pull it into here as much as I have and then press play. There you go, to start the tannery. Otherwise, you just have to put the put the bark in, put the hide in, press play, and it'll, it'll still do the same thing. But Unlock Plus is very handy for like, it's like a craft from containers situation. Love it. Uh, let's put any meat in the fire fire and a bit of dry wood fine burn that so it's cooked and we have snacks oh 
<laughs> right, now we have an agility weapon. I'm very excited about that. That is a nice thing about... So I think that's a nice bit of compensation for us because in the past... So originally you couldn't open level level uh, you couldn't open world boss chests until you were level sixty. Then they changed it so you could you could open them before level sixty on uh, on servers, and then they made then they obviously decided that progression was broken, so they moved them into dungeons, which is kind of cool, I guess. I don't mind that. I would have been doing dungeons anyway. And there are a lot of dungeons that I would never repeat after doing them the first time. So the Dregs dungeon I would usually do once just to kind of complete the journey in the past. And I would never go back in there. Well, now that there's uh, legendary chests at the end and there's a new, another new boss in there, world boss, then you've got a bit of an incentive, you know. So personally, I don't mind it. And then there are also dungeons like if you're level 60, I think the Warmaker is the best place to go and farm legendary chests, personally. I don't know. Where have you been farming? Let me know. Um, and that's because there's six boxes in there, which is really good. And once you've done the what, the Warmaker once, you can just run all the way through to the final chamber, loot the chests, and run back out again. Um, yeah. Otherwise, you know, the dregs will be good early game. Um, I have three games going. They all share the same. They all share the same battle pass. Hmm. Hello, Arcadium. Um. <clears throat> Let me catch up on chat. Uh, another restarted restart related question. I'm playing an official server. If I kill off my character, increase a new one with my battle pass. No. 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 You can only claim uh items in Okay. Let's wait for this to pass. Thank you for that. Lovely. Thank you, Cal. <laughs> you lunatic. Um uh no so if you you can only claim your items on one character it when you finish the battle pass and you claim your rewards you have to choose make sure you choose carefully which character you claim on but you can you can continue it uh through through like all of your characters basically because it's your uh, account right um this is my this is my box there are many like it but this one is mine i know exactly it was so ugly grail it was so bad uh hello pilado hello hello Battle pass progression is tied to your account rather than character, yes. But if it was items you got direct... There you go. Siege boulders probably will not reappear. That's it. You can only claim them once on one character. So I never worry too much about those things because I'm always ending a playthrough, moving on, moving on to a new character every chapter. So All knowledge recipes and emotes you get to keep. There are not a new character yet. Any free items in the chest? And I'm going to rejoin that clan. Yeah, if you've put the items in the chest, then you, you can use them again, obviously. Yep, absolutely. They should stay there, yeah. You can do parts of the battle in single player and continue. Yes, exactly. That's a good point, Excel. So when I do the battle pass, I always do it in admin mode. Um, and you can do that in single player. So if you usually play on an official server, I thoroughly recommend, unless you want to do it as daily quests, and I know some people do and love that, then um, definitely log in on single player in admin mode. You know, make yourself really, like, do loads of damage. Um, give yourself the best weapon possible. Um, and, you know, have at it, you know. <clears throat> Basic Sorton. Thank you, you like the location. Yeah, it's very juny, isn't it? It's perfect. Like as, uh, like, to us might be a PC bar pass on my Xbox. Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and also, um, you don't keep your DLCs when you move to PC either. Um, when I, I had all the DLCs on PlayStation, when I moved to PC, like, however many, two, nearly two years ago, more, well, two years ago, I guess, more than that. Um, I had to get all the DLCs again, which lots of lovely people here helped me with. But okay, uh, quick BLB chat. All right, friendos. Is Harvest Gossamer Challenge bugged for anybody else? I don't know. Has anyone else had that issue? Uh, right. Armor. Okay. That's all cooking. I should have crafting speed on max because of waiting around drives me crazy. <sighs> crafting time multiplier. This always drives me crazy. Is it 0 0.1? Right, I've got to stop the things first. Stop it. Right, let it finish that one. We always have this issue when I start. <laughs> Start fresh. There you go. Yeah. 
the lower number perfect there you go just to kind of for the interest of like moving things along um perfect last time i remember on the first playthrough i did when sorcery like hit i remember i kept <laughs> like so many like rage comments because i was changing it and it wasn't affecting the one that was already crafting i think um and people were like if you just let that one finish crafting you would have seen that it's gone like a lot faster um hello morbidius hello hello um thank you for the follow have we got any progress to that specific challenge it's weird it might be some specific maybe a mod yeah it seems to be mods affect things quite a lot in that way i don't know how to get the home set of tasks it's not showing up xbox single play game yes We've only just done it. Um, you need to unlock the artisan bench. Is it showing up when you do that? Let me put my cardigan back on one sec. It's kind of chilly in here. Oh, winter's coming, friendos. Yeah, have you unlocked... Um, I think I'll have check that later. Yeah, see, check, check that first. But you also have to be... I think you have to be a certain level as well. I think we have to be like level now we need to be level 17 in order to do the um in order to make the chair i think that's what it was yeah or level yeah 20 oh yeah 17 to make the chair i think okay um we've got some leather i want to make some heavy armor um so we need to make heavy padding we need thick hide i don't know why i forgot about that before okay thick hide so we do live quite close to the savannah. It is very dangerous at this stage. Um, so we could defeat some rhinos. Um, let's have a think. We could go to the savannah. This is one of the reasons I like living here. We could just defeat some rhinos or some elephants. Let's do. Let's go defeat some elephants, friendos. Um, let me dump everything I don't need. We'll respec. Hmm. Yes, we'll respec. We're going to make yellow... No, potion of best your memory. Um, can I... I don't have any blood, but I could put some stuff in a fluid press. Um, we just need a little bit more. I don't have any water-filled flasks. Okay. Alright, let's gear up, respec, go defeat some some heavy th thick heavy <laughs> thick heavy animals <laughs> oh god sometimes words fail me even though i talk a lot you think i'd be okay right, let's dump some stuff in the art uh, alchemical bench alchemist <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. um um bum, 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 bum. bugs uh, let's put stuff in here i'm just gonna put bugs in here because it's you know, doesn't make any sense, that's why. Um do, do, do. Ba -dum, ba -dum. Unhealthy <laughs> yeah, don't have any blood. <laughs> uh, because, because we've been mummified, so that's it. We live in a we live in a in a pyramid, so that's why we don't have any blood, because we've been exsanguinated. Or whatever. Twine you can go in here. Plant fiber you can go in here. Let's put any spare weapons in the blacksmith bench. Do 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 do. Da, 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 da. Anything else I can get rid of? Let's repair our pick. All right. <clears throat> so I need a glass flask, which means I need to make a casting table. Unless I just randomly have flasks picked up from somewhere i don't think i do i do hey presto um we don't have any blood back from grocery shop oh welcome back nephanor um they're on the forum a guy recommended savage savage uh savage wilds somebody recommended savage wilds map yeah i've never played that before people are always asking me to play it well at some point i don't know when um three blood so i don't have the blood but i can make a can i make a fluid press at this stage alchemy let's learn fluid press level 28 
Okay, we're level 27. Um, let's get a level, shall we? Um, in that case... Let's go fight a croc boss first. We'll come back, because we should get a bunch of points for that. Uh, we'll get to level 28, make the fluid press. Do, 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 do. I'm still specced for fighting. Now, I could just reset my attributes, but I kind of want to do it legitimately to kind of show it. Um, let's go fight the croc boss. Uh, the spider will be back by now, but I don't want to just kill the spider every time. We'll do it a lot, but um, I'm going to go that way. I guess we'll run through the rock noses. Let's use our hardened steel thingy for that. There we go. And that means we'll have our third key. So we, when we go into the dregs later, um, we will... Ah, do I, did I repair my daggers? I did repair my daggers. Oh, I didn't repair my daggers. That was a roller coaster, wasn't it? Oh, we need we definitely need repaired daggers. Okay, let's get some more iron. The nice thing is I can run up the, the pyramid and avoid aggro. Potentially. Oh I didn't know I could stand there. I love that noise, it's so good. So satisfying. Pyramids, yes, pyramids. Yep. Hello, Ogre. Um yeah, so we, what were you thinking about playing on um, Savage Wilds? How many of you have played it? How many of you would like to see a playthrough? I've never, I've never played it before. Um, if I'd been on PC this whole time, I'm sure I would have played it already. Um, but because I was on console, um, I just, I just couldn't. Um, um, well, we can carry a lot of this because we're specced for carrying things. So let's just carry a bunch of metal with us. It is a map, mo a mod map. Yes, it is. Mm -hmm. Quite a popular one as well. Um, Hammer, thank you for the follow. Cripple is like the most frustrating thing, isn't it? It's a bit like... Um, a bit like over, being over encumbered. I hate anything that slows me down in the game. I should just be able to avoid them. Haha. Uh -huh. Screw all. Exactly. Precisely. Like a warrior. Like a brave warrior we, we yeet towards more danger. <laughs> but I don't know, aren't you? Ooh, I thought she wasn't going to grab on for a minute. Thought you were, uh, I thought you were escaping. Oh, I haven't got my shift set. Ah, okay. I, I lost all my controls, people. Um, combat, movement, sprint, uh, release, release, release. Exit climbing, shift, yes. There we go. There we go. That's it. It's my preferred, because I used to press shift to the release from walls, and then they kind of, I don't know, then they assigned it C? Question mark? I feel like it changed anyway. Let's get some aloe. Another great reason to live here. Um, so yeah, I like it on shift, because I'm, I'm pressing shift regularly anyway. Um, I tell you what, when I, when I switched to PC from console, it was so hard. I was like, how do people use their pinky constantly to press shift? Anyone else had that experience? You move from like controller mostly. This is a great source of volatile glands, which are going to be helpful for sorcery. Um, what am I going to use for you? A cleaver. There we go. Volatile glands, lovely. Bum, 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 bum. Ah, feels so good living around here. Oh, Bunny. Hi, Bunny. Gonna be my friend. Sir. Okay. If you play on a server, it is much harder to pick up bunnies. You know what I mean? Let's get the iron as well. Do I have that marked? I do. Um, 
pro pinky shifter. Well, now I'm a pro pinky shifter, right? But in the past, I wasn't a pro pinky shifter, which is a great, great way of using words. Um, I would like to see you play Savage Worlds as a cool map. Hmm, yeah. I played it was so badly what did it wasn't fun at all really interesting um i play in the server my ping is way too high for it where i'm on the west coast in the us hmm if you're gonna place one transport to be sent outside your base where would you put it if you could put one outside your base where would you put the other one or whereabouts what do you mean which side would i put it on um no that's only because i'm talented shut up um, hate having to move my index past G. Yeah, definitely. Have a workaround to keep PC keyboard use a razor Tartarus. Have they put on the, up the buddy taming drop again at some point? Yeah, a lot of people have said that. Hmm. Yeah, that was a great drop though. You see, that kind of thing, like, drops can make such a big difference to streamers. Um, you know. Um, so yeah, I want, I want lots of like... I want, you see, I want them to do loads of, like, random, like, rare things that you just won't get otherwise. Because I need you, like, t I need, like, I need bums on seats, as they say in the theatre business. Which I'm, people are like, actually, I work in the theatre and we don't say bums on seats. <laughs> just, I don't know where you got that from. Um, translate that to American. Butts on seats. There you go. Well, White Rabbit is tired of living in a box. Oh, you just need somebody in your clan who can convert it. That's it. I wonder, can you, I assume then you can have it, if it's in your clan, I assume you can get it to, like, follow you and whatnot. Hello, sir. You are going to be a good example of why. Can I, I just want to get my daggers ready. Why I don't fight uh, crocodiles, really. Just because they're a bit of a pain in the butt to avoid. Well, I'm just going to have a sip of water, my... Oh, my allergies are so bad today. Throat's like super itchy. Good time to hydrate. No clan or... Oh. <clears throat> you had one in your base but could only put one... Yeah, one more to hold back. That's what I thought you meant. Where would you put it? It depends where I lived. Depends where I lived. If I live here, um, probably mounds. Probably mounds, because from mounds, I can get up to the north, to the volcano. Um, yeah, and I go to mounds a lot. I will farm mounds a lot for Delincia, Berserkers. Um, yes, either that or maybe Azagarth, perhaps. Because I can get, you know, between... I can get to the volcano and get to here. But I, I like this because there's a path from here. Um, I can go to mounds. I can go to stargazers. Um, it's not far down to Sepamaru from, from here. It's a very quick route through the Crown Grove. Yep. But that's because I'm living centrally right now. If I lived in the jungle, then I would just put it, like, at Sepamaru or whatever. Just as far as possible, really. Um yeah or maybe yeah i mean if you're not using maps because obviously wh wherever there isn't a yeah that's the thing wherever there isn't a uh an obelisk maybe that you want to go to a lot um i would consider placing it and moving it so if i was trying to get the the blackbird tools i would put it up here and then i would move it somewhere else is that cheating maybe the volcano yeah, maybe the volcano. It depends. If you're on a server and there's loads of map rooms, then, then it changes things a lot. Right, sir. Don't kill me. We have a gentleman's agreement here. But you're a lady. Well, I don't care. Do you avoid his face? Okay, t tail whip. One, two, three back to the butt believe it or not his face is the most dangerous try and roll outwards rather than um how do i say you just gotta avoid his face because he gets stuck in it quite easily ah! 
Tail whip. One, two, three. It's such you see it, it's so annoying. I never get stuck in spiders, like hitbox. You see I lagged then because I got stuck in his hitbox. It's also probably better to like clear the trees or something. So yeah, I got stuck in his hitbox. The spider one is just much more of a relaxing experience. You know? So, there you go. Excuse me! Sup? And I don't want him to regenerate his health. Is he full health? Yeah. Another bunny. What do we do, peeps? Do I pick a different croc? Because the trees are kind of in the way. Or should I get the trees out of the way? If anything is, I'll probably come over encumbered. Okay, well he hasn't taken any damage, so I can just run away and heal. Okay, heal up. Okay, now we have a bit of space. Because I'm on a server, things won't respawn just because I run away, which is really nice. And I really wanted that experience. Okay, we'll try again. Um, otherwise I could just kill the spider, but I, I do want to be able to like fight him as well. Um, now we have as much room as we want. Yeah, I don't know, peeps. This is why I don't fight him. I'm going to just fight the spider. Ah, tits. I don't want to die. Wah! It's a war cry. It's a war cry, people. It's not a scream. Yeah. I'm just going to fight the spider. <clears throat> Third one, yes. I like the twitch drops. Missed the last one, the throne one. Yeah, the throne one was really cool. I liked... Oh. Not intended as a pun, because it was a frost frozen one. Keep picking them up. Don't have the recipe to tame them. Play single player. What do you pick up, zombie? What have I missed? My heart cannot hold the word spiders and relaxing spirits in the same, yeah, in the same sentence. God, they're just so, un like, what's the word? Misunderstood, that's what I'm going for. Oh, the white bunnies? I see the white bunnies, that's it. Um, let's diff deal with these rock fellows. I, I feel like I'm spoiled by agility as well, you know. I almost feel like that. He moves so quickly with agility. I've been nerfed, chat. Do you know what I mean? I have no points in uh, vitality or anything else. It's just like a bit of strength. Listen, you're a bully. Squashed between the tree and the rock lava fence. Oh, white bunnies. Fine bu bunnies. Uh, if you, it depends on the base is. If it's in the jungle, I place it near seven room. Oh, we're here. Wait, let's go back to the house. 
Come on, lady. She's been melodramatic. Deady, deadified, yes. Uh, replacing a seven room with some man's office. Yeah, it depends where you live. Did you see that? <laughs> no! I forgot to click on the thing. Sorry, we're being very dramatic here. Where's my bed? Where's my bed? There you go, bed. There you go. <laughs> I wasn't paying attention. We're just being very dramatic today, people. I fell through the map again. That was weird. Anyway, stuff hasn't spawned in yet. There we go. Lovely. Excellent. Sweet. All right. Um, where did I die? Outside. Um, but, um, wrong side. Do do. Dum da da dum. Da da. There it is. I have to watch out for those hyenas because sometimes they'll spawn as a um. What's it called? A one skull, and they have really hit hard, don't they? Like how you split in half with no outside <laughs> influence. Yes. Just like. There we go. Like nothing ever happened. Yeah, let's go fight this spooder. Um, why did we go to the croc? We want it to get levels. We do level up um, <coughs> from dying anyway. <coughs> Excuse me. So I guess you could just um, you could just take your brace off a million times if you want to kind of get some XP. Yeah. Um, do I want to do anything before I fight the spider? We could put some stuff in crafting benches. Yeah, I, I, I just... The spider is very predictable. You don't get stuck in his hitbox. It's so much easier without any, like, extra points and things. Um, and if you're on a server, they'll, like, any bit of lag will affect you quite a lot. Um, da, 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 da. So we want to level up so we can make the fluid press so we can respec, basically. That is what's going on here. Um, food in the bench. Go kill monkeys. Oh no. I mean, we only need one level. We'll just kill one boss and we'll be fine. And we want more keys anyway, so it works out. Monkeys don't drop the... Um, skeleton keys. Do -do -do -do. Okay, I got that. Perfect. Let's repair our weapon. Okay. Right, spider boss notification. Um, we'll have to do the same thing and take out the little bebes first. Uh, fiend, thank you for the follow. Definitely don't get lost in my own base. Should we watch the flying moon? Totally realistic. It's gorgeous though, it looks so nice here. They've, they've changed the way the sky looks a few, like iterations ago of this game and it just looks so beautiful the stars look different they didn't always look as nice as this Do you remember peeps all right spooder let's get our like heels ready in case we get hit so if you have any points at all in vitality you'll have a bit more survivability usually when i fight bosses i have steel feud which is uh, max grit um why do i have that circle that triangle oh i tell you what i want to do Let's turn on some things in Hozav. I want float damage numbers. Float damage. I also want to see the XP. Kill XP feedback. Yeah, we are getting that. We just didn't have float damage, I think. Okay. Da -dum, bum, bum. We still have our bedroll over here. Uh, Right, so let's see if we see damage numbers now. Do, 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 do. I want to save that little short sword until I have um, until I'm got an agility build. Dum, 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 dum. Two things the easy way, yeah. 
<laughs> this is no good bows drop in Sinner's Refuge. From who? Um... Yeah, I do. I have to say, I don't like to make things easy for myself. Like, um, like the first couple of purges that we did, um, I I did them with like medium armor. You know, I did have a very good weapon. I like to do a lot of damage. So when I say I don't like to make things easy, I want to still like absolutely destroy things. Um, but you know, I don't necessarily always do things like the easy way. So that spider is definitely going to give us the XP we need. Let's deal with the little friendos first. Da -da, do -do. I could harvest the, um, them, but we're going to have so much gossamer in this playthrough. We already have a lot of gossamer. And I'm not really worried about it. Um, I could do with the Ica, to be fair. So that's probably a good reason to harvest them. We'll harvest the spider boss with a hatchet. Still the other spiders over there. The Azora priests. So they're dropping bows. What bows are they dropping? We've already been... We went into Sinner's Refuge. Um... Uh, Junior Bukov, thank you for follow. Do we're going to be giving away a complete edition Steam key for this game today? If you don't have any some of the DLCs, so we do exclamation mark ticket uh, if you'd like the chance to win that. We'll be drawing that today. Do 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 do. Uh, tick one ticket. If you do exclamation mark ticket, it'll buy one ticket. Each ticket is worth like 20 stream elements points, which you get from just watching the stream, following, being a sub, that kind of thing. Um, and you can buy up to 5,000 tickets. There you go. Okay, there is one little spooder over there I'd like to deal with because he's going to be a pain. He sees us. There we go. There's the level we needed. Well, we'll still fight the spider anyway because we want the uh, skeleton key. We'll be ready to... So we can make a fluid press, we can respec, we can make our armour. We'll go to the dregs dungeon, go get some legendaries. See the double shot and the other bow with strength damage. Um, okay. It had so it's strength damage. Okay, cool. So it wasn't, was it a legendary, no? Was it just a unique... The armor is agility buff. I think the the armor buffs different things depending on which piece. Obviously, I mean Sinner's Refuge is great anyway. We did it. We went there on day one of this playthrough, which is on the YouTube channel. Huntress, legendary. It drops the Huntress bow. Uh, but damaged was it damaged? We have gotten that from... Where did we get that? We got a damaged Eye of the Khan from the den on the beta. I love this fight. It's just the best boss fight, world boss fight for me. What did we call that? Slammy squash or something. Slammy stomp. Okay, now we see the float damage numbers, which is good. I can see the tick damage to him. So he's getting a little bit of damage from my daggers, but it's really the bleed tick damage that's doing the work for us. 27 per tick. The job is just to keep the bleed going. I should always like move away from this rock. This, um, should we just move him away from that? Because it gets in my way. Even if we lose, lose our... Even if we lose our, like, bleed stack. But, like, this is... this is, I think anyone could do this, you know? It's much more of a reliable fight. 
I think the croc. I, I just don't think we should get stuck in its hitbox. I'd love to see them fix that. Obviously this guy will hit very hard and he'll poison you, but it's a lot easier to not get hit. You know? I got no points in ability, no points in grit. I'm just using iron poniards. And I've done this with stone daggers. Have a, like, have like three sets of stone daggers. Make sure you defeat the little bebbers first. And you can do it too. It'll be ever so quicker with the iron poniards. But the better the dagger, obviously, the more you do. If you do a dagger that has poison as well, then even better. But it's a good way to grind legendaries. game definitely cured any fear of spiders I have. I don't think I'm scared of spiders really all now. I don't want them like in my bed, in my hair, you know, I don't want them on my dinner plate. But like, you know, they're like, we're on the same team I feel, you know. There we go. 37,000 XP. What did we get from it? We got a three hardened leather, we got a hardened steel shield. That shield would come in handy for the dregs, for the boss fight. Although I generally would just you know, not worry about it that too much. Two sturdy strings, shield frames as well. Okay. Cool. No, no weapon. Eh, you know, but the shield is good. Full durability. 3,750. I hate using shields generally. Let's use a, a hatchet to get Ica from this guy this time. Demon blood. There's our skeleton key. Um, yeah. Do you know what? I, I will always run here. <laughs> I'm, I've done it hundreds of times. I run here to open this box and there's no box there anymore. Anyone else do that? Can Excel achieve the truest test for over, overpowering? Yeah, arachnophobia, yeah. Because there's so many spiders. That's true, yeah. Uh, immortal and uh, stab a lot. Thank you for the follows. And it's one cute cherry spider. It is true. Johnny Guns, thank you for the follow. Ooh. Let's deal with this guy. So we can respec now. I think we'll do it in the last minute. We'll craft our armor. We needed to get to level 28. Look, we're already like 57% through level 28 as well. Lots of XP. I'm doing that constantly. Um, you've been doing that constantly. Uh, what's that, David? Hello, welcome. Um, anyone playing on PS4 having infinite loading? Oh, is that what you're talking about? Infinite loading screen issues? Oh dear. Sorry to hear that. I think I've heard other people mention it. Um, slammy jump. Slammy jump, that's it, yes. That's it. Um, running to... Oh, the running to the chest, that's that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because you just... It's muscle memory, isn't it? You just go into, like, autopilot. I did that when I made the... Um, when I made the legendary chest video. I, like, ran there. And I was like... Uh, oh, wait, wait. There's, <laughs> I was like, wait, there's no chest here. Yes. Oh well. That's what we're going to do today. We're going to go into the dregs to get our first legendaries. So. Do, 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 do. I shall forever miss my favourite chest in the Oasis at the Den after farming the Rhino Boss. Yeah, is that your favourite one? Yeah. Did, did you have favourite chest locations, chat? Where will you be mourning? Do you have little vigils? Done it once today, twice. Uh, done it twice today, once for the croc and once for the spider. Yeah, yeah. I did like the the one next to the white tiger. I always felt like it was a bit of a thrill going for that chest, um, at, at the savannah. It was kind of fun. So we were respecking. The reason we were respecking was because we wanted to go and get some thick leather from the savannah. This is me like trying to use my brain, and like track my memory, which is always kind of fun. Okay, so that's why we wanted to respec, wasn't it? Before we went to get stuff okay let's make let's make the fluid press fluid 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 there we go can unlock that now and now we can craft 
a fluid press and squish something into blood. Um, alchemy. Okay, now do I have the mats? If I press caps, it would pull it through. If I did, I don't. What am I missing? I need 50 shaped wood. Okay. okay. I've got crafting speed on like uber fast because I'm the most impatient woman in the whole world. Actually, my wife is. Nope, she's not. Um, crock chest near New River. Ah, that's a nice one. Yeah, I like that one. Uh, a group in Australia, spiders are part of life. You live with them in the house. They still make me squeal. I mean, if I lived in Australia, I think I would scream, run, and I would, like, climb onto the nearest piece of furniture like someone from a cartoon. You know what I'm saying? Um, I had built my base in Savannah. I used to lure the white tiger to my base and put palisades around him until he bled out. Yeah, that's cool. I mean, you can still fight the bosses, but obviously the chests, yeah, no more, no more. Um, right, I was dumping food in here, wasn't I? Do, 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 do. Um, Anna tries to remember what she was doing. There we go. Fluid press. Sweet. We'll put it next to the alchemy bench. There we go. That'll do for now. And now we want to squish some blood. We could pull in any carcasses. I think we have human uh, flesh in a box somewhere. No? Did I get rid of it? Did it expire? Do I need to hack up some humans? I have questions. I got no... got no human flesh left. Well, we live next to some people. We could always modify them. Um, yeah. It's a nice thing about Unlock Plus. You can be entirely disorganised. Or maybe I cooked it or something. Yeah, I cooked it. Unfortunately. Oh, I could squish the heads. There you go. Squish the heads. Yes. So why didn't it give me that option? Then I just need to, like, scroll down. Ah, because this will give you all of these items. Hmm. Okay, so we put the heads in the fluid press. That'll give us blood and uh, bone. So did I need, like, three blood, though? Was it just two? Three blood something else to squish i mean i could kill a what's it called there's there's some more heads perfect could kill a hyena and harvest it with a cleaver otherwise there we go beautiful yeah uh human flesh is really good for getting blood though just stick the limbs in there lovely all right potion of your memory we'll eat that and that's how we respec our uh, recess our attributes. There we go. So we want to spec up for fighting elephants um, and rhinos and things. Really, a really good weapon to use against elephants and rhinos is a hardened steel hammer. Um, or a hammer, because it has a lot of armor pen. Um, so really, we should probably spec into strength. We're already dressed for strength anyway. We do have an agility weapon here, which is great, but not really as good um, against like heavily armoured targets. There's 40% armour pen on that. So I think we're going to go with strength initially. Um, yeah. So let's go... Let's just spend what we have. Do, try two in strength. Combo master. Combo finishes deal 20% more damage. And then we'll do a bit of vitality. The first perk... How much health do I have now? Two nine eight. Ideally, I want like resurgence or faster healer in vitality. I'm not going to put any, any points in authority. First perk in grit will increase my armor value. Okay, we need a bit of weight, and then I'm going to put the rest in strength. I'd rather just defeat them quickly and be able to run away. So this is what we're going to try. Hopefully, we're okay here. All right. Um, let's repair those. 
are we going to leave behind anything we don't need? Um, we'll go with the Falcata instead of that little sword. Because we haven't got any points in a gelatine. We'll take a bow. Bam, bam, bam. Eight carrying around loads of bits, don't you? Um, shields and bow things. Let's put them in here. We need horns to make armour. For helmets. Let's put that in the armourer's bench. And later. What else can I get rid of? I might take the shield, but I won't use it until we get into the dregs, probably. Seeds we'll put in the fire. We could make oil from these. We could put them in the fluid press and make oil from those. Any seeds. Um, anything else I need to get rid of? I think I'm okay. Maybe the shaped wood. Do, 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 do. I think we're good. We need plenty of space. Um, yes, we need to skin things. So I'm not... I'm not at the steel level yet, am I? Is that like level 38 or something? Steel tools is level 30. Okay. So we'll use our skinny knife. We also can't... I don't think we can make the tanning bench... Uh, the tinker's bench yet. Just double check what level we have to be that for that. How we can start tinkering a bit. So let's put a simple tool upgrade kit. Um on our skinning knife just to increase the yield we get thick leather um crafting station smithing tinker okay perfect put you here friend and then we what do we need like iron yep so we'll make a simple tool upgrade upgrade kit for that. Do I need it for anything else? I don't think so. Um, no, I just want it for skinning. So we'll repair that. Not enough materials for repair. What? I, oh, I pressed it here instead. Okay. There we go. Upgraded knife. So we get as much thick leather as we can. Um, I'm going to dump a lot of things in here. Just because I'm gonna leave the shield, the falcata. We'll just use that and the daggers. Um, I'm not gonna use the cleaver. I'm not gonna use the sickle. I'm gonna leave a lot of these behind. I need weights to carry stuff. Spell pages we could put in a box. They don't weigh anything, but I'm just gonna do it anyway. I wish you could display this uh, dead sorceress map. I don't think there is. Is there a way to display that chat? Do you need a mod? Um, we'll put a bedroll down when we're there. Okay, I think we're good. We're kind of minimalistic here. Let's leave some of these behind. In case we get tidified. All right, let's go defeat some... Um, Rhinos and elephants in the savannah. Hello, Simpa. Hello, hello. Um, Anubis. Anubis, welcome. Thank you for the follow. Um, sorry for monologue. Saludos. Hello, hello from Costa Rica. Hello from the UK, Tico. Hello, hello. Or should I call you Louis? I built my base in the savannah. I used to lure the white tiger. Yes. Do, 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 do. When I say the servers I play on, I've gone full cannibal and only eat the human flesh, do you? I love that. That's brilliant. I think I had a friend who did that when I first did the playthrough. We kind of picked our um, religions based on kind of like, you know, how we felt about them. You know, I think that's what you do when you first play this game. When I was a 12 year old, I found a nest in the basement of the house. Oh, yo, 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 yo. Exile, no. Oh, my goodness. That is disgusting. That is so scary. Oh, so scary. 
Strength 15, Agility 0, Vitality 10 work for me. Um, hello, Mutton. How are you doing today? How is your day going? Welcome. Welcome. All right. To the savannah. We're getting thick leather, if I forget, chat. Thick hides. Do, 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 do. Do, do, do. Do I have water? Yes. No. Yes. We're going to be running past the river anyway. Bam, ba, da, dum. Oh, there's a flying rock nose, friends. You see him. Can I shoot him while he's in the air? I don't know why I want to. I just want to. It did hit him as well. Can I defeat him while he's in the air? Oh, don't cheat. Has he aggroed? That's funny. A recent server I chose for my foods to learn other religions. It's blasphemy, really? Yeah, I like that. Got to make your own mini, mini games, haven't you? <clears throat> Found his landing gear, yeah? What was he doing? Flying rock nose. Don't do drugs, kids. Do, do, do. Wonderful. Perfectly descended. I keep interrupting my heel. Oh, I keep inter interrupting my heel for some reason more than more frequently than usual. Okay, so let's go to the savannah. Get some thick hide. Um, I needed to play through a sense of the forest. The, the speed at which I turned to cannibalism because there was no yeah penalty concerning for my brother who was playing at the same time. Yeah, yeah. I feel like people who start playing this game for the first time are like, "What are you doing eating like that?" And you're like, "Oh, it's just, it's fine," or you know. Kind of your morals go out the window fairly quickly, don't they, in the game. Um, so my mum's hairspray and a lighter and you said, it's a flamethrower, did you? Oi, oi, oi. So scary and disgusting. Um, still don't trust my coffee guy in the main bank. He can't keep the books straight. He's off by a few thousand. Is he off by a few thousand? Is he? Genuinely. He does do that thing where he kind of like, he's, he's, his voice lines say that he can't add up. It's kind of funny. Do, 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 do. All right, friendos. Do, do. Okay, what are we going to fight first? Probably an elephant will come across first. Uh, rock, thank you for the follow. Welcome back, Mor Morbidius. I leaned into it, it was all what gotta do, what I gotta do to survive! Oh my goodness, brother, I've literally just cooked up some fish with the rivers right there, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Mate, there's a McDonald's, like, right there. You're like, that's not food. <laughs> do, 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 do. Okay. The hunt for the elephants begins. So we're doing this because we want to make thick, and uh, we don't want thick hides to make thick leather to turn into heavy padding so we can make heavy armor and then we're gonna go to the dregs turn in these keys we've got for some legendary weapons i don't think we've been here yet since the update i haven't seen that nothing seems to have changed there I'll tell you what we'll do while we're here as well before we defeat an elephant let's go and have a quick look at mecca moses place because i haven't been there yet chat um, if you haven't been here since the Age of Sorcery, this has changed. This plateau has... Oh, sh shine a light. What? What is happening? <gasps> it's an event! It's, a, it's the event! <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> it's an event! Oh my. That's a smart thing to put here. Oi, oi, oi. Level 28. Oh, look. I remember these. Oh, my goodness. I, I didn't know it was here. That's such a great surprise slash terrifying. Look at the moon going. Interesting. Yeah, events are back. We'll fight that at some point. <laughs> it's 
first time I've seen an event. Yeah. So if I break these eggs, um, yeah, yeah. Oh yeah, you see, it's like it's like uh, Sipta stuff basically on Nexar lands. It's very cool, but it it will kick up. But there's no way we can defeat that. If it's the same as it was um, in sorcery, there's no way there's no way we can defeat that yet with our current gear. We're like in 123 armor and yeah. Let's go to Mech. See what's going on. The moon, the moon is running away. I know it's because we have nighttime on super fast. The moon's like, Whoa. yeet, you know, sit to pods. Yeah, come on, you. Kill felines. My purge base across my do you such a lovely it's like a beautiful place it's one of my favorite places to have a base the music is really nice there's loads of animals around it's such a great place the only thing about building in the savannah you've got to be careful that you don't block off kind of important spawns but you know there's lots of places you can build very cozy gullies in the unnamed city drop the legendaries I did go around the unknown city. Um, the bosses seem to drop things every single time. Has anyone noticed that? Looks like the first one I did. Murdered me. Yeah, the level 60s. Yeah, it's too tough for us at this point. Bum, bum. Yeah, every time I defeated a boss or fought a boss in the unnamed city, I got a legendary. Do, do, do. Dun, dun. Trash skellies, two fangs. Mm. Okay, so this is Mech's place. I just haven't been here yet. The traders are apparently gone. Have they replaced them? These are all the fighters. Apparently they're gone and it's intentional. Yeah, they're just fighters now. Oh, Mech is still here. Hi, bud. How are you doing? Greetings, Exile. Hi. The loss of a body is a small matter for one who commands the obeisance of many other bodies. Yeah. I mean, yeah, cool. I agree with you. Definitely. Ah, these guys are still here. Okay. So you can still turn in, you can still get the magic caches for blood crystals. I don't have the severed head of... Why did it let me click on that? I don't have the severed head of crack. Purchase made. What? That is bugged, friends. It hasn't given me a, um, a box. Yes, but you're supposed to be able to go into this um, dungeon, which was inactive on, it was inactive on, uh, what's it called? Uh, the beta. It wasn't working. But yeah, blood crystals defeat, um, what are they called? Rock noses, like blood crystal rock noses or golems around the map. Harvest them. When you see weird looking ones with like red crystals on them, harvest them and you just need 30 to transport yourself to Karak's dungeon, which is here. The axis is here, and then when you come out of it, you can turn in the head, the head of Karak, Kurak. <laughs> to like sounds like I'm saying head of crack, um, to one of these guys, and then the other one you can just turn in for blood crystals. Okay, so they're still there, but if they give you obelisk, because they gave you obelisk before, there's no trader anymore to turn your obelisk into. Right, that's the thing. That's the difference. These are all just fighters. Um, but you can learn golem shaping from this guy still. Wanderer. There you go. I suspect an interesting. I love the voice acting for this. It's like Big Trouble in Little China. Reminds me of. So over the top. Um, you can still buy crystalline body parts. You can make one of these. Uh, guardian. What do you call them? Crafting machines contraptions. Cool. Okay. All right. So now we know what's here. Um, no other tra no hello stack thick no traders are gone intentionally yeah 
yep, yep. I think because um, just to return the game to like the usual progression, you know. Um, but I'm glad that Harvard Master Qua Master Quava Master <laughs> Master Carver Huang is still there. That's good. No more free momentum. Yeah, and momentum is pretty cool, right? Mech is a bit ahead of the curve. Never know a corner. You're like I was already there. Just, just refreshing your corner like time. <laughs> Yeah, you can still get momentum, obviously, from, like, world boss chests. Um, yep. All right. Let's defeat some elephants. I always want to drop down here, and it's not the best, is it? Sweet. Right. So we've got how many points? we got a bit of points. Some points in strength now. A little bit of vitality. A little bit in grit. So we're going to defeat some elephants and some rhinos. Get as much as we can carry. Make ourselves some armor. And then we'll we'll need enough so that we can maybe make another set of armor for a friendo. Hi there, buddy. Please don't modify me. We got this hammer from uh, killing a, a, a spider boss. Well, I like it for elephants because they have a lot of armor. And this is 40% armor pen. There we go. So glad they sped up um, or they reduced the health of elephants. For one point, there was such a freaking grind to def defeat. Corner for live, yo, yeah. Oh, look, there's the, the event. Can we ignore it? That's the question. Da -da. Hello, sneaky, sneaky friend. Who is always there. Let's move some heels onto a hot palm. Doo doo. Da -da. Do, 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 do. Hi, friend. Grass looks very fluffy, doesn't it? Where's this dude? There he is, he's on his way. Twenty nine. Stop it! I don't want to die again today. I don't usually die in this game. But I forget that everybody hits harder. And I'm so used to having Steel Feud, I guess. And loads of agility. Thunderfoot still has obscene amounts of health, like 25,000 or something, isn't it? But, um, doo -doo -doo -doo. um I, ne well, they've nerfed his health a bit, didn't they? Certainly on the beta. Well, certainly last chapter he was nerfed. I didn't get any water. Speaking of water. Time to hydrate. Do, 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 do. Mm -hmm. This is a good place to get a baby tiger as well. Down here. If you want to get thick leather, you can get it from baby elephants, I think, can't you? It's like your first source. We'll do it just to see how much you get. Anyone who's like of a nervous disposition can look away. Um, um, sorry about this. I love all creatures. So how much do we get? This is on two times harvesting. Uh, 20. 20. So we got 40 elephant hide from that one. Um, so 20 without double harvesting with a iron uh, skinny knife with a simple tool upgrade kit on it. So that's definitely a good way to get your first uh, elephant hide. If you're not a complete savage. 
if you are a complete savage. Um, hello, Valentin. Hello, hello. How are you doing? Hello, Gara. Hello. Hydrate. Yes, absolutely. Hydrate, friendos. Sometimes I forget. I'm like chatting away. Oh, someone's already hurt you a bit. It just used to take so long to freaking kill elephants. It was such a pain in the butt. The grass does look very fluffy. Do you think so? Can I fight just you? Sir or madam? Thank you. Keep out that AoE. Oh, this is fun. I do like it when they eat you in the air. It's kind of funny. Okay, so we're over encumbered. It is a crime to drop exotic f that, a flesh or whatever. Um, so we're probably going to have to just go with this, aren't we? We could strip the elephant hide, which is also kind of a crime. I guess we take this back. Ba mm -hmm. Yeah. should have enough to make armor we strip the elephant hide sweet let's go friendos i'm gonna leave that auto modded valentin do you know what i mean um she's wearing uh she's wearing shorts so don't don't be too alarmed <laughs> so mech is a dietitian his weight loss program which he himself uses is head and shoulders above. I'm not even going to respond to that. Never know. People leave. <laughs> you do. Oh, hello, rock nose friend. I forgot about you. All right, let's let's deal with him. XP. Okay, let's get let's get some blood crystal. We have to drop something else. Sixteen blood crystal. There we go. Um, all right, sweet. So we can use that to craft golem parts later, or we can use it to spend at the trader we just went to at Mechamosis Spire. All right. It's a new Rogue Cup game in the way. Doesn't look half bad. A Robocop game, really? It's fine. No, it's fine. I'm just gonna leave it auto modded, that's all. Hello, Kevin, how you doing? Oh, is that the, the joke? Kevin has been broken by that joke, never know. Hope you're happy. Yeah, it's fine. It's fine. I'm just gonna leave it auto modded. Da, da, da. Do, 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 do. <gasps> do, do. Right, back home. Craft some heavy armor. Hello, sir. That is a crocodile boss I will not be fighting today. When we've got, like, when we're, like, you know, max level, we'll defeat all the, like, world bosses. I just like the spider. Um, because dying is just so, in like, inconvenient for us. Let's deal with this guy. We've got a, um... A volatile gland, a sorcery, and for, um, what is it called? Not just for sorcery, but for, uh, demon fight orbs. I'm going to keep the head because we want, um, I 
I know it's a crime. I can't, I can't take the head. Can I take the head and leave the, leave those? Yeah, okay. Alrighty, friends. No worries, my buddy. There. I mean, no, you're fine. You're fine. Sometimes I just leave it auto-modded. I'm just, I'm just gonna leave that auto-modded. I saw it. It's fine. <laughs> Daisy, you're much darker. Oh, bless you. Um, and you. How, how am I? I'm, I'm always a bit tired. This is such a meme, isn't it? Yeah, I have been sorting out my sleep schedule. Although I did sleep a bit later today. Yes, because I was up a bit late last night, and then the night before I was up very, very late because I was um, editing. Um, I had to get a video out, so otherwise I'm all right. I'm all right. Do, 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 do. I'm going to enjoy um, using the studio version of um, my editing software, which was very sweetly gifted to me by this community. Big thank you to people, which I've only finally just got. They're not going to see me. So I'm going to enjoy kind of practicing with that. I would, I'd like to be able to do a speed build, um, which I couldn't do with the basic version, so... God, I keep forgetting to refill my water like a noob. Okay, so, thick hide. Let's uh, strip some stuff. I hate stripping elephant hide. I'm just going to do it. I will need it later. Um... But we'll be fine. Okay, um, so I need to cook this. We need this to make heavy uh, heavy padding. Let's squish the salamander's head. Where should I put my blood crystal? Maybe in here. Oh, the feet are going on the box, chat. Oh, so cosy. I have to check the cat's not there. I have to be very careful. Right, so now all we need is stuff to make our armour. Do I need... I keep going to the wrong bench. Moving thing, moving problems. Um, that's what we need to make. Um, this is the armour I'm going to make, which is my favourite. We've got a bunch of iron already. Do, do, do. We need some. We need more of those. There we go. Uh, I've got to make sure I remember to collect horns for headdresses. Um, do, 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 do. Um, 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 um. I'm going to strip the rest of this, people. I know it's a crime. Ho, ho, ho. Right, while that's uh, cooking, what should we do? Should we go fight some people? Um, should we go fight some... Should we go to s the summoning place? That seems like a good thing to do. Um, I need... I'm going to need some arrows though, because I left my arrows behind. Lots of those. And how is my bow? Bow is fine. Ah, it's not fine. Should I make a fresh bow, maybe? I gained some points. Let's put them into strength. Uh, bow, 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 bow. thick leather for that as well hmm I should be able to use that because I've got plenty of elephant hide actually I should just be able to pull it in just exactly what I need why is it not doing it is it because it's active
Bam, bam, do, do. Here we go. Um, reflex, thank you for the follow. Giveaway. Hello, Jamaha. Hello, hello. We're doing a giveaway free complete edition key today. If you want to buy a ticket, it's exclamation mark ticket. Um, and then you can put a number of how many tickets you want to buy. Each ticket should be, I think they're 20 today. I forget. Okay, so now we've got a bow. Uh, let's do this. Let's go defeat some cannibals while that's cooking up. I'll move any elephant hide that's already processed. There we go. So that'll process as we're away. It's processing very quickly because I have crafting speed on. Very quick. Let's go to the summoning place, which is just over here. Da -da -da -da. North Bear, thank you for the follow. If anyone here hasn't checked out my YouTube channel, there's a link um, at the top of this chat to a recent video I did about the purge. If you want to sub, I would like to get to 10,000 subs by Christmas. I like super love that. If you haven't subbed to me on the YouTubes, bum, bum. it's a bit of a goal of mine. All right. I don't have any points in agility. The, the range on that weapon is crazy. Okay, I better switch to this. damage sweet that was good that was good we got some dried meat i'll take the boat the arrows um nice just use this to kite them uh so twice if i could oh you're so sweet um okay let's do this friendos I shouldn't really do this with my feet up, should I? <clears throat> Alright. Get sit properly. Get ready for some fighting. Like, how did you hit me? I think there's, um, I'm going to have to get used to being on a server again, because I think on single play there's just no lag whatsoever, obviously. But I do benefit from, um, I benefit from a lot of other things, like the fact that I can run away from here. If I knocked out somebody, they would stay on the ground until I came back, um, within reason, until they woke up again. Uh, whereas on single player they'll just kind of, quite often... The whole camp will respawn. It's going to be really nice in like Azagarth. Because if I ran out to get my. Like to switch weapons or something. Um, everybody, the entire camp would respawn. Which is suboptimal. Sorry about that. Ooh, 22 thick hides! What? That's brilliant. That is like just what I need right now. I love that for me. Ooh. Bone cl Bone claws. Four health damage. <laughs> but they do bleed. We'll have to try those. I'm going to leave the shell bag thing. I don't think I've ever used that for anything. Maybe once. Maybe for a shield. I don't need to be this thorough, but I can be. Because I'm on a server. Like, I feel like I was really far from him. You know? I'm going to shoot you in the penis, sir. Oh, I got a taxidermied ostrich. Wonderful. And some steaks. Nice. Cooked meat. Immersion breaking, question mark. Don't be sorry, these guys are cannibals. Yes. 
bit tired, yes. Hello, Forig, how are you doing? Are these the points we buy tickets with? Yes, points. Exclamation mark points will tell you how many points you have. It's stream elements points. It's basically like channel points, but it's just through stream elements. Um, and they mean nothing apart from, like, giveaways, really. She's, she's like, she's like derped out. Another mask. That's what we're wearing at the moment. Full health. Full durability. I mean... Oh. Can I get you from here? Apparently so. Okay. Kind of got to stand still. I love this place. It's such a cool place. So creepy. Which is your favourite NPC camp, chat? Is it Sep? I'm really glad they put events back into the game. I think um, it just really makes the map feel so much more lively. When I saw it on the beta, I was like, is this a mistake? Because they, I'm pretty sure they said they weren't going to put events back. Um, and I'm, I was really, really delighted. More thick, yes. Prayer to Yog. Okay, we can learn the, the Yog religion without going to the trainer. Sweet. So good crafters here. Don't know who he is. But later in the game, I would just one-shot him. He's got it right through his head. Do you see that? Look at that. I love it. You look great, sir. Shot through the head. I'm not to blame. No. No. Okay, am I gonna sing Bon Jovi today? Maybe, maybe. <laughs> Ooh, healing potions. Lovely. Lovely. Ooh. Encumbrance frenos. Should I take the bone? I'm going to take the bone. We'll, if we'll start leaving these, we get too full. It's fun. You go around NPC camps and you can pick up stuff and be like, oh, the loot has changed. The loot is good. But it's only really when you play from the beginning, I think, that you kind of really get an appreciation for, for it. How did you hit me? Don't return to where you were going. You can get a Benaru heavy hands in here, which is a... Dude from this camp. Right. Please don't hurt me. Oh, she hurt. She hit like a truck. So do I, friendo. So do I. We should skin all these people, really. Do it on the way out. A taxidermy. <laughs> I love it. I love the random taxidermy stuff. So funny. Um, you enjoy a bit of pirate action. Interesting. <laughs> Mounds. Oh, Mounds, Azagar is my favourite. I do love other Azagar. Uh, Angel Forge, thank you for the follow. Seppamu is my favourite. It's got a good selection of workers. Yeah, I really love Seppamu, I have to say. This is one of my favourites, though. I love it. I do like Sinner's Refuge just because it's, it's such a, like, a treasure trove. Um, I don't know. I like, I like them all, I guess, in a way. I also really like the little NPC camps around around Azagoth. I didn't even realise he was next to us. One hit, chat. One hit. Was that one hit? Did you see that? Was that a one hit? Squirrel? I... One hit, that brute. Now, admittedly, we didn't have a lot of armour. Holy potatoes. That was crazy. We gotta get our body back from in there now. Let's get some heals, shall we? We could take a we could take a shield, which we have in a box. We have armor. I wouldn't normally put armor on. But you know. We could do medium boots because they have 
encumbrance. I should have put some aloe extract um, in a box as well, or well, aloe leaves. Very brutal. Yeah, it was so. It was so surprised. Just it took me by surprise. I knew they hit hard, obviously. Yeah, crazy. So where's the shield that we had? That I, that I, I'm like, oh, I never use shields, but this is a great use for a shield. In here. Did we have it on us? No. There it is. And a weapon. Okay. We we survive. I should probably take more wraps, actually. Crikey, friendos. Now, because it's not single player, nobody else should have respawned. This is the test, right? This is the reason I'm playing on a server. Do, 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 do. Do, do, do. I never use shields in this game. I used to use it a little bit on console. I just never got used to it. Um, yeah, if it's a single player, these people will, they would have respawned already. Because I ran out of like the area and back again. I might climb to get over there to avoid anybody. Don't know what happened to these people. Squirrel? Uwe la body. Okay, got it. We got it. I repeat, we got the stuff. We got the stuff. Okay. Um, anything I want to switch? Really? I guess we continue. Now we have our heels. Okay. So, um, yeah, don't get hit by the brutes, peeps. I mean, hit but don't get hit. That's the. This is a really good rule of thumb. Come, Shadow. I will not. You scare me! <laughs> I'm afraid of you! <gasps> Think about them, is they? So she's gonna be like the arena champion for me now, isn't she? Because I have like... <gasps> I kind of want to fight them one at a time. <laughs> she gets the poops out of me. <laughs> can I like... Can I cheese her? Can I do a bit of cheesing? I've never been afraid to come in. Well, the, the the archers were always a bit scary, I have to say. Um. The music is just so cool and dramatic. Can you hit me here? Madam. 
It's a lot of creatures. Excellent. Ooh, golem parts. Sweet. I like it. Drums. Six wind chimes. Impaled skulls. Which of these is the worst? This is the worst. Speaker mask. It's a different mask, but it has the same stats, doesn't it? What is the difference? Same same strength weapon damage, just a different name, just a different look. It's very beautiful. It looks stunning. Everything's the same. This one is just much more attractive though, am I right? That is like, you are going to chat her up, aren't you? Oh, Automod thought that, um, Automod thought you were being dirty there. Um, we got the stuff bucket. Yeah, I know, I know. A little pirate about your head, yeah. Um, we got the stuff. Heard about Brutes crashing, killing his friend. I was like, he was like, not this time, not with me, I know. And it's like, do, 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 can't touch this. And the brute was like, hammer time. <laughs> yeah, I know. Scary. Oh, wait, let me hide my helmet because it scares me. There we go. And we look pretty again. Oh, treasure. Friendos. I didn't, I've never seen this one here. Interesting. Can I drop down? Oh, God, I'm going to die from that fall. All right then, lads, ladies, non-binaries. Let's get the heck out of here. No one's gonna see me. Please don't respawn. I don't think they will, because their bodies are still there. I love that there's treasure here. I never, I've never seen it in here. Kind of funny. Bum, ba -dum, bum, bum. Seems very fitting. Take the bit of bones. Oh, we got some friendos to medify on the way out. I assume as soon as we get past the out, like the outside, we're going to get attacked by spawning enemies. We'll get as close as, to these guys as we can before we fight them. All right, lads. I've just taken... Uh, I've just... Uh, Frank said I could take this, I promise. We don't know any Frank. Please leave me alone. Squirrel. Squirrel. Sirs and madams. Break my rock. I like this rock. This rock is my friend. Safety rock, friendos. Comes to us. I'm not taking a lot of damage from the bows and the arrows now. Okay, we can take these guys now. Famous last words. I'm just going to leave. You're not going to trouble me, are you? Everything's going to be fine. Don't shoot me. Don't shoot me. I'm going to get killed by a Kudo now. Don't shoot me. We can go this way. I should heal. Who is attacking? Oh, they've respawned? Question mark? No. Right, you're going to have to come over here if you want to fight me. It's a different size when you place it down, isn't it? It's like smaller. Starboard, hello. How are you doing? Hope, uh, hope everyone's update. Hope everyone's enjoying the update. Yeah, I am. So far. I don't know about the patch. I haven't noticed any difference. But I don't really have any issues. I've noticed you drip blood when you're bloodied. Do we drip blood? No, this is the coins. 
This is, um, we're dropping coins here. I believe. Yeah. Is that what you mean? From, from chest. Yeah, never mind. Oh, that would have been kind of funny. Maybe it will need to get back in. Here. Yeah! Having a good time. This is our little pyramid, friendo. There's a tiny pyramid. The test pyramid. Oh! Balls! He scared the absolute poop out of me. I didn't even hear him spawn in. You terrified me. You... I, I like... I had like a mini heart attack. Sir! You scared me. A little warning next time. Seriously. He's one of the guys that spawned in to antagonize us. It was terrifying. Crikey. Where was the rock nose sound? <laughs> it was such a jump scare. My money. Yeah. I'm kind of nervous now, peeps. Oh, it's so much better since we like extended it down to this, the sand. Definitely. It was going to be fine. We'll just run, right? <laughs> Except you can't shift. Hopefully. So I'm in my land claim now. Re uh, radius. So no one should attack me, hopefully. That was such a random dude. Shut the door behind us. Yeah, mate, we've got some good stuff for you here. Oh god, I forgot. I forgot we didn't have a coffer. We're gonna have to build a coffer stats. Uh, Webber, thank you for the prime. Welcome in. So, left click. Oh, I can't. I can drop it. And it'll despawn. I think it's like half an hour or something. But we need to make a coffer, like, ASAP. Is it slightly in the ground? No, it's just little. Sorry to insult its size. Right, can I make a coffer? We did put one, but we removed it so I wanted to make it legitimately. Um... Coffer, coffer, coffer. Decoration. Clan. I haven't learnt it. Is that right? There it is. Treasure coffer. And I need shaped wood. And iron reinforcements, which I thought were crafting. Um... Okay. Maybe we use them. I don't remember. I don't know what we use them for, but apparently we don't have any. So how many do I need? Uh, five. Okay. Okay. Super. Yeah, the recipe for the fancy coffer is um, you get that from doing um, purges. So which way do I want him to face? Which is the way out? So I want him to face the other direction. This way. There we go. This guy is our little scribe. Tell us how much we have in our coffer in the chest or in this area, in this radius. So if I, if you didn't know, see the radius. Show you the, show you how big it is. There you go. That's the radius of the coffer. So it'll be, you know, well inside our pyramid. But then anything I place inside there, it'll add up or should add up within the coffer. Ooh, balls. I forgot I was in ghost. It's terrifying. I always jump scare, jump scare myself in this game somehow. Um, that way. Okay. Okay, let's get out of creative mode. There we go. Let's 
Let's pop him back down again. Oh, it's because I disma dismantled it in creative or something. Balls. Okay, there you go. All right. We did it all legitimately. Okay, perfect. Now, so I can place things in here of value. Like those gold coins. And I can use just one coin to get threat level one. I've got ten, but I could just use one coin. Then I could proclaim my wealth and I could summon a purge. I'm not going to do that. Because even even though it's just a level one, it's still quite tough. And I don't want to do that to this base. We're going to have a specific purge target. So when you bring back heroic treasure, this is worth 5,000 coins. It's worth a lot. So it's good, you know, like worth picking up. I just have to right click it and place it anywhere within the coffer radius, which includes um, out here. Let's see where it goes to. So I could put some decorations outside here if I want to. And I can stick to it in here. I could just place them anywhere in here if I wanted. And then he would have 5,000. See, Bountiful chest, Treasure Chest. Any of the heroic treasure is 5,000. And that would take us to threat level 3. Just from that one. You need 100,000 to get a level 10 purge. So you kind of get an idea. Now we could put this um, around him if we wanted to. Like, so he's kind of totting it up ready. Um, or we could put it in these, like, little little like spaces that I've made I'm tempted to do that um, but maybe maybe initially we'll just put it next to him on this rug so it looks like he's counting it can move it around should we put it here there we go so we can kind of see it and eventually I might just fill these like maybe the Lemurian things and the cats and stuff kind of cool don't forget to place the chest again yes absolutely um I rate hello thank you for the follow need a friend of your own to guard you uh yeah a follower yeah yeah get chased down when you're carrying now yeah definitely mm -hmm. you do indeed right I'm just gonna eat quick snack chat and we're gonna make some armor Awesome sauce. All right. Let's continue. Let's make some armor. Do, do. We do have some more treasure we could put in there. Should we do that quickly? Um, I'm not in creative or anything, am I? No, we're good. All right. Yeah, we've got a bit of treasure here. We can put in our coffers. I don't have, like... I have a means to, like, automatically check over if I have treasure in my chaos do, do, do. wow we got so much metal the lovely thing about being on it's very slow to craft isn't it lovely thing about is it because i changed the settings after i started it nice thing about being on a server is knowing that i can leave things to smelt and they will continue on offline as well which is wonderful Let's try again. Yeah. <laughs> I hadn't stopped it. That's it. I changed the settings so it was like super, super quick. And I hadn't changed, I hadn't, uh, had to, you have to cancel, let, let, run, uh, let whatever you've started already kind of finish. There you go. Wonderful. Um, okay, we've got some thick leather now. Regular leather. Uh, we'll tan that as well. And now we can make our armor, hopefully. Heavy padding, we need five of those. Five of those. And I'm going to make the Pictish War Chief and the Savage Frontier DLC. Um, one shoes, one top, one gauntlets, one headdress, and one pants, as I like to say. Um, let's go get rid of stuff let's put things in the treasure coffer while that's crafting i should get rid of my emergency stuff as well so this little friendo here gilded jade warhorn so this looks like heroic treasure but you pick this up and get it from like boxes and stuff don't you but i should be able to place it in here i kind of like that stuff better because you can just put it in your pocket and it's still in there 500 coins or can i put it in the chest I just, for some reason, no, you tell you have to place it, okay. 
to place it in your coffer. Perfect. And it's worth, like, yes, a very small amount compared to the heroic stuff. Exile, Exile needs snacks, it's true. I prove the chaos makes me relate to the fact that I never get around to organising my base, yeah. When I used to play on official servers, I was very organised, but I did, um, uh, I did have... I did have like more kind of time and I wasn't like chatting and kind of trying to keep things interesting for you to watch, you know. So yes, that is my excuse. I'm sticking to it. Uh, maybe we'll drop any stone heads and things. Okay, let's get rid of our stuff. Um, do, 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 do. Armor. Where are we going to put our armor? Because we've got it in multiple places. Um, hmm. Armor, armor, armor. Could do with like another box, really, for it. We could make better chests now, couldn't we? To be fair. Um, so we need shaped wood and uh, re iron reinforcements. So can I loot you? Because you're great at the beginning, but. Decorations storage. Okay, we can make these kind of fancy boxes as well. Um, shall we do that? These are from the... What were they from the Battle Pass chat? I forget. I think they were skinning chest. Let's put that next to the tannery. So the nice thing about these is they do help me with my chaos. You know what I'm saying? Ba -dum, ba -dum. Let's put that there. So I can just put hide in there. Um... We'll put a mining box. I don't know I don't know how I feel about the mining one. I feel like the stuff that's already crafted is kinda of helpful. Um one for blood crystals. Okay. Okay. Uh a wood cutting one would be good. What do I need? More shaped wood. <laughs> Let's make more. I usually set it to craft everything and then I just take some out so it removes that from the queue, personally. Alright, let's put anything like Ica in our benches. Got so much stuff. Um, return things to where they belong. Can't f uh, find it odd you can't put sap in the wood. Yeah, I agree with you. And like seeds? Can you put seeds in the foraging benches yet? I feel like that's a bit silly. Facts. Let's make sure we're just kind of processing things. Um, I'm going to drop this chair because I don't want to use it decoratively. I've got a lot of these things here. Anything that isn't full health, I'm going to get rid of. Okay, right, armor, armor, armor. That was the thing I wanted. Okay, make some of those. Let's do the box for armor first, shall we? Because I'll forget about it. So I need to learn the chest, probably. Chest, 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 chest. There it is. Do, 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 do. Um, and we'll put this next to the next to the armor's bench as well. No seed for yeah, no seed foraging box. Yeah, I think that's kind of silly. Oh, good. Look at you fit in there. Perfect. Sweet. Okay, so any armor. So we're going to be wearing our heavy Pictish war chief now. Okay. Oh, we've got some more treasure here. I assume I can't place that necklace. I assume it just goes in the box. No. So it just goes in here. I didn't see this until chapter two. I didn't even see it in the beta. I didn't think I noticed. 
Um, so how much are we up to? 5,500. Level 3 still. Cool. Excellent. Um, I might put the shield in with the armour. I'm going to drop the bungos. Uh, right, hide we can put in skinning box. Nice. Can't put silk in there. Can't put feathers. Put the feathers in the carpenter's bench. This is going to be an ASMR tidying stream now, chat. No? Um, um, bam, blood crystal. I can put the blood crystal box. Bam, bam. Um, bone. You can go in here for now. Twine. No room. Okay. I'm going to convert one of these to silk in my inventory. I should have been doing that while I was just standing around, actually. It's crafting so fast. I have crafting on fast, okay? Don't judge me. Okay. Can I put... Let's put this stuff in here. The skinning box. Will it do hides that have already been processed? No, it won't. Hmm. Let's put it in the tannery then. Save a bit of space. And the silk can go in there too. Now we can take our armour out. And I want to make armour reduction kits in the tanner's bench. Ha has anybody else experienced... Um, how is the lag since the update today, the hotfix? Is it working pop uh, better? What's your experience like? Um, armour reduction kits. Let's pull in enough for like 10 maybe. So I'm going to put one of these on each piece of my armour and we'll have some spare. Ebony silk. Does it count as treasure now, does it? I feel like someone said that to me. I still find it hard to can't put sap. No yeah, foraging yet. How does the Valheim server work? Can anyone join? Anyone can join. You need to add, be added to a whitelist. You have to uh, raise a ticket in the Discord. That's about it. But yeah, if you want to be added, you can, you're can. you welcome to join us. I was non-existent um, a bit ago when I log logged in. Good. Good, good, good. About to fire up my man's guy. Cool. I need to continue my No Man's Sky playthrough. I don't know when to do that then. Okay. So let's reduce the weight of these. We'll get better stats on this armour if we craft them with an armourer. But we don't have one yet. We don't have any friends yet, friends. Okay. But Anna, you haven't changed at all. This is what it looks like. Be careful not to click into these little boxes. That looks kind of cool. Like, no pants. No. Yeah, this is what it looks like. It's from the Savage Frontier DLC. This is my probably my favourite armour. Especially because um I like to dye it. I've got like I've got like a necklace on, so it's like covering my neck. But I like to dye it. Um, I like to dye this like Sumerian blue and this white, or I like to dye this black and this black and just have it all like really opaque black. It's very cool. I like it. Um, shall we stay, yes, yeah, stay transmogged? Yeah, why not? This is fashionist that enables me to do this, otherwise you need to use sorcery to transmog each piece. Okay, sweet. Oh, still in vanity mode right let's get rid of things from our inventories and we need to assess how much it, how much weight we can carry we might need to put another point into expertise um to put people into the friendship wheel need to put people into the friendship wheel you mean just generally in life do, 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 do. there we go in here and then I'm gonna put the shield stuff in the in here. What is our armor value now? Four hundred and eighty heavy. Um. Don't yog. Okay. Shield stuff. Don't want that sword. What is that? What is the stats on that now? Eight and five. Yeah. No, thank you. 
I'm probably going to drop these claws as well, even though they look kind of cool. I could transmog them onto my daggers. Perhaps. Yeah. Oh, no. <laughs> I thought he was going to do it then. I don't know why. I guess it's just a different type of weapon. No. Okay. This is the same thing. Transmog for, like, fashionist for the weapons. It's kind of cool. Um, all right. Right, let's get rid of anything we don't need. We're going to go get ourselves into the dregs. Um... got heels. Could put the golem parts somewhere. Could do with a box for golem parts. Uh, where do we put that? Do, do, over here. So we craft one of those. Okay. Um, I just need to dump a bunch of stuff now. Demon blood into the alchemist bench. Seeds can go in the cooking area. Where do I get a wheel of pain in real life? Asking for a friend. I only know of wheels of friendship. I don't know of any wheels of pain. So I, I couldn't help you with that. Um, yeah. I find avoiding people to be like the easiest. So why would you like to... Well, why do you want to recruit people when there's like people there? You know what I mean? No. Uh, let's put these in here. Snacks ready. Let's just make sure we have one stack. Okay, so we want the bow. We want that. Um, bugs can go in there. Seeds can go in there. Bones, we could grind into uh, bone meal, which is kind of helpful. Vines will save for the horse we haven't yet got. That's another thing I was going to get is a horse. Okay. So in that case, I think what we'll do is we'll take uh, we'll take a horse stable, we'll take a saddle, we'll go get a horse, we'll convert the horse, and we will ride it to wherever we're going. Hello, rookie. Hello, welcome in. Good to see you. Thank you for the follow. All is good. Yes, having a great time. This part about sorcery was having my heavy helmet look like shiny earrings. Yes, definitely, absolutely. If you're not doing mods, then it's such a freaking it's wonderful. It's wonderful. Um, yeah, so let's learn horses, shall we? Stably stuff. Um, horse situations. We're gonna need to- I'm worried about weight though, that's the only thing. Transporting it. Hmm. Uh, unless we, like, place it where we're going. Let's learn the things anyway. Stable, stable, stable. Because we really need a horse to, like, get around. Stable master. Okay, so we need to learn friendship. Thrall taker. And then stable master. Okay. Um, so now we should be able to make... Can we make the the armour bench for the, the saddlery? Is it saddle something? Saddle. Could already make it. Novice saddle maker. There we go. So we learned the saddle bench. Okay, so what do I need for... Let's put, like, a box down for this stuff to come with us. I used to always have like a go box if I needed like, uh, when I played on a server. So we want like saddle things uh, or stable master things, I guess. Companions, stables. Do I have the mats? No, apparently not. So I pressed uh, caps and it didn't pull in. So I need just one piece of twine, okay? Bit of twine. Twine, 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 twine. Maybe I need to craft some twine. Okay. Wow, the fast crafting speed is great. When the game goes, like, quiet, just for, like, a brief second, does anyone else think that, um... It's going to crash. Does someone else have that paranoia? Like, uh oh. Just like the music pauses for a moment. 
Just me. So what else am I missing? Twine shaped wood brick. I should be able to carry that actually. Yep. 15, 10, 10. Yep. Okay, so we've got that for the for this. Now we need to make a saddle bench. Saddler's workshop. And what am I missing from that? Um more twine. Okay, let's make loads of twine. At a speed of knots. We've got fastest fingers in the West. Portal Matt's box, that's it, yeah. Learning horses. Head of horses, I see. I see myself out. Ugh. Uh, corner kiwi. Um, yep, yep, yep. Making friends is so hard now. Ooh. Yes, to put people in friendship meal. Lag was non existence. Yeah. Um, okay, we can make a saddle thingy. I would like to put it next to the, the armor stuff, but I don't want to put it in front of the coffer, dude. Well, I guess we'll put it over here. There we go. Sweet. Now I want to make a saddle so I can ride my horse back. Just need one of those. Okay, now I need more twine. Story of my life. There we go. Craft a saddle. Perfect. And hopefully, maybe we can carry both of them and process the horse. Um, we leveled up. Okay. Prepare to defend a hit level 30. Nice. That's like 10 levels already today. It pulled the mats in. Fudging fudge. It pulled the mats in from that box. Um, okay, now I have the mats again. So can I... I can carry all this stuff. That's good. So I've got what I need for the horse. Brilliant. Perfect. I'm excited. Good, good, good. Okay. So let's get rid of any, like, um, these spell things. Oh, God. Do we make a box for sorcery? Um, wait, I can pick block. And then I can press caps to pull the mats in. Perfect. I love that for me. Okay, so anything sorcery in here. So we make a thaumaturgy bridge. We haven't learnt sorcery yet. I'll have to do that as well. Uh, dried wood I can put in the, the cook, uh, campfire. I've got to make sure I don't get rid of any mats yet. Did I... Do I have what I need for the freaking horse thing? Just double check. I haven't used it. It's going to be like the story of my life now. Yeah. <laughs> Caps lock. Okay, I've got it again. <laughs> got it again. No more crafting, Anna. Oh, God. Okay. I think we're good now. I can leave a weathered skull. I'm going to definitely leave that. Let's name this sorcery. Sweet. We're going to need weathered skulls. So I chose Zath as a religion for this playthrough as well. Bear that in mind. So hopefully getting weathered skulls will be a lot easier. Uh, we've got the sorcerer skulls. They don't have any use anymore. Uh, cloth pouch. How did I get? Oh, I killed a sorcerer. That's right. Um, okay. We have what we need in order to um, grab ourselves a horse. We've got some vines to give it for healing, uh, health, or whatever. I can leave those feathers behind in my bench here. I don't want to leave anything else. Don't need crystal. Don't need that. Okay, I think we're good, friendos. Got my bow. We're going to go to the north for this. Because I like to go up north. We're going to go here to the, uh, what is it called? The, uh, here? Question mark? Oh well, I'll show you. <laughs> I do like this new rescue friendo mechanic. Be nice to have a dungeon to a high value rescue at the end. Hmm. Super delayed. Super delayed if it if it is working. What is that, Kel? Um, the voice thing. What what voice thing? Squirrel. Okay. So we're heavily armoured. We can carry what we've got. We're going to go get ourselves a horse. We're going to process it. We've got vines to process it as well. Um, we could do with getting some water on the way, but we're going to run up through some water. We've got that. We've got heels. Brilliant. Let us effing go. Up north. 
What what is it, Kel? Did you try doing Tangier? There's something not working. Tangier is turned on. It's not working. Isn't it? Interesting. Sorry about that. I don't know why it wouldn't be. Oh, I hear it. I heard test. Did you hear that? All I turned on was music. I just clicked the I for music on my OBS. That's weird. The other one was the other one was better. Oh, I'm sorry, lovely. I don't know if there's anything I can do about that. So you didn't hear the previous one. Um, which is my best path. Let's get up to, yeah, we'll go to the savannah, like, little pathway thingy. Try it again. Okay, love. Sorry about that. All right, friendos. We're in heavy armor, at least, now. We're going to meet some wolves on the way. They're quite dangerous. Bum, ba, da, dum. Do, do, do. So, yeah, we could learn, like, maps. We could place maps down, things like that. But a horse is just <coughs> going to be very handy <coughs> on a solo world. Excuse me for coughing. Da, ba, da, bum. Yeah, so the only thing I did was I turned the music thing on. Um, maybe that's what I could do. Maybe if I get Tangier to come through the music thing instead of SFX, then I could add, I can make it like louder. Hmm. Squirrel. Somebody said to me in a YouTube comment, are you just randomly saying squirrel, the word squirrel? And I said, seems unlikely, that would be absurd. Is that gaslighting chat? <laughs> didn't see it in the chat either, yeah. Probably just didn't process, mm-hmm, yeah. Yep. Mm. Why didn't I hear that? Did you hear that squirrel? What is going on? That's so weird. Did you hear Squirrel, Valk? Nope. What is going on? That's so weird. Hmm. Sound alerts aren't working. Because I didn't hear that hello there. I don't get it. Hmm. It's being it's being buggy, I suppose. Uh, Kifuri, thank you for the follow. Yeah, I don't know what to do. Right, we're going to run along here. We're going to take a path. Oh, look, that thing's still in the sky. We're going to ignore that because it's a trap. Uh, we're going to have to run past... Two world bosses. Uh, Erendold, thank you for the follow. Welcome, everybody. We're doing a movie night in our Discord on Friday, 10.30 UK, um, which is 5.30 East Coast US. So if you want to join the Discord, everybody's welcome. You don't have to be a subscriber. You're just welcome to join us. We watched Dune last week, and it was very cosy. So we're going to watch The Goonies. I didn't tell you the movie. Yeah, we watched Goonies, which is a favourite of mine. Said your squirrel is out of stock. Well, that's because somebody managed to press on it, click on it. Um, but it, it's not sounding. What are we going to do with our sound? They were working at the beginning of the stream. Why weren't they working now? That is a weird thing. Base. <laughs> yes. Is that the demon tiger? No. Just a regular one. I'm very suspicious of the tigers. The demon tiger scares the poops out of me. Hi, sir. Hi. Oh, 
Ooh, I completed a challenge. A challenge. Ooh. Okay. I'm not going to pick anything up. I'm just going to run to the north, get myself a horsey. Probably two horses, and the horse can carry the other horse. Don't hear it either. I don't know why it's not playing. It doesn't make any sense, because I haven't changed anything. That's what's weird. Yeah. If I could change one thing about this game, and only one, and I realise I can speak from privilege because my game is currently w working properly, so I apologise if you've got something major in your game that isn't working, but I would change that when I click off the screen, the game played in the background, because I find it really disruptive. Um, you should be able to just click off. I want it, I'd like a toggle. I have mentioned this to him. I would love that so much as a streamer. I really like it because I don't want it to go to suddenly like be like noisy background noise and then suddenly like complete silence and then noisy background noise again. I find it kind of jarring. Yeah. Since Mr. Jackson won't say it, I always put people in boxes. It helps me set their personality. The annoying box for annoying people. The bad box, impatient box, screaming box. But then the government told me to stop because that wasn't how you ran a daycare. Calendros Horner for being a nutcase. <laughs> Neville's like, come on down, the cookies are warm, <laughs> the beer is cold. <laughs> oh dear. Okay, let's go get a horsey. So we're running through here, there's a little like pathway if you're new to the game. It's a little pathway here, which can help you get to the north, otherwise you have to like climb a lot of steep things. Um, or you could go like through other places, but it's a good little entrance way to the north highlands. It's one of my... I really, really love the north, like the northern biome. It does rain a lot, though. Thank you for demonstrating, game. It does rain a lot, so I have to be in the mood for rain. It's quite nice, isn't it? What's your favourite biome, chat? Which one do you prefer? Hello, sir. So these, um, these boars... You harvest them with a cleaver, you'll get pork. And that pork is very handy. Um, just cooked pork on its own gives you your th uh, followers, fighters, a 25% strength weapon damage boost. And if you salt it, it'll give you 15%. Uh, uh, you can't get this 25% like your friendos. Um, I don't have a cleaver. We're being kind of minimalistic. I should have... I kind of failed myself, actually. Because... Um, we really could do with getting some pork. But then it's not very far. I could just make a, like a little stone cleaver. Dun, dun, dun. Ah, the rain is quite nice. Um, do you have any twigs anywhere? I think there's like wolves up there. Let's get a tree. Do, 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 do. Dun, dun. Branches is all I need. Oh, it's cosy. Oh, I need more twigs. Now we've got a cleaver. So I'm going to get a bit of pork. Doo -doo. There you go. Pork, exquisite meat, wild boar head. Some regular steaks. Sweet. Alrighty. So you can make the salted pork once you uh, have made a, a stove, um, but the cooked pork rinds you can just make um, for your thralls, uh, just in the campfire. Just cook it like a regular meat. 
Hello, Kudo. I need some... Well, not Kudo. Elk, sorry. I need some horns. You got any horns for me, bud? Yeah. We're gonna need those for our followers. I should keep the heads, really, um, for blood. Because they don't decay, which is kind of nice. Oh, there's a boss. This guy's kind of aggro. It's a bit of a wally. Grab Azura's glory. What for my horse? Vine. I got vines on me. Angel, thank you for the prime. Thank you very much. Put them in. Did I drop my? Did I leave my? Oh, I've got my vines here. Oh. What for the healing for a second? Yeah, vines are fine. I love the lower north just beyond the wall, like all of it from mounds all the way to the aqueduct hmm lovely thank you so much for joining us as long as it doesn't rain inside anymore it doesn't rain inside anybody um has, has it been raining indoors for you recently they did get rid of that as soon as they changed that suddenly it was like oh i can build a castle and feel immersed in the game you know um as but as it doesn't butt inside anymore oh gosh valkyrie's pulled out a lurk um, desert around Seth is my favourite. Yeah, Seth and Rue's lovely. Northern biome is good. Have to be in the mood for rain. Yeah, you do, definitely. Highlands always build here too. Yeah. Very cosy. Uh, fix the indoor storms. So I don't know. It but how long ago was that donut? Because it used to be that it always rained indoors. Then they changed it. Is the game super loud? Is it alright? Is it fine? I realise it goes silent when I click off. Um just want to get his horn if I can. Okay, piggy. Hello, sir. Sorry. There's a wolf over there. Scary guys. Okay. Um I'll drop the wood. Got to remember to keep everything for the horse stables. Um, makes it feel like home. Also, hello from North Wales. Hello, what a dice up here. Does that surprise you? Don't know. Last server. Oh, sh shining light. Oh, shizzle nits. Oh, poopies. Boobies, boobies. I say we played in my clan, we built in nothing but storm glass. And that just left rain too, like a sieve. That is a freaking dire wolf. They scare the absolute poops out of me. It's a bit like the, um, what is it called? It's a bit like the demon tiger. Kind of scares me. He wants your, he wants your sweet meats. He's so scary. I'm glad we're wearing heavy armor or we would have been dead, wouldn't we? Definitely. So scary. Right. Horses. Um, further up that way, right? Dun, ba, dun. Ooh. There he is. We should put down a bedroll, really. Famous last words. Dun, dun. The other good thing about playing on a server um, is remember, like, whenever we went to Sepham Room, there's, like, some Relic Hunter tomb raiders no relic hunter slave takers i think they are and they um they spawn with like a tier three armorer there's some of those that don't don't appear on single player i don't know why they don't i think it's just it's broken um there's a white wolf over there as well equally scared well equally dangerous he's more scary because he looks like he looks like heck super scary um mini boss Yes, is a mini boss. Yes, and my big base in Sky Home Ruins. The rain was very annoying, but yeah, inside back then. If you had your horse, you would have been fine. Thank you, Calendros. Thank you. <laughs> That's what we're here for, Calendros. Uh, thank you for stating me. Oh, what, what, what is it they say? What's your specialist specialist subject? The bleeding obvious. No. Um, Pre-war chapter two. It wouldn't rain inside a building. It wouldn't rain under a mountain. It would rain inside a building under a mountain. 
Yes. I think if, if you've built in a cave, um, I think the game gets confused as well. Like that kind of situation, it'll like storm, uh, sandstorm inside a cave, even though you're in a building. Like, I think it just gets kind of buggy and confusticated. Um, right. Should we try to avoid the white wolf and the dire wolf? They're so scary. Oh wait, I should put down a bedroll. Do I have hide? No, but I got a bedroll. Okay. Let's put it here. Mayhaps. There's no timers over there as well. Right, let's fill our water while it's raining and we'll buy all this water here. I remember. Water, water. Reach. Okay. Water is our friend. At least they fixed. They did fix the sandstorm in Dagon. Yes, they did. I'm very pleased about that. I would. So, if you've ever been in the water when the sandstorm is on, you can't see your friend. You can't see the direction you're going. That was a nightmare. Never mind like while you're fighting and stuff. But swimming in a sandstorm in the freaking dungeon is ridiculous. Yeah, I'm very glad they fixed that. About lemon time. <laughs> oh, it was a nightmare yeah so yeah so so is the common like is it is it raining inside your buildings again friends i would like to go over there i think there's a book there isn't there or i'm not mistaken it's a good way to get dyed though hello nordheimer friendos there's no book is there you're gonna hurt me i feel that Oh, pokey guy. I hate the pokey people. Yeah, there's a book. Yoink. Specialist cooking five. Got it. Bye. What's in there? Woo -hoo. But boxes and a steel, re a steel repair hammer. That, that was a war cry chat. Remember, I don't scream. I'm incredibly brave. Stop it! Please don't poke me in the butt. Sir... Madam, the sorcerer. Hi. Hi. She needs a tan, doesn't she? Thought about a bit of vitamin D, love. Is that is that disrespectful? I'm just gonna go and get the horse, right? I'm I'm gonna go out on a limb and say the horse should happen right now. Um. He's still following me. There you are. If you want to follow me up here, I'll fight you. I'm not coming down there. You have to come up here. Thank you. Super. All right. Uh, we're going the wrong direction, peeps. Bum, 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 bum. Right, we can take it on a wolf. I want to take on a dire wolf. There's a bunch in that little cave. Bum. As soon as we get a horse, life is going to be so much better. Right, we want to be under this damn thing, whatever you want to call it. Bridge. Aqueduct. That's the best place to get poked. Okay. Two weeks in a row, uh, more bit more videos. Badum, badum. But why not riding a rhino? Do you know what? I haven't been on a rhino since Sitter first came out. Isn't that funny? I forget that they're a thing. I mean, they're not very manoeuvrable or very quick, are they? Does anyone who uses the rhinos? Sound off, friendos. Type one if you use a rhino. Uh, for for like as a mount. Hello, sir. Ah, oh, shizzle nets. Okay, there's too many. Horsey! I see a horsey! Okay, perfect. Don't you attack my horsey. If I can just lose aggro. And then we'll get that one there first. Convert him. Stop it. Oh, you little budge. Woo! Walk right. Oh crap, they're really scared of me now. Okay, we got one. <laughs> Woo! Walk <More> right. <laughs> In my defense, <laughs> I wasn't scared at all. I'm a warrior. Horsey. Okay, first horsey. 
let's let's just get this guy in a conversion thingy let's get you like indoctrinated as a friendo there we go perfect place for a stables if i say so myself of course he can go in there i'll give him some i'm gonna put one of these in here there we go We've got four minutes to go okay I don't think I changed through all crafting time just because um, we'll go get the other one to put in here because um, they've sped it up anyway. Yes, I think that's why I didn't change it. Oh, there's another one over there. I'll just do one at a time. Avoid the wolves. Um, you do? You do? Oh, okay, okay. I just think they're me. Yes, that's it. I say the other space, but I always have one. Do you? Clunky, they make up for that because they can attack. Yeah, yeah, fair enough. Maybe we get a rhino on this playthrough. I haven't used one, like I say, for such a long time. I actually forget they're a thing. But we'll be getting a new mount in Chapter 3, I think, they said on the dev stream. I believe. It was supposed to be in Chapter 2, but small delay. Bum, bum, bum. I'll put you in there. Bum, bum, bum. Ryan at the moment has 22,000 health. It's crazy, really. Um, Pleomorphic blue. Thank you for the follow. Um, I want, want to ride the giant rhino. Mm. Uh, what do you think the mount is going to be? You heard so many different ideas. What do you think? Chat, write in the chat. What do you think? The like, put your, pass, Cast your votes. What do you think the mount's going to be? Camel. Okay. Anything else? A wolf? Oh, I would love that. I really want... Oh, we had a bit of an art conversation earlier. I want, like, a thylacolio type situation. I want to be able to, like, scale the walls. I want to take full damage and be okay. I want a wolf, but let's be realistic here. Yeah. Bear. A bear would be very cool. An elephant would be very cool. A chariot. A chariot would be cool. New mount. Yog. You want to ride Yog. That would be pretty awesome. You want to put a saddle on Yog. You could be Yog, obviously. Has anybody tried the new... Um, the, has anyone tried Gods? I guess uh, at all in PvP or PvE since the updates. Because I know that they've um, extended the... They've reduced the damage by uh, by 10. And they've uh, multiplied the time that they last for by 10, haven't they? Have you used them? My horsey is like 57%. We're better off just waiting and putting this guy in, then we can use this guy straight away. We want a gargoyle, a gargoyle type mount. Um, new mount idea, big boy, a big boy thrall. Like um, thingy Pithecus, whatever is he called? Gigantopithecus or something in Ark. Not only, uh, not yet only using during challenges. Mm. We'll have to use a god in this, um, in this playthrough. What, to ride in a basket strapped to a front Fox <laughs> giant, I love that. That sounds so cool. Probably a golem you can ride. A golem you can ride would be kind of cool, yeah. Yeah. I'd love that. Come on, horsey. So this is like vanilla settings now. Blood, a bloodstone horse. Hmm. I mean, they could do skins for horses, I suppose. I don't like any of the reskins for the horses. Um. I've got to worry about those thingies respawning. Um, I do have, I do have like the Riders of Hyboria thing, so we'll do like a, I guess a white horse and a black horse. I don't like the white horse because it's this W I G H T white horse because it's too like scrawny and it's like saddle hangs off it. Um, I don't like the undead horse because it looks super gross. Yeah. A bunny, right? A bunny mount? No question mark. Dun, 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 dun. I never made the Ophid Ophidian magic cat. I don't think. I forget about all these things, honestly. I see them in the battle pass. I'm like, oh, we'll have to use that, and I forget about it. I never made the black lion. We did try the Arcanist of Zar one, which is kind of cool. 
Oh, we got him! Ah, uh, he's like um, he's like the light brown one. Should we should we get this one? Should we call him Maduro? Ah, uh, so beautiful. Hi, buddy. First friendo. There we go. Now you can carry stuff for us. Let's put this other horse in here. And we'll go get the other one. Okay. Horse friendo! Wait, let me let me name you. Oh wait, let me give you some vines. Sorry. I will keep um I'll keep one of these. Or like a couple. There we go. We'll keep a couple for converting more. Okay, let's go get that other horse. Where are you, horsey? I remember when they said they... So this is why... When they say they won't do stuff. Like, uh, give us an Unreal Engine 5 upgrade. Uh, oh, there's two over here. Perfect. I, um, I always like Exited Out because... Um, they said that we couldn't have mounts because it would like break the game and then they like you know they did some changes and then look we have mounts now they said they couldn't do sorcery um, and look at where we are um, so you know I'd like to think if it's yes boating would be cool too so yeah I would love to have boats obviously just maybe just on Sipta that'd be kind of cool um, we go. We've got a, ho a few horses now. We need spare horses just in case we have an accident. Okay, I think that's probably all the horses in this vicinity. Um, but yeah, like Unreal Engine Five upgrade is really think the thing that I'm looking forward to because I want this game to keep going. I want more maps as well. We've gained a bit of a bit of levels. He's healing up. Okay. Well, what do we do? We could go for like a little adventure and we'll come back for this horsey. The other two we can just carry. These guys. Um, let me mark this location. Or we could just leave the stables here. Couldn't we maybe? With a horse in it ready in case we get stuck. Maybe. No, it's not. No, it's not. If you listen to what I said, I said they say that we couldn't. They couldn't do mounts. They they said that they uh, we they wouldn't be able to do sorcery or you know we just got kind of like necromancy vaguely, didn't we? Because we got those corrupted creatures. Um, and I'm so I'm holding out for like when they say that they can't do something, I'm like mm, maybe maybe they could, you know, if it's like financially viable. Okay, were you Freya or Dina? Dina. I always forget. It's a good archer. Oh, she does a lot of damage. My horse is so pretty. I'm so happy. She freaking hit like a truck, didn't she? There we go. We got a heart of a hero. Taxidermied elk. We've got some veneer stuff. Lovely. Put that on a dancer. Sweet. Oh, look how pretty he is. As the moon just very naturally just sails across the sky. Like it's on a freaking speed track. Because I have I have my night set up really quick, in case you're wondering. Okay, where should we go to, friendos, before we head back? I do wanna do I do wanna do the dregs. Do we do it now? Or do we just go back and get the dregs done? Or do we do something up here first? Um can't just copy and paste. Oh no, I know, I know. Spaghetti code and all that. Let's take a rewrite. Yep, yep, yep. I know that's what they said. You just got here. That's okay, that's okay. This game needs the arc treatment new maps in through all enemy types every year. Yeah, we need new. Yeah, definitely. I agree with you. Yep. So said we can't get carty. <laughs> you really you want a cart. Horses can eat the leavening agents and it's always going to. Yeah, mm hmm. You can see what they can eat. Um, just here. They can eat all this. Zora's Glory, Leavening Agent Hops, Shades Bites Highland Berries, Greyfell Lupine, 
desert berries, seeds, vines, bark and hannah berries. This food here will always be the 10 heals per second food uh, for any animal or for your fighter. Um, but obviously these gives different kind of buffs and the vines give a uh, 14% chance of leveling and vitality. So it's kind of the best thing for your horse if you want a lot of health, because that's really the only thing that matters for horses. Um, what do we do? Let's go back because we want to do the dregs so and we won't have time to do it if we don't do it now. Got to get, get on. The horse is ready. Should we take this horse with us? Should we take it or should we leave it here? Because then we've got a spare horse. What do you think? Why are people carrying random taxidermy animals? I know. I mean, Dina makes slightly more sense because she's a hunter. I don't know. Um, but given how much they weigh, check to see if the tearful blacksmith wound up Freya's house. Yeah. I mean, there's a bunch of places that, uh, what's she called? Uh, what is the name of the berry? Berry? Spawns. Careful how far north you go from here or you run into a rotten branch. I know this map very, very, very well. I have 7,000 hours in this game. Um, take the horse and use it as a poop farm. Yeah, well, we've got more horses, that's the thing. Yes, the only thing is I would need to... I would need to make another stables because I've got all these other horses. And I don't have a fridge, so I'd want to kind of process them. It's like, are you going to leave me here? It's raining. See what we can do with our space. Let's make sure we give you your vines. Okay. Let's go. No man left behind. Alright, let's get back. Shall I use my little mini map? I house have one. Do I need to reset it though? Yeah. How do we feel about that? I have to remove, like, redo it. I don't like it up there. It's a bit too intrusive. I like it bottom right hand corner. Um, okay. I'll work on that off stream at some point. Um, 690 butts. <sighs> Exposed. Da -da -da -da. Doo -doo -doo. Right. Let's head home. So sinkhole, yep. I just have to, I was like, wait, where do we live? The problem with starting a new playthrough every chapter is that occasionally I go, where do I live on this world? <laughs> you know? Horse is going to level up. Horse has already got 7,000 health, which is lovely. Hi. I don't have a lot of stems. Just regen. Come on, regen. The horse is like old school uh, human like player regen hasn't it um i guess yeah we'll go to we'll go back the way we came like simple maps it gives you everything the big map my house i mean i feel like hot house does doesn't it it gives you like the, con the context stuff how much how much better is it do, 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 do. Hey there, friendo. I feel like stocking up an iron. Look at all this lovely iron. Nice thing about the highlands. Hello, bear friendo. Hi, I see you. I like you. I don't want to be friends right now because I feel like you might hurt me when you cuddle me. Just a little hunch. How many of you have bears, like, outdoors, near where you live? It's such a crazy thought to me as a Brit. Because there's nothing outside. I mentioned this before. I, sometimes I repeat myself. But there's, like, nothing outside that could hurt me, except maybe standing on a hedgehog late at night. Do you know what I mean? I mean, I feel like the hedgehog would probably do a good job of avoiding me. Um, you know, there are, like, urban foxes and things, and generally foxes, but they won't hurt us. So it just kind of, like, boggles my mind that there's, like, a bear outdoors. Or, like, a, I don't know... A dingo, you know what I mean? Various places. 
ding wait sorry a dingo you know like a dingo um it doesn't i mean i see so i when i use my um so i i haven't seen the other one so i don't know the difference obviously i don't know what you've got that this one has but i like the fact that it shows it shows this it's i can see what i can see on the map you know um seen bears here in orlando how are you we have black bears here in mountain lion see you they're forced to be introducing wolves around here really goodness me so yeah i mean the reason to not let a cat outside in this country is because it get hit by a car and i definitely wouldn't be able to let my cat out because of that but i can't imagine like being somewhere where you have to worry about like scary creatures eating your children and pets do you know what i'm saying kind of boggles my mind but how wonderful to have nature the way it's kind of you know a bit more the way it was supposed to be can i get through here I think if you ask me wolves should be should be part of nature mm? Ooh, that was interesting felt like we had, we had a little wobble in alligators do you i can't i just like the idea of there just being alligators outside look at this procession what happened to three people attacking me at the same time Hurting a lot of people right here. Yeah. yeah. Fight the power, brother. Do do. Ba -da. Do 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 do. Da -da. Hmm. I wonder what we're going to do with our pyramid. Do we build more inside? Do we put more pillars in these? Or maybe like more mezzanines and things make it more interesting because i kind of want to like shape it a little bit um sorry didn't mean to get you in the butt um kind of want to make it more epic obviously when we when we decorate it with the battle pass stuff it'll be cool but i don't have that yet da -da. Do -do -do. Okay, let's go past here. I always mess up the way back to the sinkhole. I don't know why. There we go. I travel around the map and I like remember all the like big fancy bases I've seen on servers i've been on in the past anyone else like that you're like oh i remember somebody had a giant base up there and no I don't know how you see the map now but it is nice like it is nice to play solo um because if i was on a server with other people i wouldn't be able to just build wherever i feel like i would have like oh there's a person in this dungeon i don't i just you know prefer playing solo on stream simpler easier predictable i like it Humankind is part of nature. I see sick people advocating for intuition wolf here. No extra things to account for. I mean, reintroducing things is obviously like a is like a big question, I suppose. That is like uh, that is that is, it is interference in its own way, I suppose. Yeah. But yeah, you have to think about everybody's safety first. I think. Okay. It's gonna take the my favorite way into into the house. Right, let's get the horse in. Yay! Brando! Right, let's put you on stand here. Ah, he is outside, Maduro. Be quiet. He's already got 8,300 health. That's so good. Oh, excellent. Well, we got you so we could go to the... Um, what's it called? Um, shall I make some... Shall I make some buffs? Can I make um, salted pork already? Um, I did level. Let's put some points in strength. Can I make a... I can make a stove. Do I need to learn the recipe for the salted pork? Should we make the stove, friends? Um, let's learn the bonfire. And then the stove. 
I don't know if I need to learn a recipe. I can't remember. I'm going to make the stove anyway. And I have this cute one. Um, this one here, which is like, was in was it in the bazaar? It was given to me by Funcom. Thank you to them. Do I have the mats? I need some regular stone. Can I cook all my stone? Easily remedied, I guess. Living where we do. Follow me, friendo. Um, can I clear out your inventory? Ooh. Okay, let's put the heads in the... What is it called? Oh, we can put the other horse here as well. I'm probably going to change the colour of that horse. It's not my favourite. Um, fluid press. There we go. There's some more blood so we can respec when we need to. Um, oh God, I want to change the colour of this horse before I place it. Um, do we make it into a black horse? This guy here. I need to make tainted fodder. I haven't made any gruel yet. Aloe leaves. I've got aloe leaves. I need to make gruel. I can do that quite quickly. Right, seeds and um, plant fibre in a campfire. And that'll make gruel. Just switch it on. I need a little bit. Okay. Da -da -da -da. And it's the Riders of Hyboria DLC that allows you to make a black horse or a white horse from any other horse. So you do it in your inventory. Um, wait, not you. In here. Tainted fodder. There you go. We'll make one of those. And then I can make... I need the horse in my inventory as well. There we go, and we can make a black horse. There we go. Let's place that one there. It'll last like 24 hours, um, unless you put it in a, um, like a thrill pot or a fridge, <laughs> which sounds absurd. Um, we could convert the other ones as well. How long do they have on them? 24 hours. I guess we will. I guess we'll put down a little, like, table briefly. And we'll remove it. We have plenty of room in here. Crafting stations, companions, stables. Do I have room? Somewhere, maybe. Maybe I have to do it outside. I feel like we should... Yeah, 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 yeah. Did it for a second. There it is. Love it. Thank you for that. Was that better? So delayed. Um, oh wait, so that's the one from earlier. Oh god, did you did it get louder? Because I adjust the volume in my slider when it. So what I could do is when it goes bloop, I could uh, I could like increase it. But I don't want all the other like sounds to kind of go super loud. That's the thing. The volume was good. Okay, so yeah, when I hear like bloop, I'll like just increase it quickly for now until we get better. Okay. All right, let me convert these horses. Let's go, friendos. Um, do I have anything oh, that they'll eat? A desert berry, maybe. Oh, but it take ages. Okay, okay, we've seen how long it takes. I'm going to speed up time. Oh god, am I? Am I? Yeah, my fatal error. Fatal error. We crashed, friendos. Poops. Hopefully, the game shuts down quickly this time because it fatal errored. Has anyone that had, else had that? Balls. I put the BRB screen on. I'm still here. We're just waiting for it. But somebody said I should put something on the screen. Let me have some water while I wait for the game to shut down. Tids.
it takes so long to shut down more videos so yeah i thought okay that's fine it's i think i think it's quicker if you get a fatal error i just dropped my water bottle okay start hmm Went to stare, but I want to stare into the black void of nothingness. Lovely. Happy to see. Yes, that's why we have the BRB screen on Calendras. <laughs> right, continue. Oh, friends. Ba -ba -dum -bum. Do do do. Do 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 running it's starting up friends oh game i don't know why it did that i think i was just doing too many things too quickly It's starting, attempting to join game. Okay. We are back in the game. Let me just put my code in. Okay. We're back, peeps. Okay, so I was going to change the server settings um, so that crafting speed for thralls was really quick. Thrall crafting time multiplier. So now it won't work for this one that's already in here, but the next one it should do, which is good because we ain't got all day, my friends. Uh, am I leaving? What do you mean, am I leaving? No, no, we're just restarting. The, the game crashed, that's all. We're back. The, the sounds are still not working. What is going on? It's so weird. Yeah. I am streaming through Restream at the moment, though. Um... Which I don't need to be, so next time, hopefully, maybe that's why it's kind of janky. Sorry, lovely, I don't know what to do. Should I turn off sound requests? Maybe I should do that. Um... Uh, viewer rewards, rewards. Um, wait, I'm looking at the wrong thing. Channel points. Manage rewards. I'll just turn off rewards for now. How do I turn off everything at once? Um... Oh well, I don't know how to do it. I don't think there's a button for me to do for all of them. I'm not going to do it individually, it's going to take too long. So just know that the sounds aren't working properly at the moment. Buyer beware. There you go. Use at your own risk or whatever. Okay, let's convert this one. This should be really quick now. Four minutes to go. Is it quicker? No, I think so. Either way, we've, we've got everybody placed now. So let's put this guy. So this is just a regular colour. Um, I might make that into a white horse then. Doo -doo -doo -doo. 
What's going on here? Am I crashing again? Nope. Okay. Um, right, let's make a white horse. Do do. Or shall I make a different, like a weird looking horse? What do you think? So I do like the the blue dude. Shall we do the blue dude? Maybe? Sorceress. Should we do that? Why not? Let's do it for once. Um, can I turn him into a camel? No. That'd be kind of fun though. Um, so I need to make sorceress pet food. Sorceress. That one. Does that expire? Yes, it does. In 60 hours. Okay, let's make the weird looking horse. Sparkly horse. This guy. There we go. Weird looking horse. We'll call him like weird horse or something. How did we get him? Was he, I think he was like a level 60 on the battle pass or something. This is another thing. Okay, so in single player, I can place them like right next to each other. I gotta remember that I can't in uh, on a server. Oh, you can get on them without a um, saddle. I forgot. Oh, interesting. Uh, that's kind of cool. Okay, this might be my new favorite. I can use a no saddle. They changed it. Pretty yours, level sixty, battle pass. Yeah. Do you know what? I clicked on it and I kind of didn't realise. I guess you can put a saddle if you want to. Is, is this what they used to do? Ride around their own pyramids. <laughs> that one you can. Interesting, but I, I, it's already levelled up. Can I put the saddle on him? Medora's like, don't take my saddle. No, you. okay, so they changed it. Oh no, you can put it on. If you want to. Interesting. But it no longer sags, which is cool. Okay. Well, I like that because I didn't use it because I thought it just looked a bit silly. How do I get the... He's got my saddle, friendo. Sir? Is that a bug? Did I get it back? Sir, you stole my saddle and now you look silly. I don't want the saddle on you. How do I do it? Just doesn't have the square. You can't take it away. Oh, I hate that. He looks silly now. What can I give him a different one? I might I might actually like Am I going to break bonds? It's called stuck with it. Correct. <laughs> oh my god. Is it doing it multiple times now, Kel? It's like, um... It, it's like repeatedly doing it. That's so weird. He looks stupid. I want to, like, get rid of that. Right, let's get rid of this. Okay. There was a horse in it. Oh, such a bad stable person. I didn't get my mats back. Oh, it did. Okay. Okay, I'm glad I got my horse back. Usually it says you can't dismantle something because there's a creature in it. Okay. Alright, horsey, sorry about that. Yeah, I, I don't want that white horse with that thing on. It looks so stupid. Um, can I make another... Where's the horse thingy? By the food. Send it twice. That's alright, lovely. No problem. Looks for the bits. There's that old comparison that we had. Um, 
I prefer the scout saddles generally. Um, maybe we try something new. I have never tried the Ophidian Magi saddle. It's kind of crazy. I don't. I just don't want anything on this on the white horse though. So I guess we'll do this one if we can. Yeah. And I'm gonna break bonds with that other one because he looks stupid. Yeah. We'll make another one. Da -da. Doo -doo. Oh, sorry, friend. You look kind of crazy. Oh, I got the saddle back. Sweet. I did get the saddle for breaking bonds. There we go. Okay, saddle for you. Saddle for you. Right, now we've got a spare black horse. For in case of emergencies. We'll call you Knight, like usual. Because I am creature of habit and I lack imagination when it comes to names. Alright, wonderful. And then that guy will turn into... Unless it's a grey horse, because I love the grey horses. That's like my favourite. If it's a grey horse, we'll, uh, you know. Okay, perfect. Let's get ourselves ready to go do the dregs. Excellent. Let's cook some pork for ourselves. Oh, I was going to make the... I was going to make the stove, wasn't I? Cooking... I needed stone for it. Okay, let's go get some, like, remembering what I was doing now. Right, let's go get um, some stones. Let's get rid of this stuff. Need to give you back your vines. We'll pick up some more vines for you as well, bud. You can have the berries. Do, 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 do. Okay, armor. Where are we going to put armor stuff? We need some of a spare weapons blacksmith bench, I guess. We got an ancient bow from someone. Do I want to use that? Eight. Maybe, yeah. I don't know who I got it from. This is way much. Mm. May as well just take it. Okay, I'm going to dump some things. Yes, food in the blacksmith bench. Everybody puts it there. It's not just me. And then pork can go... Okay. Let's go get some stone. Oh, it's like pulling teeth, isn't it? Ooh. so much nicer once you get a horse so much easier to kind of just go gather for things Oh, I love our pyramid now. So cool and weird. Okay. Stone. Got enough of that. Perfect. Oh, that noise is so satisfying. Okay, now we can make our stove. We'll put it next to this food situation. Next to the door, maybe. Okay, now I need to put some fuel in it. Um, the only thing is, yeah, you can't put, you can't bring fuel in from um, using Unlock Plus, as far as I know. Um, so we, yeah, we can't make the, we can't make the salted pork. Let me remind myself where we learned that. I don't know if it's like mounds or something. Salted pork. Bup, bup, um. Um, specialist cooking one. Is it nearby? Because those look like bug type things, our furry things. I don't remember where we learnt it. Specialist cooking one. Um, 
it's in the it's in the it's in the summoning place. Yeah, it's in the summoning place. Let's go get it. Minus like sidetrack again. Oh yeah. Okay. Into the summoning place. If I can find the door. Let me leave the stone here. We'll use that to make salt after. Okay, let's go get some go get our recipe. Da 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 Come on, horsey. Our intrepid friendo. So I won't be able to make black lotus potion yet, but a little bit of a damage buff will be kind of nice. So now I have three perks in strength. Uh, well below 50%, I'll deal 25% more damage and gain 100% armor. I mean... I don't want to be in that situation, but I'll do a lot more damage because of all these points. Hi there. This guy should be one hit now, that's good. Sweet. I'm going to check when they drop, actually, because um, I, forget. I forget they've completely changed loot. Ooh, we've got a... A yog of a skull of yog? Some berries. I like berries. Hi! Oh, he's so noisy. Ooh, yeah. Bit kite. War paint. Wraps. I'll take it. Hello there. I'm here to modify you. Go quietly and all that stuff. Shy shadow, whatever. I don't want those. I do want the arrows. Uh, a shrunken head. Chat. Chat. Oh, it's treasure. <laughs> I just got a sunken head. A shrunken head. <laughs> I've never seen that before. Place really intimidating me. Yeah, it's so intimidating. Yeah, it was cool. Um, oh, I love that I can one hit them now. Sweet. Hey, it. Is it over by the cook? Over there, maybe. Hi. Oh, stop making a fuss. Just a little wallop on the head. Ooh, human flesh is kind of cool. Ooh, a spider! A taxidermy spider. So that is where I'm seeing the hidden daggers can spawn. She's very good. Oh, can I get you? Oh, I'm afraid. War cry. It was a war cry, chap. I was warning him. Ooh. Ooh. Okay, taxidermy stuff I do not want. Where's the, is that the book? There you go. Specialist cooking. Brilliant. Uh, lots of decorations I don't care about. Ooh. Pretty yog. We already learned that. I'll take the water orbs. The bed is very cool, actually. You're wandering around. Ceramic mug. Nah. Yeah. It's not really my style. Do you know what I'm saying? Right, that's all we wanted. We'll check if there's a yog priest over here or a witch doctor alchemist because they spawn right there. A yog priest. Okay, that's fine. We don't care about you. We're only after like fancy people because we're like super discerning. I don't think you're gonna be feasting upon me today, sir. Sorry to disappoint. Don't hit my fingers. Horse Friendo is like so helpful when you play solo. It makes such a difference. What is that? It's a taxidermied Komodo. <laughs> I want to pick it up. I don't know whether I'm going to use it. Speaker mask. Yeah, strength weapon. Okay. Sweet. Oh, 
wallop. Nice. Ooh, take that. Oh, poops. I'm gonna, I'm gonna leave the taxidermy stuff just this once, friends. Even though it looks kind of cool. You, you, you scare me. Okay, I'm not a one hit now. So I'm in heavy armor. Horse friendo, defend me. Look at that 140, 152, 168. Hits like a freaking truck. Spudo. Exotic flesh. Ooh, very nice. Clothing. I have horse friendo who can carry stuff for me now. Sweet. Let's get out of here, horsey, while the going's good. Is there anything we can learn here? I don't think so. Or steel. Nah. Pots. Don't care about your pots. Uh, ooh. Survival kit. I shall take you. Wind chimes. Mm, not today. Thanks for that. Oh, and a truncheon. Truncheon and bindings. That's good. Very nice, very nice. Oh, there's something here. I found a stone skinning knife. Okay, I take it. I take it like the loot goblin I am apparently today. Place a komodo outside one of the doors. Outside some butt. Yeah, put the komodo outside some butt, definitely. Excellent. All right, we got the recipe. We'll go make some salted pork. Screw all. I should take the feathers, really my arrows because I'm really doing a lot of shooting of bow today well not today but in this playthrough I should take the coal as well I'm just going to point out that I should take the coal and I'm going to leave the coal so we all know where we stand give them the device skill and stick oh I see yeah yeah I'll never make that though I even left the things behind Ta -da -bum -bum. oh it looks so good yeah. excellent pyramiding we had a taxidermied salamander in our coffer on the uh, on the playthrough the other day, didn't we? It was kind of fun. What do we get? Skull's cultist hood. Doesn't do much for us except it looks cool. Yeah. Now we need the armor volume. Squish the human flesh, make some blood for ourselves. Um, trophies we can't do anything with. Open the survival kit. Healing wraps. Lasting feast is a really nice drop. Love it. Shrunken head. I love it. So funny. Oh, what did we get? Oh, like a proper Maduro. Oh. Um, can I put that in there? No. I can put that in there. I can't believe you get a shrunken head. That is so fun. I love that they've done that. That's so cool. Can I place the skull of Yogg? Oh. Ah, so it teaches me... It just teaches me the religion. Consumable. See, I want to place it, though. Oh, I can place weathered skulls. Okay. You should be able to place sorcerous ones as well. I don't already even know. Okay. All right. Okay. Sweet. So now I should be able to make the salted pork. Yes, I can. So now I need to make a grind stone. Which is in general. Is it? I'm going to learn it first. Grind stone. So I'm going to grind up the stone and make salt. You can get the um, you can get the salt from various places from harvesting various things, particularly shattered springs if you want a lot of it. When you harvest brimstone up here, take a sandstorm mask because there's loads of AOE. Uh, what is it called? Gas. Um, we want this thing here. There we go. Put you next to this. And I can just get some salt from a stone. There we 
There we go. We can use the salt to salt the pork. Sweet. Keep. We could keep some of it. Um, we'll cook that in case we get a friend and we could give him a damage boost. Do do. Uh, will you let? Will it let you place the skulls? Skulls in the braziers. Like in these. Yep. Yeah. You want to RP as a as a creepy uh, sorcery dude? Yeah. The small ones about outside with. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. That's cool. Oh, you mean in these ones here? No. Could put one on our little... On our stove if we wanted to. It's kind of creepy. If you want to roleplay as a cannibal. I remember using grinder as a stone storage when I was first when I first learned to play. Ended with a lot of salt! Ah, oh. Yeah, that'll happen. <laughs> okay. Over there, buddy. Okay, salt in here. Salted pork. Switch it on. There we go. 15% strength weapon damage. Nice. It works out really nicely where we live. Excellent. So I can eat one of those. And it'll give me a boost to my strength. Um, we could deal with some more stone. I'm just going to grab a bit more so we can salt that pork before it goes off. Do, 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 do. Did I give any to the horse? No. No. It's kind of annoying though if you uh, harvest a bunch of um, stuff and then you accidentally store it in the... Is that, that doesn't give us a buff, does it? It's just food, yeah. Um, you store it in, a, in some somewhere it's going to transform into something else. You're like, no, I needed that. Yeah, so I can't use the Lasting Feast while I've got this salt uh, pork thingy active. Um, it'll just replace the buff. It's quite nice to carry that lasting feast around because it lasts like six hours and then you can use it in a pinch to give yourself more encumbrance.
do. do, do. can make iron into salt as well but it's a bit of a waste really I should just have like a bajillion iron I'm pretty sure you can correct me if I'm wrong chat a little bit more and we'll be all set up for the drinks the horse has got 8,300 health already I'm so pleased with that it's gonna be a nice meat shield for us Horse's like what <laughs> I mean <laughs> supportive companion that's what i meant to say i might do some like um i don't know columns or like like i don't know some squares on the side of this uh for the braziers kind of i don't know make some do some more embellishments to it i haven't decided yet this place it's a bit like a warehouse at the moment it's like we're like camping uh right let's put the stone in the grinder There we go. Do, 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 do. Where is the salt here? I bet I have more of this. No? I don't want to grind crystals. Okay. Alright. Alright. We'll leave this now. Let's put any food in here for now take steaks for snacks um da -da -da -da. Do -do -do. just dumping stuff anywhere at this point this is how things get chaotic but then i can just pull things into benches using unlock plus so it's kind of nice all right so we got a bow we need a bow to do the dregs we need arrows check we need something to kill a boss or two. We can use daggers and we can use this hammer if we want to. We need a horse for a meat shield slash friendship companionship. Um, we need three skeleton keys. Check. We got those. Um, excellent. We're going to be gathering some skeleton. Uh, we're going to be gathering some skeletons. We're going to be gathering some uh, legendary weapons. Hopefully. Let's put... Can I... Do I want to see what the taxidermy spider looks like? Oh, it's creepy. Put it there to scare the enemies. No. Alright. Um, golem parts in the golem parts box. Let's get going, friends. Okay. Tusks can go in the grinder. Blah, blah, blah. We've got bedrolls. Okay, I don't need a million. We've aggroed someone to the door, I think. Okay, sweet. I think we're good, right? I could probably repair some things. Do I want to take my little short sword? Probably not. Um... So I can, t I can take some, um, I can take some iron with me now because I got a horsey to repair some stuff. But I won't take five hundred. I'll just take a bit in case I decide to. I don't know. So I get into trouble. Okay, 
we'll gather some vines for you on our way, little friend. Okay, we're good. All right, has everyone been to the bathroom? No? Okay, we're buffed as well. Horse is here. Okay. To the dregs. Hello, Miss Nirup. Hello, hello. Um, I've got to notice some of the spears are OP and PvP is a game changer. They do more damage than the base game. That's not good. I'll have, to, I'll have to look at those. I don't have any of the battle pass stuff yet, though. Okay, let's go. To the Drix. We'll go along the river. We'll get some vines from the water. Ooh, stuck the landing. So we're going over there. I'm just going to go down the river so we can harvest some vines for the horse. Do -do -do -do. Have a look at patch notes with the Netflix horses for health being good. Well, we're at level six and this horse has 8,300 HP, so I don't think so. See some fine trees here. Uh, mm, regular, regular. Hmm. That, yeah. Dregs two hours later. All right, all right. Don't be patient. Just playing the game here. There's the vine trees. I don't know. I want to kind of continue. If you could stop shooting me, I'd appreciate it. He got sidetracked by a croc. Go away. Your heart will be eaten. No, it won't. Do you not consent to that? Let's keep going. Buffed javelins if you're in. Yeah, I heard about the javelins being buffed, yeah. I mean, what? Yeah, javelins. I mean, that was, that was on the beta as well, wasn't it? I remember seeing that. Let's keep going. Okay, a little bit of chaos. Ouch! That hurt. Is it a moat over here? Well, me and, me and my mate, the horse. I don't know. We're not thick yet. We're only just met. Give us time. Just getting him some snacks for now. Okay, this is a way to friendship. Ooh. Pokey, pokey, mate. No, no pokey pokey. that little note there it is right if everybody could just go away i would really appreciate that off you go get bored go on leave me alone i'm going to attack my horse look at that damage 
Right, you'll be sorry you ever messed with my horse. Watch your flanks. He's gonna fart in your face. <laughs> so That's right. Son of a gun. Ooh, another taxidermy bird. That's right. Ooh, coins. Sweet. What did we get? An iron mace. Bug soup. I'll take that. Bracelets. Ah shoe bill i kind of want the shoe bill but you know i'm trying not to like hoard <laughs> right let's click on the emote which is show off which is here on the map what is it i5 right there on the beach one horsey wait let me give you your snacks first there you are you're welcome oh there's music Oh, it's so good. Oh, we need more more than this. We don't have enough branches for our friendo. Because thieves, you've got no idea what's meant by that. Who are you meaning? Uh, Buderun. Buderun. Thank you for the follow. Did you say the javelin been buffed? What does this do to the bunch of, bunch of javelin? Bunch of javelin is so bad these days. There's no exclamation mark drops. You'll have a drop down and it'll show you what's in there, what there is. But you need to connect your Twitch and your opponent accounts. Looking for the drop timer. Oh, well the drop timer won't come up from... Exclamation mark drops will only bring up my chat box if I have that set as a command, which I don't. Um, it won't it won't bring up the uh, the timer if the timer isn't there it means you've got it you can go to your your inventory and check mm -hmm. it probably means you've got it already that's what happened to me the, the timer just disappeared you can see it in your twitch inventory mm -hmm. oh i didn't mean to get on the horse yeah buddy i guess we'll keep the, the wood da -dum, da -dum. do you have like a hundred what do you have 159. Ah, that'll do. I got bored of hitting trees. Right, to the dregs, friendos. Driving while not looking at the road. I wouldn't do that. A very responsible horse driver. There it is, wasn't showing. Um, yeah, yeah. So if, it, if the time is gone, right, was it that you had it already? That's probably, that's what happened to me. So I was having to watch my own stream on my phone. Let's do this. Woo Woo. Nope. No, me neither. I wouldn't do that. It's very silly. Very sensible horse rider. Punisher, thank you for the follow. Dun, dun, dun. Do people use the clan emblems? I Yeah, I think so. Chat. Type one in the chat if you use the clan emblems. Or two if you don't. Type three if you're just confused by my question. Type four if you would like a burger right now. <laughs> I would have frozen a <laughs> I don't have any burgers for you. <laughs> don't have any burgers. I think I'm hungry. I'm like, <laughs> can I change my vote to bigger? It's too late, donuts. It's too late. Do you know what's really funny? Is I nearly said if you'd like a donut. Um, 
which is probably because you've been shut in. I was like, why am I thinking about donuts? Donuts are too sweet for me. I'd prefer a burger. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> Type 5 if you'd prefer a pizza. Type 6 if just some fries would do. <laughs> burger giveaway. The giveaway is not for a burger. <laughs> I remember it's maybe used more to RP servers. I think I think people use it because it looks nice. I, I definitely think people on like PvE servers will be using them 100%. You know. Anything we can use to like decorate our stuff or, you know. I think especially people who have like the battle pass and have more choice will be using them. Look, this horse is the most incredible meat shield ever. Hi buddy. I love the hammer. It's such a great weapon. Okay, we'll get some crappy stuff. I don't want to use repair kits, honestly. Oh, cooked human flesh. Oh my god. Exposed. Didn't know they were ca exiles were cannibals, Rendos. Right, let's go. I think this is where my very first ever base was on the on the uh in the game. Ever. First ever. Um, I want it all. I want all the all the stacks and a donut for dessert. Got to look. Just want all the blood crystal weapons. Of the way. Yeah, the blood crystal weapons are really nice. Yeah, definitely. I want it now. That's it. Blood crystal spears on the OP weapons. Is it interesting? Thank you for letting me know. I do want to know if anything's like broken or um, or especially like anything that gives you like an advantage. I always want to know about that because I think they need that fed back. You know. What number for special tummy tomorrow? I might treat myself. I know. That's it. With all the new changes, I take it's not a good idea to put the best gear on them because they will die a lot. Your fighters? Um, it depends who you have. If you have a bearer, if you have like a. Are you a dancer? Yeah. Just I'm just window shopping. I'm not interested. Calm yourself down. Um, if you have like a named bearer or a tier 3 bearer and they have like a ridiculous amount of health you could definitely put the best stuff on and I would do because they could do with a boost of damage you know um, it's reading a phone call for them there where uh, about the, the boost thank you that's good yep good 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 yep try not to hurt the bebbers hi there Right, so we have to fight our way through this dungeon, this camp, NPC camp. We hope, hopefully we're going to come out with some good legendaries. But yeah, you could live here. I know, um, I don't know, at Bliker you were here, weren't you? If you have like a base down here, suddenly you've got like a nice reason to go in the dregs regularly to get your legendaries. The music is so good. Am I going to put a bedroll down? I guess so. as close as I can get. We'll go here. Um, I'll put one there. Yeah, that'll do. Right, horsey is good. Got my bow. Tweet, tweet, tweet. Look at the little sounds. The new river is so wonderful. Um, right, we have to fight our way through here. Um, do, do, do. Surprise, Mother Hubbard. No, Lady Flesh, how dare you? Assuming my gender in 2023. Excuse me. Go 
can make you into a pincushion, lady. That's very nice on you, actually. Thank you for dying. It does make sense that there's a lot of arrows around here because you need them for the dregs. Da -da -da. Do -do. Taxidermied everywhere. Oi! No snacking on the humans. It's weird. Just put them in the blood press. Fluid press. That's acceptable. Sweet. You could be dying, sir. I'm gonna take the arrows, I think. There's a yog cudgel you could pick up here. I don't really have one, I don't care. Check out the box. Mmm. Bed. Yeah. Okay. A simple tent. Cool. Leaving it. Language. Yep. Black Kingdom's language. Uh, twine helpful. Weathered skull. Very nice. Chase my horse in a Benny Hill kind of fashion because it annoys me. Have your soul. Please don't regenerate. Thank you. You're welcome. Nothing we ain't got already. Quality death goggles, yeah. Um, fairer, yeah. Um, I do have a, I do have a fighter video on my YouTube channel. What do you need for the Valheim one? It's just a steam, a steam, steam. What is it called? Your steam number. Yep. 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 Just put it in the. Uh, oh, we'll take that. Man of flesh. Yeah, they definitely should have ha should have this like in a cannibal camp. That makes so much sense. Sounds like sarcasm. It isn't. Um, no, I know we knew that. Okay. Weathered skull. I love that. Can't wait till I can one-shot these guys. I just have no points in agility. I will take your little spell page, my friend. Horsey! hate that when I click somewhere and the horse is like, oh, let me go over there for you. And you're like, no, I'm trying to interact with something. I love the bow. Even though I don't have any points in agility, I really just slept on the old bow situation for such a long time. This is an ancient bow that we got from some person. I don't even know who we got it from. I will shoot you in the knees, sir. Has he got an axe? Is that what that is? Don't you... Don't regenerate! I hate it when you do that! It's selfish. Sweet. Okay. I think we're ready. Let's go. There's a brute here. Let me one hit him. He's so scary! He's so scary! No, 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 please don't drink my blood. I like it. It really just keeps me hydrated. Oh, oh, oh! oh. Judge! Judge! I need an adjudication on this. I need an adjudication on this. I was halfway up to the freaking moon, friendos. 
that was a foul. That was a foul. That's it. It was crazy. That AOE. It was ridiculous. These disgusting cheats. Hacks. He was using hacks, people. Hell of darkness, my friend. Yeah. Right. Can I make a, a wrap? I could try and get a bit of aloe, but I'm too lazy. Let's get a sated buff going. Yeah, don't try and lull me in with this lovely new river music game. Just like I was in, I was safe where I was. I've been robbed. Got your toe, yeah. <laughs> Did like yes. He, he attacked us. So if this was single player, these people would all have re respawned. Horsey! Ah! Horsey! Get away from me! Whoa. We're going to lose aggro. Like pro gamers. Wow. Could got on the horse actually. Whoop. Parkour! <laughs> parkour! Hardcore parkour. No. The way the body. Oh, it's over by the thing. Stop attacking, Amy! Nope. Oh, it's halfway up there! Oh no! No! I've been stuck! I've been stuck! It's been a day of misfortune. <laughs> I'm not bleeding. I try again. I try again. I have hope. I believe... I believe the judges will make the right decision next time. Okay. So a little heal. Get off my horse's butt. He's got nearly 10,000 health already. Sorry, Horsey was born in a carry-on film. Can I interact like part way up? Don't you freaking get me up here, AoE freak. Can I like land on it? Get away from my things, you turds! No! No! <laughs> I don't want to die! I got Berserker, excellent. Have extra armor suddenly. Oh, bull! <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> I didn't even know he was there. I've never seen him before. Okay, if they get distracted by him, I would be really happy. Okay, I'm going for it, people. I'm going for it. I'm going for it. Stay with the horse. Horse best distractor friendo. Got it. I got it. I'm armoured. I'm armoured. I repeat. I am armoured. I'm ready to fight back. Oh, I missed my agility. Don't you pokey pokey. Wait, wait a minute. She's a Darfari. Why is she saying pokey pokey? Does anyone have any idea? Right, let's go over here. I don't want to brew. Let's just fight some normal people. This is chaos. Right, so we've got to sacrifice someone on here in order to... There you go. In order to get down here. My cat, by the way, gets very triggered by that sound. Let's go down the stairs. Get in, horsey! Get in! Get safe! Get in and get safe! Surprise! I know, just when she thought things couldn't get more crazy. Oh, crikey. Right, let's learn Dredger. Dredger teaches us this glowing stick, which you can craft from glowing goop and bone. We're gonna go... Can I not bring my sickle? Well, that was silly, wasn't it? I don't have a sickle with me. Um, let's just get down here. Dive down in here, you can harvest some... Is there a... 
Oh, I kind of had a feeling there would be. What a lovely game. Thank you very much. Right, sickle. Wonderful. I felt like they'd added that. Okay, let's get up again. Wonderful. Use a sickle to harvest plants. Excellent. Horsey's like feeling his best right now. I've got f decor. Sweet. So there we go. We've got a bunch of glowing goop. And now we want to get some bones. You can get bones from defeating these little Komodo friendos. These guys will give you a lot of ichor. They're really good to harvest. They might poison you if you're not careful. So I'm going to use a uh, pick on them to get bones. Ichor. Okay, no bones that time. Uh, I might get bones actually from a box if I go to all the boxes. Wait for me to attack. Come on then. I'm not there, am I? You can have these guys as pets as well, by the way. Okay, am I going to get any bones from you, bud? Bone, there you go. I should really switch to um, hatchet now to get more ichor, but hey ho. Okay, loads of ichor. So now I can make myself this cool torch. And it doesn't weigh much. Let me double check. So I'm going to make a few of those. And just carry them around with me. The nice thing about these is you can use them underwater. They won't make you warmer either. You shouldn't. Okay, sweet. Okay, so we can go to these pools if we want to and see what the loot is. In the chests. No chest in here. I can get more goop, but I don't care. Got lots already. Some chests over here. Can't climb. Uh, snacks, enhanced gruel, raw head bindings is a good drop, spice steak. Okay. Is that, was that like a weight thingy? Oh, I lost my, my, um, strength buff because of my, as we died. I have died more times today in this game than I have died, like, in multiple playthroughs altogether, I would say. Am I right, chat? Generally, I don't die. <laughs> Today has been the day of all deaths. Um, bug soup is just snacks. Okay. Spicy food will warm you up if you get particularly cold. Let's get some ichor. Okay. Doesn't seem to matter what I harvest them with. So I don't know how I'm going to get to that box. I to, like, jump on there, maybe. I don't know. I don't care enough to, like, try for ages. <sighs> yeah, I don't know. Seeps. up with chats um cream is horrible it is horrible definitely um there's you know, how broken mesas are um what a day i know what a day why not just stand on the ground and look up yeah i did but there were like enemies there pc version looks better it does look better but it it does i was on uh, playstation for like 5700 of my hours in this game yeah it does it is nice water looks wet and shiny and see-through armor is wet when it's like raining and things just kind of you know sad um also i think playstation 5 didn't get an upgrade right is that is that the t they didn't upgrade playstation 5 but they did with xbox is that right um 
they have the highest armor pen, they reduce armor. Um, Chaos is a ladder. I used to farm blood crystals, so I knew there was one there. I haven't, it's funny, I haven't run across that one. I don't think so, anyway. You can have snakes as a pet now as well. Yes, you can. Um, you can repair torches and lights and stuff. like NPC spikes have changed a bit. Definitely the purge was tougher. The purge, the certainly level 10 purge is tougher, yeah. Should have given us weapons or armor. Um, yeah, double jump. You're probably right. Double jump would probably get us up there. Probably full of stuffed animals. Yeah, I know, yeah. PlayStation got a patch today. No, no, that's not what I'm asking. I'm asking about um, upgrades to P PlayStation 5 compared to the PS4 version of the game. That's what I mean. Um, yeah, the, the, the drop is a, is a clan banner. Mm -hmm. X looks almost like comp computer that goes to character. Yeah, just closer to character. Yeah, mm -hmm. Yeah. so that is kind of annoying that there's no PS5 upgrade, but I think they had to do that for Games Pass or something, did they? Or oh, that's why they did it. But yeah, that would be really nice, wouldn't it? Um, but because I said you had to stand in the ground look up instead of climbing it. Because I said you had to stand. Uh, yeah, I mean, that's what we did. Yeah, PS5 just handles the game better. It handles the game better than what? Oh, than the PS4. Mm -hmm. Because the SSD and things. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That makes sense. Yeah, it would be lovely to get an upgrade, definitely. Because I would like to do... I was planning to do a PS5 playthrough. Maybe on YouTube or something. Um... I wanted to kind of return, but I, I was expecting it to look better than PS4, and I played, I spent so much time on PS4 Pro. Um, so I don't know. We'll see, we'll see. Ooh, okay, box. We've got some flint arrows we don't really need. Okay. Oop. Da, 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 da. We're in. Let's get our bow ready. Do, do, do. Uh, ancient bow. Did we break it? Nope. It's there. Not much left on it, but it's probably okay. We need to shoot these targets. The water will rise, and then it'll let us get to the next level. It's quite. I quite like this dungeon. I tend to do it, like, once, though. Um, but if I lived around this area, I might, like, redo it just to get to the legendaries. Hello, skelly friendos. I have done some changes. I think these guys appear earlier, don't they? I don't think they I don't think they used to appear this early in the dungeon. Gained a level. 8,000 XP from him. Not doing a huge amount to me. It's a very early dungeon. There we go. Ooh, skeletons drop such good stuff now. Ten grey lotus seeds. That is amazing. Well, it's our glands. They're going to be really, really handy for um, sorcery leveling. Seems to be like an alchemy theme with skeletons nowadays. Oh, we got ash. Seven steel reinforcements. Frost lotus seeds. Crimson lotus and leather. So this is the nice thing about doing this dungeon already at level 32. Have any points to spend? Yes. Um, I'm going to go for Vitality. We're going to try and get up to the Resurgence. A bit more health. Okay. I'm not going to, like, dive and look for, like, boxes and stuff. Um, I'm not trying to be, like, super thorough. Okay, let's shoot that one. So you can't climb in dungeons, obviously, but you can rise up. Out the water. You just hold down space. Maduro blocking me. Thank you for that. Um, 
Let's get these drop. They're so good, yeah. So, so good. Yeah, Grave Lotus Grave is immediately a no. It's awesome. Little law book here. Yeah, Unnamed City is so cool now. I love it. Okay. So I'm gonna like, I'm gonna like casually look for chests when they're kind of on my path and I don't have to swim and really look. Arrows. I mean, I don't need them because I've got a bunch with me, but if you didn't bring a, a bow, then helpful. Okay. Got the water to rise, so we're going to go over here. Oh, Majoru. Go. Bop, 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 bop. Nice. Okay. So do I have to do... I forget. Do I have to do both of them? Shall I run first? Do I... I think I have to do both, right? It's, this is the one little bit that I always forget with this one. Because I do it, like, once every playthrough. So we'll shoot that one first. And we'll go... Oh, no, I have to go this way, don't I? I have to go that way. Or is it either of them? There we go. Um, it's like the other one, there were still chests at bosses, but yeah, we've just duke it. It's going up and down by itself. There's a chest here. We've got a stone golem chest, weathered skulls. Leave the, boat, the rest of it. So I have to shoot this one to get to get that to fill, is it? Normally I just shoot both shoot both of them. Yeah, normally I just shoot both of them and it works, but I've never done that one first before. just shoot all of them once yeah mm -hmm. yeah well I did that's what I did normally I do the first one that one's closest to us and then the one that's like further away there we go okay sweet I hear you skeleton turd wallets Excuse me, mister. So it is quite nice because I used to find fighting skeletons really boring, but now that you get like decent enough loot from them, like wolf pelt for at this stage of the game is kind of handy. I could use my torch if I wanted to. Oh, I got some yellow lotus potion for stamina. Um, so I currently don't have a potion buff. So I'm going to use one of those. Squirrel. Why did it replace my food buff? That's not supposed to happen. Yeah. You're supposed to be able to have one of each. And you can use one of each because I did with agility stuff. That is weird. Hello, friends. I'm just, like, looking around. There's a lot of you. The roll out of that is an oh, because I'm crippled. Okay. I barely have time to attack him. Do 
Should we just run on and see how far he follows? Say cripple and, I, and I'm quite a slow attack. There's a chest. Arrows. Okay. Now we've got to shoot the thing. We're going that way. I'm going to shoot this target. Yep. The water should rise. It's, I think it's the abyssal remnant whispering, isn't it? She's a hot and dead chick. <laughs> yeah, she's very attractive. She's waiting for you, personally. Right, let me have some water if they haven't seen me yet. the poison. <laughs> it's just a very hot lady waiting around the corner, peeps. So I didn't bring the shield, did I? Which I don't generally... Right, let's deal with these skelly friendos first. Oh, speaking of which, the shield! Every time that keeps happening to me. Individually these guys are fine, but I prefer to use an axe. Um, or... Um, what do, I, what do I use generally for skellies? Oh, my two-handed sword. Okay, we got black lotus, brilliant. Gold, leavening agent. Um, I'm not going to take these, although they're full health, which is great. Decorative grindstone. You have to learn otherwise from the Library of Esoteric Artifacts. A lot of weather skulls, which is nice because they're a pain in sorcery. Hi there! That's the hot lady. She's quite a looker. She's still friendless. She's just very excited. I mean, she's just very excited. She's been waiting. It's a bit like a pig, really. Okay, can I get my shield ready? So I don't usually use the shield. Um, I don't have a one-handed weapon, though. Do I have a one-handed weapon? No. So we're going to just avoid, and then um, we're going to use our hammer. Hi there. So you can shoot them as well, but I'm just going to avoid until he does the thing. Budge. So 4,890 health. You're gonna do the thing. Where are you gonna go, bud? Okay. Come on, meat shield. Don't move, Beach Shield. Stop hitting my horse. Right, now he's going to do his thing. Poor oh, horse. I 
It's been good to see you. Hope you've been keeping well. You smell pretty bad. The old place smells pretty bad. Dora doesn't like that. Could you stop? Just like a like a chemical peel, people pay a lot of money for it. It's really good for his complexion. And Dora's like, how much more of this? So we can just move around, or you could use a shield if you want to. We do the shield. Or we could shoot arrows and run around. It's like, she's boring, let me just get, let me get the horse. So I could use this. Really weird noises. Ha! Ha! Surprise. Let's try the running around and shooting thing. Loves that little surprise thing, doesn't he? So close. One more. Yeah. There we go. There we go. First dungeon. Okay. So make sure, make sure you harvest the body. You want the staff of the triumvirate, abyssal eye, abyssal flesh. Um, you want to make sure you click on the book here for the recipes, for the abysmal stuff, although I've never bothered with it before. Here's the three chests. We've got a war spear at the black circle. I'm being reasonably quick because the acid will return. Another one, dueling blade of the hawk. We'll have a look at these in a second. <gasps> My favourite weapon, the Beck de Corbin. Friendos! That is so cool. I got my favourite hammer. <laughs> I love it. Streamer look. Okay. I mean, this is my favourite hammer because it's an agility hammer. So I can spec into agility and my points will count towards this hammer, which is a traditionally a strength weapon. I love that so much. Um, we've got a war spear of the black circle, which is a pike, uh, which does 51 damage, eight percent armor pen. And then we've got a dueling blade of the hawk, which is a strength weapon, 60 damage, 9% armor pen, cripple, and it has a severe debuff. Um, so yeah, nice. Three legendary weapons, including one of my favourites. I love that for me. Very excited. Let's leave that behind. Excellent. Good loot. So cool, right? Let's get out of here. So you can either run back the entire length of the dungeon if you want to. Chat, I have, oh, I forgot about the thing. I forgot about the thing. They added a new, like, chain. Okay. Okay, I lost it. Hold on. They added some new kind of things in the dungeon, so if worth revisiting them. There we go. Do I have enough stamina is the question. Uh, no I don't. If you don't think you have or you're not sure, um, save some. Because uh, otherwise you'll just <laughs> die from the room. Uh, this chest's up there. What do we do? Um, we have a lasting feast somewhere, don't we? Will that? Will that? Will I use less? 
Don't have a huge amount of grit. That gives me grit. It gives me stamina. But it takes away my... I don't think that's going to make any difference, really. I think the lasting feast might have made a bit better difference. just i was like oh oh do i try it i was like well i was like we could just do it i'll just fly up in creative mode and show you what what's up here yep okay so you get to the top better be something here okay further up i came up here on the beta okay we've got some chests better be good loot <laughs> it's, it's not good loot at all it's not really good. Just Dalfari stuff. A hunting bow. Three damage, 5% armor pen. Rough wraps. Dried meat. Weak aloe. Dalfari cudgel. I mean... Nah. Not worth it for this, to be honest. Um, admin mode breaking the immersion. Um, well, I'm probably going to put this onto YouTube, so if I'm sorry if it's breaking your immersion, but I might want to complete it. If I couldn't have gotten up there, then I might have, um, you know, I wanted to show people. Yeah, we haven't fought the other boss yet, actually. I just remembered we skipped the other boss. We ran right past, didn't we? Yeah, I know. Yeah, I know. You might not be serious, but people do come in. They say like things about me doing stuff in admin mode, and I'm like, like even when I'm even when I'm literally making like a good guide, <sighs> you know. So I know you, you you might not be serious, but people do it a lot, so it kind of gets a bit it annoys me eventually. That was so close to death. Yeah, so close. So I guess we run back because I missed a spider. I got distracted. Oh, he's back again. Um, we might be better off TPing to the start because I missed the Spudo. Are we like um, in the middle of like a... What is the word? A love triangle. Are we in a love triangle here? If I go here though, I won't get back to the beginning. I'll just get back to... What do we do, peeps? Let's run back. Sounds like a donkey. I'm just gonna go out and say it. Um, just went fire it. Yeah, that's cool. That's cool. That's cool. I understand. I understand. Um, so let's run back. I might regret this. I'm tempted to like fly. Oh. So the only other boss I've seen in here is a spider. He's saying there's another one. Just gonna run past everybody. There's one in the first water room. I saw the spider, but I haven't seen anything other than that. When I first came here with my friends, we had no idea you could teleport out. It was kind of funny. Would not bother with those. 
The thing is, people aren't so clearly defined into toxic and non-toxic people, as far as I'm concerned. I feel like there's a lot of grey areas. And, like, a lot of people mean well, but then they might, you know... So some people come in and they just, like, well, might just call your names or something, and then you're like, okay, you could just ignore those people. But some people come in and you're like, you know, they're not all bad, but they kind of, you know... I might say something annoying. You know what I mean? In general. I mean, absolutely. Definitely. It's, it's a good rule to, of thumb, you know. I do have, like, a like a general policy about people who are just rude and whatnot. So now we're right back out here. Okay. So let's see where... The spider was off to the right, as I remember. Uh, Dark Will, thank you for the prime. Thank you, thank you. We're doing a movie night on Friday. You don't have to be a sub, but everybody's welcome. Join the Discord if you'd like to come join the movie. Um, will it now rise and fall on its own if I don't do the thing? Let's get rid of these brilliant legendaries. I probably won't worry too much about buffing. Um, yeah. So it does, it does on its own once you've done it the first time. So I just want to get to the spider. do in the water he's like what are you gonna do in the water <laughs> you don't have a space bar buddy it's not that way is it have i gone past it there is a chain there yeah yeah but there's nothing we can do with that chain is there yeah. Yeah. I'm well spotted though. I didn't see it. It's worth mentioning. The Goonies. Yeah, we're going to watch The Goonies. That's right. What movie are you watching? We're going to watch The Goonies. Yeah. Last week we watched June. Um, it's on Prime. Uh, in the UK we can watch it so da, 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 da. Do, do, do. so it's just further on isn't it I just kind of run past everything do, 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 do. come on lady Come on, up you go. There it is. There's a spider. So you're saying there's another boss, a third boss. I'm going to use my daggers. Right. The acid hurts. Bear that in mind. Don't go in the acid. Oops. So I think this is like the spider, um, in visually like the one in Skittering Cavern and in Sipta. But it doesn't drop the Nemedian. Didn't when I defeated it before. Same attack pattern as the other guy that we fight. The very first room. There's a boss in the very first room. You mean where the dredger is? Do you drink any more of the water? Remember, you're in a sewer. I'm not clicking, honestly. <laughs> 
I wasn't clicking. She was just automatically saying cooling down. Not my favourite place to fight a spider. It's a bit like the skittering cavern um, because it's, there's not a lot of space in there either. And if it gets dark in there, oh it's a bit of a nightmare. I like using daggers on these guys. Same with the arena champion, although I like steel feud for her. She's scary. <laughs> Bleed up, that's good. I haven't read the books in this dungeon for such a long time because it's a sewer even though I think it's a kind of cool dungeon I kind of I don't know I don't like it that much I feel like it's like it's in quite a remote, remote location it never used to have very good things um there we go all right let's harvest and uh loot as well let's get the gossamer question mark Oh god, yeah. I, so I really like this, the fact that it's got a load of dead bodies, like dead creatures in it. I think that's kind of cool. Ooh, we got Graceful Knight. So when I fought this guy on the beta, or like admin killed him, um, he dropped rare items. So that's kind of cool. Oh, we got a legendary repair, well, Ma Grandmaster repair kit. Fragment, Graceful Knight. Never seen that weapon before. Legendary, not repairable, obviously. Agility. Oh, it's a katana. <gasps> oh. Oh. Yeah, let's see if we can get a key from him. I guess we'll take this good healing. Um, heads are good. Let's take those so we can make... Um, I don't take carcasses. Carcasses are also really good for blood. Let's see if we can carry them with the horse. We'll see what we can do with our encumbrance. Let's use a hatchet for Ica. Skeleton key. There we go. Okay. So let's sort by weight. No. Carcasses will drop. I'll drop the wood actually. Um if I drop if I leave the wood. Okay. All right. So there's another one at the very entrance. I just never saw it. Um, it's not the katana with 100% no. Mm -mm. 
That's, um, is that Blade of Seven Winds? I forget which one it is. It's either Seven Winds or the other one. I can't remember. see it in 100 hours. It's, I feel like this is a new... I, I've, I have 7,000 hours in this game. I've never seen this weapon before. The one that I just got, yeah. Got it today, pretty good. The seven, is it Seven Winds? Yeah, Seven Winds is 100%, that's it. Yeah. Yep. Yep, yep, yep. So the first water room, are you talking about where the, where the little Komodos are? Stats on the Katana. 64 and 14. Yeah. Bleed everything. So out here, there's a boss out here that I haven't seen. Where? Go left. Aha! A Komodo boss. Ah! Oh. Interesting. I see. Thank you for telling me because I, I've been in here and I haven't seen it. Hmm. Thank you. Deal with the friends first. It's helpful. I need to sneeze. Oh gosh. This is where Valk says um, she sneezed all over her keyboards and I have to tell him I turned my head like, oh, we're gonna never little Komodo him. Am I gonna get stuck in his hitbox? His headbox. This terrain is super annoying for fighting. get my heels in my hot barn. Oh, he's fully, fully he's regened. So it's just basically reskinned croc for this purposes. So he got bored of spinning. So like, would you stand still, woman? <laughs> Sorry, Meat Shield. You said my name is Maduro. No, it's been renamed. I forgot about spider spiders, but I was too busy like yapping and running away from skeletons, I guess. I went to like autopilot because I knew there was a spider in here. I didn't know about this guy. What a janky fight. I mean, I'm glad they've added more bosses. More keys on the way in. I'm stuck in him right now. Actually, he doesn't hit as hard, I don't think. Mind, mind you, no, we're in heavy armor now, aren't we? So he does hit as hard, I guess, is this crocky. Okay, tail whip. Three. Go 
throw it. So that flat nosed Tiberian golden tongue Komodo. It's very specific. Yeah, they need to like change the head hitbox or something. This is just—it's like the rhino, isn't it? The rhino boss can be a real pain. Like it just gets stuck under his head so frequently. Stuck. I hate this fight so much. So annoying. I'm stuck. It's like you see me lagging into him. I get close enough. I guess this this uh, dagger's like it's probably the wrong thing to use. Um, I do have passive regeneration. If you could get stuck there, I would be. Ooh, I didn't even feel feel the damage then. gonna regenerate. If he regenerates, I'm not gonna fight him again. I need to craft some heals. Go for the horse. The horse loves it. The horse loves a good nip. He's gonna- yeah, this is the thing. If he regenerates, I'm gonna be super annoyed. fine. I didn't panic and that was definitely a war cry. This is the last crocodile I ever fight in this game. I know it's a Komodo. I might when I say stuns. What happened? He was- excuse me? He wasn't facing the same direction as me. I got, what did he do? Fart on me or something? Do you have some kind of explosive gas that comes out your butt, dude? What happened? I don't understand. Did you see that? I want loads of ichor out of you. Right, three tail whips. Good time to heal. Oh, I broke my daggers. Okay. I'm a time, friendos. Okay, I'm rolling like a mofo here. I'm stuck in his head. At least it's quicker. I meant that. Scream. That was so frustrating. <laughs> 
lots of wool grades today, I know. Maybe something good to, yeah. Frickin' heck, people. Hate the, hate the fight. I hate that fight. I hate fighting crocodiles. Hardened steel, great axe. 56, no armor pen. Damaged. Damaged? Witchfire, stone consultant. But we'll get a key. We'll get a key from him. Let's get all this ichor we can't carry. Feral flesh, skeleton key. Fangs. He drops he drops the same stuff as a crocodile. I think the game doesn't think he's a Komodo. You know what I mean? Let's go sleep. Okie dokie. See you, Kevin. Have a good night. Yeah, he should have dropped like Ica. Maybe like demon blood or something. That'd be kind of fun. We've certainly leveled up our horse today. Wow, that island lynx. Is it a carcass? Yeah, there's nothing we can do about it. Shubal carcass. I'm just going to drop those. Okay. We live to tell the tale. Um, let's drop that. Let's give you back some vines for food. Let's get the heck out of here, friendos. Thank you for telling me about him because I didn't know he was. I never noticed him. I had no idea he was there. Um, let's get the hell out of Dodge. I have never gone through this. Have I gone through this way before? Must have, originally. Where is Snake Boss? Where is Snake Boss? You mean the Abyssal Remnant? Right, can we run past here? We could get on the horse. Do you mean the Abyssal Remnant to you? We've we defeated that. We should got a key. Yeah, yeah, the Great Axe I won't use. You know, you could put it on a thrall. Um, yeah. The one we got from the spider was better. She killed that one to begin with. Yeah, I did did it in reverse, basically. Yeah. Yeah, we ran through, defeated the Abyssal Remnant, and then ran back out to defeat the spider. And then we went to the beginning and defeated the... Oh, the Komodo. Oh. Peacefully back on the river. We have some wet air. Crikey, that was annoying fights. We, I'm so glad we did it. Oh. Yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. I mean, you could absolutely miss out that boss, really. He's obviously got the same loot table for those unique items that the world bosses have. Um, seems to be random. So you might get, so this hammer that I've got here, I got from the spider boss, this hardened steel hammer, which is brilliant and has worked really well for me. Um, let me think. Yep, go up the river. Let's go defeat this little mini dude and see if he drops us a... Um, some of his armor because he has a chance to we don't need it now but i just want to see if he does thank you oh they're working again the sounds are working squirrel So he should drop, or has a chance to drop, his armour. Not this time. Just some light pieces, yeah. That's kind of sad, because those guys always used to drop it, didn't they? It's like a nice early game thing. 
Some of them do still horribly delayed. Interesting. Sorry about that. So weird. Yeah, like I said, I would have turned them off, but there's so many I have to turn off individually. I don't know how I would do it otherwise. It's so weird, isn't it? But, um... Well, now we have three legendary... Well, four legendary weapons, because we got one from the spider. Sorry. To to our pyramid home home friend. So that's where you learn yog, but we already learned yog from um from like a scroll. So we don't need to go round to the trainers. Um, just Amir and Keto left, apparently. And Zath is what I chose. Oh yeah, let's defeat the... I don't know if we have room for your blood crystal stuff. But it's worth it. How did you hit me while I was rolling? I'm not used to... Um, I guess, the little bits of lag that you get from playing on a server. Just because I'm used to the server being my PC, you know. Okay, we have managed to carry that as well, that's good. Alright, I'm a little horsey. Actually, I'm quite large for my age. We could learn sorcery while we're here. We're about to go past it. Should that one when you killed the croc. Did you? Ah, Very strange. I don't know why it's not working. I'll be back to... Uh, streaming through like regularly. I don't know if it's like a restream thing. I don't know. Shall we do the? Shall we learn sorcery now? Or should we save that? I think we'll. We might save it actually, because I'd rather do it like start sorcery. Um, I feel like it make more make more sense rather than just squish it into this. Screw you, Lady Flesh, how dare you? Sorry, I apologize. Was it me? The horse got angry. Anyway. Have you ever killed the rocks have you ever killed rock slides? Yes. And he's killed some thralls of mine. I hate him. Yes, of course I have. Um, how about you? What is that big giant rock monster that's close to the north area? The yeah, rock side. Mm -hmm. What about him? Uh, hello, Mikey. How are you doing? Welcome. Do 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 do. Yeah, it isn't a, it isn't a fight I would like particularly choose um, because uh, he has a huge AOE. Um, he's um, he's a great one for very very tough thralls with lots of HP to fight, um, and he's also a great one for using better thralls to like command your thralls away if you die. That's one of the reasons why he'll kill your thralls is because you can't get close to them to E on them. Um, to kind of get them following you again and get them out. So. No, I have not. I got one shot by him. He's a world boss. He drops the same things as everybody else. Yeah. Hello, Merton. Hello, hello. Doo -doo 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 -doo. Yeah, the world bosses drop the same stuff. The same loot table. And the, they get the drop legendary uh, skeleton keys. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yep. Yeah, I mean, that's it. Like, I mean, chat, do you have any bosses that you just never fight? Yeah, for me, it always used to be Thunderfoot. Definitely Rock Slide. The, um, the Rock Branch I would fight in Shattered Springs, um, depending on who I had as a thrall with me. Different, at various times, it would have been a Delincia. Um, and now, like, well, in recent times, it would have been, like, a Bearer. 
We've lost the interest of our friendos. Oh, crikey. What a day. Well, we've got a bunch of like really good weapons now, which is awesome. Um, and I did really enjoy doing that dungeon like this early, you know, level 33, which is kind of the level really you were recommended to do it, I would say. Um, we're going to leave it here for today, friendos. Thank you everybody so much for watching. Let's do a quick, let's draw the, uh, let's do the Steam key draw, which is for the complete edition of Conan Exiles. You can do an exclamation mark ticket if you haven't bought a ticket. And I will close the giveaway in 10 seconds. We'll draw a winner. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Closing the giveaway. There we go. Let's draw a winner. Valkyrus! Valkyrus, but how many points did you spend on that? Congratulations, Valk! Well done, lovely. 57% chance of winning. Oh, it pays to watch, doesn't it? <laughs> Thank you so much for entering. I will uh, whisper you here um, on Twitch your key. Thank you everybody for like participating. I have more keys to give away. We'll be giving away um, soon. Um, I'm going to be back uh, here on Twitch tomorrow, uh, Friday, uh, with some more code next hour. So do come back and join us. Follow if you haven't followed. Check out the YouTube channel, which is actually linked in the um, just above the chat. That purge video is one of my latest videos. And uh, yeah, thank you all so much. Thank you for the follows, the bits, the subs, the gifted subs, everything, all the support, all the advice and guidance and, you know, everything. Appreciate you guys. Join us on Discord on Friday. Uh, we're going to watch a movie. We're going to watch Goonies together. If you want to watch that with us, you, anybody's, everybody's welcome. So, yeah, uh, the socials are linked in the chat. You have 3,000 tickets, Pika. Your time will come. Your time will come. We'll have more have more Steam keys. So thank you, everybody, so much. And thanks to Funcom for the Steam keys. I appreciate them. All right, then. See you guys.